Clicking and clicking and clicking and waiting for this thing to prepare. There we go. We're preparing to stream live on YouTube. Now we're we go. We go. Now we're heading over there. All right, we got that going on. Go over here, do that. Get in here and do that. There, turn that on. Yeah, buddy. I'm going to put a thumbnail on this puppy. Uh, uh, uh. Come on, come on, all right, looks like we got it, clicky that button, mm -hmm. all right, close that, refresh this, who we got, who we got, we got Tiffany, Jose, what up Jose? Tiffany, good to see you. How you doing? Thanks for thanks for coming over bright and early. Let me. Yeah, huh? Well, uh, yeah. That one and that one. Go uh, no. here first. Send out a couple emails. Oh, yeah, it'd be nice if you copy the link first, you may. Got that. Copy that. There we go. Mm -hmm. Bada bing. Yeah. Oh. Well, actually, I have to go back and check that out. Uh-huh. Disarray, what up? Infinite moi. Good to see you, buddy. You doing good, Tiffany? That's awesome. Awesome, awesome. All right. Emails have been sent. Oh, fuck it. Yeah, it's a waste, but we'll send it anyway. All right. That one's gone. Oh, he might be. Oh. 
probably not, but we'll send it just to keep them on the way in the link in the loop rather. Hmm. All right. Oh, how we doing over here? Just uh, do, 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 disarray. Hey, Jimmy. Hey. What up, Wood Air? Good to see you. How you doing? Uh, I'm pretty good. There you go. Nine Cali beer. What up, my man? All right, let's go over here to. F book. Send out my links over there now. Did you do anything good today? No, just working. You finally move all them logs? Almost. <laughs> Almost. A uh, Tiffany. I hear you say he's doing gardening today. Gardening. Uh not that I think of. <laughs> I don't know. What was I doing? Hi uh, Joe. I had a bunch of I had a bunch of crap to do today though. Yeah. But that the wife <clears throat> <clears throat> the wife reminded me of uh, at nine o'clock this morning when I was laying down to go to bed. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Uh huh. When I looked at her, and I was like, "Well, I need a coffee." <laughs> uh huh. That's why the show is so late. Like, uh huh. I had, I had things to do. That meant I didn't get any dang sleep. Josie. Joseph Wu. Joe Wu. Oh, are we keeping you up, Joe Wu? I know it's late over there. All 1030 and all. Um, yeah, go fishing and send one there. All right, we'll run with that and see what's happen, how it goes. If anyone comes in and needs one, I'll send it. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Oh, Woody, I got to send you the the uh, the updated picture for that. Where's your... Where are you? Right there. The surf sold that car in. Oh, yeah, he's got the Mustang in there now. Yeah. I mean, I got a, I got a quick one of it. Lady C, what's up, girl? On my walk today, I saw five squirrels and lots of birds. Heck yeah. Five squirrels, that's kind of on the minimum, ain't it? I don't think he was paying attention enough. <laughs> those, those things are everywhere.
Heck, I think I got five of them in my my yard alone. <laughs> oh, there! I think I sent you a link, go there. Let me double check. Oh yeah. She had to do the honeydews this, this morning, huh? Kind of. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> had a yeah. doctor's appointment. Oh, that, I, yeah. that I thought was the wives. <laughs> so like, uh huh. Oh, yeah. All these crazy bitches. I'm not at home at the moment, so I'm chilling. There you go. Chilling like a villain. Chicken burger at McDonald's come up when I get back. A chicken burger. It's not a chicken burger. It's a chicken patty. Chicken yes. breast. You know, freaking. It's... it's, it's. <laughs> I like those chicken sandwiches from Wendy's. They're pretty good. Uh-huh. I'm a big fan of the original chicken sandwich at Burger King. Oh. Mm -hmm. Best bang for the buck, always made fresh. And usually comes out piping hot. Because <laughs> they put that sucker in the oil, you know? Uh -huh. Usually takes a couple of minutes, you know. But hey, uh, we 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 don't mind waiting for fresh fresh food, right? It ain't a fucking chicken burger. <laughs> it's not ground up and freaking. Besides, <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> oh yeah they just you got y'all just talk different in australia that's all yeah we went to the dark to the day though and then we walked around wally world freaking i've been been meaning to get a bottle of freaking uh Spray on adhesive for like ever, and I always forget about it when I when we go in there because like, yeah. You know, what are you using that for? Well, for one, to to glue the insole back in my shoe so it doesn't come out every time I take my foot shoes off. Oh yeah, that gets annoying, you know. Oh yeah, <laughs> and uh, I bought some um, sound. Uh, Soundboard, sound suppressing things, tiles to put on the wall. Yeah, I remember you were talking about that. Yeah, and and I kind of just, I just stuck them all like they were like a one wall type thing, instead of mix and match type of you know, and I just want them to lay out differently. Freaking, because I think I want to do the whole wall with them, but um, you know, I yeah. want to play. I want to see how hard they are to um. 
to cut to fit, you know, because mm. uh, I get angled walls and whatnot and mm. to work around the outlets. So I'm going to peel one off and, or a couple off and try and work around this electric crap I got down here. And if it's not too shabby, which I forgot to bring a razor up here, a new razor anyway, if I can. And yeah, if it's not too shabby, I think I'll buy buy some more and actually finish that whole wall right there, you know? I'll put some of those on a ceiling once. They're not just, a bad uh, idea. They're just an acoustic little 12 by 12 panel. Yeah, just, yeah, that's exactly yeah. what they are. Yeah, different designs on them, but you can get them, I guess. I like that idea, actually. They look better than the 12 by 12s that are up there now. <laughs> or at least, well, not in this, in this room, but downstairs. Yeah. That's every, that's every room downstairs freaking has those fucking things. I hate them. They're the cardboard ones, you know, freaking, or made with paper mache type freaking crap. You could probably <laughs> expose your ceilings down there and really look good. Yeah. You might even have a hardwood ceiling. You never know. Um, maybe in the living room, the kitchen. Push a couple of them out and look up in there, you know? <laughs> yeah, let's just say I have a, I didn't want to open that can of worms until <laughs> until I was ready to play with it. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. <laughs> right, but the, uh, the, 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 the bathroom in the bedroom down there, though, that, that was built in the 70s, so I think they just used those freaking cardboard tiles. There's already a piece. There's a, there's a, it, you know, they, they're ugly anyways, but like the laundry room, it's it's hanging, you know, because mm -hmm. freaking there once, once upon a time a tree went through that roof. Oh. Uh, so that's probably why it's hanging. Never mind the fact that it's the laundry room, so it gets hot as fuck in there. You know, with the you know the temperature change is always you know what I mean. It's always up and down in there with the uh, fucking dryer yeah. in there too. You know, freaking so. I'm thinking that's why that's hanging, and it's just gonna be you know I'm gonna have to just go boom, and it's all gonna come down. <laughs> yeah. Well, or ninety percent of it's gonna come down anyways. <laughs> um. Yeah, freaking. I don't. I don't. I don't know. I'm I'm pretty sure they don't have much over that. Might be drywall over it, but you know, under it rather. Yeah. And at that, I'd be happy with that over those stupid tiles. <laughs> yeah. Might gain you a couple feet of headroom. <laughs> I, I mean, I don't know if you need it or not, but it might be pretty cool. Not 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 down there. Down there's okay. In here's a little it's a little small in here. <laughs> A little small in here. Well, that's freaking. We have to do the addition that I want. Freaking, I, I'm bumping this out. <laughs> do the Dahmer thing, you know. Mm. Dave's not here, man. What up, Dave? Good to see you. Look, Seth is down there smoking weed. Come on, Seth. Seth, just just so you know, when you're right smoking. You don't need to use the letter E, okay? It's K-I-N-G. <laughs> like Smoke King. <laughs> okay? <laughs> Uncle, sir. Get out of my freaking garage. <laughs> I ain't in your garage. Could be just as quick though. <laughs> Click the link. <laughs> My grandma's birthday cake is going to have orange frosting. Ooh. Uh, that's different. Orange flavored frosting. Uh, at least I hope it's orange flavored. I mean, I wouldn't want orange colored freaking frosting that was just like sugary, you know what I mean? Put some fucking flavor in that shit. I got beer, booze, and buds. Link me. I sent it already, man. 
I sent the email already. Let me double check, make sure it went through. Give me a little bite to eat there. I'm going to be on the old mute. Button. All righty. It says I sent it, Uncle. It says I sent it already. I'll send you another one just to be on the safe side. This one, it's got no... No description. <laughs> uh huh. So it's been recent. Uh huh. Uh huh. Luke, dude, what up, my man? Oh, we got a weather report. A weather, weather what? Oh, someone fired up the Nightbot weather report. For Jamestown, conditions are mostly cloudy with temperatures at, of 19 degrees. Uh -huh. Wind is blowing from the northwest at 17 mile an hour with current humidity at 65%. Hell yeah. Cold as fuck. <laughs> Weighing out today, man. Freaking walking, walking from the leaving Walmart, right? Leaving, you know, we were only, we were only like three rows past the handicapped parking, right? Freaking, and we only had like one bag of stuff and the dog food, right? By the time. I put that away, pushed the cart in the freaking corral. We were, we My were, hands were frost, frozen. I was like, oh, <laughs> I should have wore gloves. <laughs> All right, put a hat on. <clears throat> Just like that. <laughs> How you been? How you doing, man? You oh, doing? fuck. I got a call from my buddy. He sold his storage freaking complex. So I got to get fucking vehicles out of it. Oh. I got a month. I got till the end of the month. But oh. I've never had to, I've never had to pay him. Yeah, yeah. I understand. <laughs> and so you don't want to pay the new guy. <laughs> oh, hell no. I'll build a I'll build another fucking building. Yeah, huh? I hear you. <laughs> How do you know it was a damn Mustang? I could be throwing you for a loop. <laughs> I'm gonna start. Be. Fuck, I'm gonna start fucking with y'all. <laughs> <laughs> don't hate your uncle, sir, for his choices of fucking vehicles. God damn it! No. Don't let don't let freaking California get to you. Come on, man. Damn. Remember, he lives in Cali. He's, you know, he's a special kind of stupid. <laughs> no shit. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, a car cover with the bumper stickers of the 50 states. Fuck that. I ain't putting shit on this thing. When I first got that cover, they said, oh, yeah, you got to cut a hole out of it for the antenna. And I was like, I ain't, no, no, not for what I paid for that fucker. I got, 
went over with a little wrench, took my antenna off. <laughs> uh -huh. Fucking cut a hole. Yeah. Even. How about you guys sew a hole in it? You know? Mm -hmm. They send this little patch. So you cut a hole and you put your antenna through that. And now mm -hmm. shit's going to get in there. So fuck them. Sometimes right. the simplest solutions are right in front of a stoner. Right. A twin turbo K member for that. Oh, it needs to go faster, does it? <laughs> no. It goes plenty fast. All right. What am I, what am I missing? What the fuck, Mike's in there? Oh, I see the Royals now. What's up, Lisa? Lisa's in the house. Mm -hmm. Oh, fuck. And what the fuck, Mike? See you. If I had a Mustang, I wouldn't want anyone to see it either. Uh, it's not a Rustang yet. Come no, on. it's not. No. <laughs> no. See, it gets, it's done like that every night. Every day, it sits under a fucking cover. It don't get rust. None of my shit's rusty. Most of my shit's from California. It don't get rusty in California. As long as that cover's breathable, man. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's even got the uh, sheepskin on the inside of the cover. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, she breathes. It's all good. It's all good. Don't worry. Mm -hmm. Ooh, I got a beer. In the well, I've just seen. I've seen what a tarp can do to a car, you know, because it doesn't uh, doesn't release the moisture. <laughs> this is not a tarp. I know. <laughs> and if I told you what I paid for but, it, if I told you what, what I paid for that fucker, you'd think I was stupid. You know what I'm saying, though. <laughs> Yeah, I know, but no, I got. <laughs> I don't use parachutes. I don't use bed sheets. <laughs> I don't use tarpaulins. Hey, you know what I got today? What'd you get? A fresh bottle of Four Roses. Oh, you fucker. <laughs> God, and you slept all fucking day, didn't you? I had to, man. I, was oh, up. My... I didn't sleep all day. I didn't lay down to fucking... What was it? Three thirty. Fuck. What were you doing? I had a doctor's appointment, and then we went to Wally World. No, oh, fuck Wally we went, World. Then we went to the freaking shoe store. Then we went to lunch. Oh, got to take the wife to a doctor's appointment tomorrow. And the bad thing is, the donut shop closes at one o'clock, and that's her fucking time for appointment. Well. That just means you got to leave earlier, right? I don't think the doctor will appreciate it if I walk in. He's my heart doctor. <laughs> She's going to see my heart doctor. You don't have to go in with the fucking donut, man. Why? They're <laughs> you, fresh. I'm just saying you don't have to. I don't. No, I don't have to breathe, but it's a nice thing to do. <laughs> just, just eat some of the minis before you go in there, and you'll be happy. It did, no, no, a box of hots. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> the YouTube wall. What's up, Stacy? Good to see you, Gavin. Good to see you. I'm going to get a beer. Oh, mm -hmm. fuck. Start drinking. Now. God damn, 10 o'clock at night, and you got me start drinking. Hey, man. Uh, next thing I'm going to do is smoke a cigarette. Is, they don't call it a nightcap for nothing. <laughs> fuck. All right. One. <laughs> One after the other. <laughs> uh-huh. Come on, man. The wall with the five dollar Tanaka stands. Woohoo. 
for you. We'll we'll take an we'll have an extra one just for that, Stacy Morgan. Woohoo! Cheers, my brother. Well, fresh four roses. Fine, fine. Is this whiskey or bourbon? I think it's bourbon. Oh, Kentucky, straight Kentucky bourbon. Yeah, huh? Good star. Notice I didn't even need to chase it. Like, ah, yeah. Uh huh. After 5 p.m., there's fair game here for. Starting drinking. Well, you know, that's just a that's just an old wives' tale, you know, freaking Yeah. You know, it's it's never a bad time to start day drinking, okay? Damn, a five Ooh. Right? Nice. I think it's gonna take a while to get used to not seeing my actual name. What? What what what? Oh, freaking, uh, well, you got the other channel, too, don't you, Stacey? Don't you still have the one with your name on it? Or did you, what, huh? Clint Brook, what up, Clint? Let me, uh, at any rate, freaking the wall. <laughs> Be the wall, yeah, okay, I'm subscribed. You were there when you were born, but you don't remember being there. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Was your mom there? I'm teased. Uh, Just relax. I don't know. God, that's good beer. Oh. I like that. Oh, okay, you did change the whole name over here. All right. All right. Well. Won't smoke a cigarette, but I hope smoke you pot. managed to get some sleep. Yeah, I did, Clint. I did. I slept. Oh, geez, what I get? What I get? I got about five hours sleep, so feel revived. I had a good uh, 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 dinner there. The wife made a uh, a pork roast. So I made sure I got me a bowl of it. You see, what kind of bridge? idiot? What that kind of idiot it? drives a boat in the ocean? Brings it into the river and doesn't know how high the bridge is. Well, you know, he must have been smoking something. I I saw I didn't see the video yet, but I but I heard I heard about it. <laughs> you heard about it? Yeah. All right. I, I didn't see it yet though. <laughs> We're all fucked. We're all gonna die. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he killed the bunch They're still of people? pulling. They're still looking for people. Oh, damn. Huh. What was that? Uh, 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 people driving freaking? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Bridge was open. Yeah. Man. That's why we can't have nice things in America. Well, yeah. And if you haven't paid for it, you don't care if it gets broke. Thought they had, I thought they had tug, tugboats for to avoid that shit. <laughs> and he's going up river. So he's coming in. That, he didn't yeah. need it. He had depth under the keel. Mm. And P. Diddy got a rated. Yeah, P. Diddy. Yeah, saw that too. They seized his private jet. Mm hmm For uh freaking what was it? Sex trafficking. <laughs> Man, there's some sick people in this world. You can have all the money in the world and still be a douche nozzle. Yeah. Fuck. Our problems. Hell of a time to start a power problem, make it all the way across the Atlantic. I'm teasing. Mm -hmm. I shouldn't tease. Lives are lost. But I ain't going to speculate on it until they release more information. 
But me being me, I'm highly suspicious of a foreign flag vessel. Uh, oh, he ain't even from here? Oh, huh? the dude wasn't even from here? No, it was a container ship. They're bringing in containers from across the fucking well, water. Oh, you know, I didn't. Oh, well, that whole thing was full of traffic. Ooh. Ooh. Wow. Well, even though he flees the country, it doesn't make him look guilty as hell. You go on a run. Oh, he fled? You got you got all that money to to pay for the best freaking legal minds in the world, and you're gonna take off and run. You guilty biatch. Oh, that looks that looks so much like freaking he did it on purpose. <laughs> you think? He, he got straight from off. Pier. He went straight to the pier, for Christ's sake. He didn't. Oh, um, you were being sarcastic? <laughs> no, I would say that. Best Baltimore engineers. I, I would say that's sabotage, <laughs> man. I wouldn't say it. Don't trust a foreign flag vessel. I'm, I'm don't have the same that. standards as we do. Yeah, man. Well, I man, that thing was built a long time ago, man. And I don't even know. Say, let's just say um, those are, uh, I mean, those, those, the piers that they set that thing on are pretty, are pretty fucking strong, but I'm pretty sure they're not meant to uh, take a hit like that. No, mm -hmm. no. Oh, that's good. Yeah, Hard to make yeah. bridge boat proof. Oh, you can you can make it boat proof, but container ship proof? That's a different story. <laughs> that's a different story. You'd have that fucking, you know, a you know, something. Oh yeah, mm. I don't know. Cheers. Well, oh, hell, hey. it's just, you just you and me. What Get back that? here, Woody. God damn it, Woody. Go into your garage. Stay out of mine this time. I ain't got room for you. Oof, I love that. That's some good bourbon, man. Old ass bridge. Most of the bridges are old ass, Mike. Yeah. Look at the one that fell in Minneapolis. Mm -hmm. That fucker just, nobody hit it. It just fucking went, boom. Right. Our infrastructure is old as shit. We got up? World War II vets that are younger than some of this stuff out there that we're going yeah, on. Yeah, but most of our shit, most of the big shit was made after World War II. Yeah, that's still a long time ago. 70s fucking years. Jesus. Yeah, I know. And that's, what was it, Mike? Mm -hmm. uh, God, damn well, the deal changed concrete. after they let, the, let loose the atomic fucking bombs. The steel changed. Ah, the pre-war steel was fucking pre-war weapons, pre-war steel, yeah. pre-war metal. That was some good shit. Yeah. Uh huh. After the war. Yeah, because yeah, they they mix it different nowadays. Mm -hmm. huh. Took the wife grocery shopping today. Is it named after Francis Scott Key. Who wrote the Star Spangled Banner? Yeah, he did. Who's named after him? Was the bridge, bridge is named, named after. after uh, bridge is named after. It's Francis Scott Key Bridge, uh, Memorial Bridge. Ah. Uh, it was started in '72. What's that? The bridge? Yeah, Mike's uh, Mike's doing a Google thing, Google Hammer, showing all these other slackers how to do it. Mm-hmm. Well, that concrete was aged out anyway. <laughs> no, don't talk about concrete. Got 50 bags of fucking Portland to bring in tomorrow. Woohoo, that'll wake you up. Yeah, fuck. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, it ain't it ain't old. That's for it's sure. Old but, in Pittsburgh, but concrete too. concrete starts going the, the other way at fifty. So you know. <laughs> oh, tell that to the Roman goddamn aqueducts. <laughs> well, and the Colosseum. We use different concrete than they use. Yeah, no shit. They use seawater. That they ain't that old. Okay. It ain't and that, that old. Coliseum's crumbling too. So, <laughs> hey, look at you after 50 some years. Oh, I'm crumbling. <laughs> oh, shit. That's been around for a lot longer than 50. Yeah. So, 50, 50 years old for a steel bridge and salty water. Yeah. Uh huh. Especially the concrete, man. There. But still, that freaking, <laughs> that's some fucking. Uh, pardon. Mm -hmm. That's some heavy duty shit freaking crashing on that bridge. Mm. Ooh, this, no, I can't be a long night. I got to get up and fucking take the wife to the doctor. Okay. Let me just sit here and smoke some power. Oh. It's coming out of the store. Some guy was smoking a cigarette five feet from me. Uh-huh. Exhaled it right my way. It was like, oh, dang. mother fucker. Ooh. <laughs> Lady C, what's going on? Doctor was impressed with me today. Yeah. You know, I had freaking actually gone freaking 26 days without a smoke. I told you. It's Zen for the win, baby. Yeah. yeah no. But I have been double stacking lately. What? Yeah, I've been doing two at a time. Oh, damn. That old evil tobacco's trying to get me to break, and I ain't gonna do it. <laughs> I am working on it, night bot. Come on. It's fucking Seth that's hogging all the damn weed. Yup. There's always high. That he is. I wonder if that fucker even leaves the house. He was working remote, wasn't yeah. he? He Seth? ain't got to leave the fucking house. You fucking Seth, stoner. Seth don't work. Damn. I thought he had a fucking work from home gig. No. Who the hell's working from home that I know? Salty Nana. What up, Nana? Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Whatever it takes to get through the day. Uh-huh, Kane, simple. Yeah. Kane's in here. Oh, Jesus. Hey, who did, did you throwing the terms around there pretty freely there, pal? Mm -hmm. For somebody that never shows up to the ball. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. We know Kane's the true slacker. You'd cover it up to you wish you owned it, motherfucker. Mm. I'm teasing. Hey, you gotta take care of your shit, damn it. Uh -huh. If you don't, it ends up turning into crap. Uh-huh. Fuck six. <laughs> well, pride and ownership, something like that. Sometimes. Yeah, I should clean my garage, show some pride and ownership. I'm working on it. I'm going to the lumber yard tomorrow to get shelving stuff. I want to get everything fucking put up off. I'm going through this whole fucking thing. <laughs> what, what, Lady C, what are you giving me a congrats for? Oh, the, the smoking. All right, never mind. That was you? What do you mean that was you? Huh? What? 
I don't know. She says, that was me, Uncle Sir. Who? Lady C. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I got no idea. It's too hard to figure out. <laughs> Oh, here goes a love fest between. I'm, I'm watching. Here goes a love playing. fest between Mike and fucking Kane. They're going to tell each yeah. other how great they are. Uh, uh, Partners. Doing your diamond art painting. We don't. That's all right. No, diamond no, art. That's painting. all good. Yeah, they. You ever see that? They pick little pebbles and put them in little holes. And, it's fucking mind drain. You know. You're proof of what? Jimmy C, I'm proof of you, man. What? Huh? And Kane, start speaking fucking English. Oh, or speech. proud of me. Oh, okay. Uh-huh. And nimble fingers. Fucking fat fingers. No oh, shit. <laughs> Sausage fucking links. Uh, uh, maybe the fact that he's stoned. <laughs> yeah, well, maybe. Mm -hmm. Well, hello, y'all. Well, Hi. hello, Lady C. Nice of you to join us. How you doing? Uh huh. I'm it's not a lot better you, now. Jimmy, it's not how you doing when you're talking to somebody from Texas. It's how y'all doing. <laughs> well, okay, you're talking to me. Remember that. It's single. <laughs> I was talking to Jimmy. <laughs> I know. Y'all is, right. is for everybody. <laughs> yeah. You know. <laughs> Singular. And just so you know, and I don't never do this, but I'm going to protect Kane for once. It was me that said whatever it takes to get through the day, not Kane. Oh, okay. Mm. Just to let Uncle Turf know and he tried to jump oh, down Kane. Oh, is that why, you, that why you came in here to clarify <laughs> uh -huh. the situation? Yes, I sure did. Damn. <laughs> and Kane, you know, I don't ever defend you because you're a scary ass, but I'm doing it this one time, so you better be appreciative. <laughs> uh -huh. Yes, sir. Freaking. Well, I feel wall. better for that now. <laughs> Almost a month. Ain't yeah. easy. I ain't even hit the vape. Ain't much left in it. I've been kind of freaking nursing the fuck out of the bottom of that thing. <laughs> well, all I'm going to say is congrats to you, because I can't do it. Well, it wasn't easy, but you know. It's some zen. You to do it. You're gonna stop. Okay, you know me. You know it's me cheaper. well enough to know I ain't doing no zen. I ain't doing none of that extra. My nerves are too bad. Cigarettes is the only thing to make me not go psycho. It's the nicotine that's not making you go psycho. This is pure nicotine. Uh-huh. I'm not saying that nicotine is making me go psycho. The nicotine is keeping me from going psycho. That's Big why difference. you use Zen. You get straight uh -huh. fucking nicotine. You don't get any tobacco. Yep. You don't get any chemicals. You don't get any bullshit. It's, yeah, straight, it's nicotine. straight nicotine. Yep. Uncle Sir, how long have you known me? <laughs> hey. See, this is where we're going to take the conversation to old people, isn't it? Because of memories. No. No. <laughs> no. This ain't got nothing to do with that. See, how long there, there, you okay, me? but you don't ask people. How long? I, I said, how long have you known me? I didn't ask you how old you were. I said, how long have you known me? Clean your ears out. So if I can't remember, what's that mean? It means you, you know me well enough that I don't do nothing me. anybody tells me to do. Uh, well, I, I'm not telling you, sweetheart. I'm, there's I'm a reason why Jimmy a calls us. Yeah. There's, a reason why Jimmy, there's a reason why Jimmy calls us crazy bitches. He knows us pretty well. Yeah, I'm just saying. Like, crazy bitches. I'm a crazy bitch. I got a redhead. What do you got on top of a redhead? Oh, oh, trust me, she should have been red. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what mm -hmm. non-redheads say. I should have been redhead. Oh. Well, better than a blonde. <laughs> well, I'm just saying. A Brillo pad's better than a I, I didn't mean that, ladies. Hey, <laughs> yeah, watch it. <laughs> just, never mind. I come oh. from a blonde family. And my my sister is one of the biggest. She's a Kamala Harris in blonde fucking oh fuck my sister. Both right, of my right. parents were blonde and I came out brown headed. So what does that fucking yeah. tell you? I uh -huh. mailman, yeah. mailman, postman, yeah. car mechanic. No, uh -huh. nope, nope. I'm paper, just different. Paper boy. 
<laughs> I, yeah, was, I was cut from a different cloth. Yeah, I was made bit. unique for a reason. <laughs> and we, hold on. We got, we got boiling Diet Coke. That ought to be nasty, but boiling welcome that. to the show. Uh, <laughs> yeah, Zappa. welcome to group therapy. <laughs> Zappa couldn't stand the zin. Yeah, it's, it takes a little getting used to, but I like I've 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 told I told the wife today I want some more of that coffee, the coffee oh. flavored one. I like I enjoyed that one. Freaking, oh my god! I'm telling you, I like it. There's different flavors. Sir. I know there's I, different flavors, but I don't want to get hooked on the fuckers. I want to use these to get off the cigarettes and be off the cigarettes for good, and then dump this shit. Yeah, I'm working. Okay, on, then make on donuts, Uncle too. Sir, if like but you planned on. You're going the other way. You had to fucking go to donuts, didn't you? You brought up coffee. <laughs> Shit. Okay. So he uh, didn't yeah, bring yeah, up sir, coffee. Sir, he brought you're up the one coffee flavored zin. That's not and you're, but you're, who, you're the one that's doubling up on him now, though. Freaking and you, you said wanna... I don't want to get addicted to a flavor. And now you're doubling okay. up on him. Come on, man. And who's the I guy that talked about coming out with a coffee donut shop? Right? Uh -huh. Instead of smoking a cigarette, I took two Zins. Okay. Well, this is my group therapy. Remember that. This is our group therapy. Remember that. Uh huh. Yeah. We tell you the mm -hmm. shit you don't exactly want to know. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh -huh. What? I, I used the <laughs> own nicotine patch. Where the fuck that go? They worked much better. All right. There you go. And we oh we got exactly we got another one from Be the Wall also known as Stacy Morgan, woohoo! Jimmy Ooh. C, if you can go another twenty eight days, I will attempt to quit smoking myself. Keep it up, man. All right, Stacy, game on, man. Freaking game on, freaking. All you gotta do, wanna I, quit? Oh, and well, Zin, and you'll stop smoking. I I I smoke two packs of cigarettes a day for. 50 fucking years sometimes three and four packs when days ran long i quit in one day with these fuckers and i've gone to... through all that chantix and the fucking patches i'd have chantix in the system patches on fucking uh -huh. both shoulders down on my thighs uh -huh. smoking a cigarette but you know what the difference is is you actually wanted to quit this time oh yeah that's, 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 how many the times i've me. tried to quit but deep down, we all know it's you, you gotta want it. You gotta. Oh, it uh -huh. yeah. mm -hmm. And right now, I don't want it. Right now, this is the only mm -hmm. thing keeps me from committing murder. So <laughs> sometimes murder is a good thing. Not with what I'm trying to do. No. Well, no, not murder. I shouldn't say murder. I should just say whacking people. Mm. So, oh, hey, uh, no, I'm I'm saying murder because that's what the fuck I mean. <laughs> Hold on, creepy Rob. YouTube didn't give me a strike, but disabled my ability to go live. Hopefully that's temporary because I was streaming earlier today and in the stream, someone was apparently using a gun or promoting it. What? Mm. Mm. Wait that's, a minute. That's, you got to be sketchy about the uh, the way you, the way guns are used in a stream, without a doubt. Uh -huh. Number eight on patch lasted me over an hour. I didn't ever like the oh pouch right pouch sorry oh, yeah, yeah. I right. mean, an hour they still working after an hour yeah uh, I yeah I can't do five, I yeah. wanted to do the, I wanted to try the chan text but they wouldn't let me because they said it would fuck with my bipolar so yeah we ain't trying to make me angrier than I already am Rez you got a link Rez come on up what's up Rez. Uh -huh. Being yeah, scolded. We're being scolded by Lady C. I'm not scolding nobody. I'm just speaking my truth. Thank you very much. There's a uh -huh. difference. Mm -hmm. Jimmy allows uh -huh. me to do so until he cuts me off and tells me to shut the fuck up. I can speak my mind. Thank you. <laughs> by all means. Yeah, man. Take that hole deeper. No, I mean, just say what's on your mind. I'm going to speak my mind while I got the chance. Well, the, there you go. Media words that you use will never offend me because they're really words. I know that this there's a reason why I call you my YouTube father. Dad. Hello, I know. And you know what? You know what, Rob? Freaking, um, you know, freaking what do they call that? Appeal it, appeal that dude because freaking 
If it's just sitting there, there's nothing wrong with that. I mean, I have shooting videos that yeah. are that are monetized, okay, because they were they were being used in a safe manner. They weren't. I wasn't teaching anyone how to use them. I wasn't teaching anyone how to fucking take them apart, you know, and that it, or build one. And that's where they That's what their freaking guidelines said. You can't teach people how to build them or fucking service them or or alter them, you know. And in in all any anytime you use them, they have to be used in a safe environment. Mm -hmm. I, mean, I have monetized. I have monetized videos of gun use. <laughs> and I have a question. Yeah. I'm asking for a friend. Uh -huh. yeah. Um, male or female? You, <laughs> that's not important. Just know it's another YouTuber. Okay, uh -huh. that's all okay. I'm going to say. Okay. Um, because they are 420 friendly, and they do mark all their uh, live streams 18 and older. Is YouTube making people use hashtags to clarify so that they don't get strikes or bans or anything no you just do the age restriction yeah okay she wanted to know so yeah. i was just asking. Yeah. age restricted yeah and age she's restricted. in a and she's in a legal state but the yeah. other day she tried to go live and she got banned because um a piece of paraphernalia was sitting in the screen and they try to give her a strike they gave her a strike mm -hmm. oh it's, uh yeah you can't promote the uh you can't. You got to read the. You got to read the guidelines. You can't. You know, there's there's things you can and can't do with it. Freaking. That's why well, I keep it on the low profile up here. Yeah, people can smoke, but they. You know, I don't highlight them. We don't. You're not supposed right. to make it look don't promote it. enjoyable and this. Yeah, you. Yeah, you can't. You can't promote the freaking. Yeah. You know, don't try this at home and don't do what I do. Yeah. Uh -huh. Well, she wasn't like trying to promote it. She didn't even know it was sitting in the screen. Yeah, that that's yeah. probably that's probably not the reason. Someone probably that is what's up. Someone probably freaking you know reported her for it. You know what I mean? So yeah, because she got her first troll yeah, and she wasn't yeah, even doing yeah. what she was doing yeah. it on. It had yeah. nothing to do with that. Yeah. So yeah. So tell her to appeal it. Appeal it. Okay, freaking. that's what I told her. Yeah. And Terry Ryan, happy birthday. Yeah, still federal law. Fuck. Yeah, uh -huh. Goddamn government. Jesus. Well, she's in a legal funny, state. Funny, parts of it are still fed, uh, federally legal. That's why they got to make these dispensaries and whatnot. And Yo. she's in a legal state. And happy so birthday, Terry. Happy Love birthday. you, sis. Did you get a spanking? <laughs> Do you want a spanking? We'll, we'll have to leave that up to the mistress. And to oh, okay. Just ask in the house. Curious mind. <laughs> My Teresa. wife's birthday is April Fools. You got a link, Teresa. Jeez. Do you know how much fun I've had with that over my lifetime with her? Oh, yeah. Oh. The uh -huh. best one was she wanted she wanted another car. So I told her, okay. I'll get you another car. Mm -hmm. But I got two cars. I got this piece uh -huh. of shit fucking <laughs> Chevrolet Cabriolet or some kind of crap <laughs> fucking four door goddamn didn't yeah, have yeah. caps rusted fucking out. The California car from Wisconsin. Yeah. Oh I shit! Put, <laughs> I put a big I put a big red bow, and in California, our kitchen window looked out to the driveway. Yeah. So she gets up. She goes. She's in there doing dishes or something. About a half an hour later, she goes, what the fuck is that? <laughs> I'm way back in my man cave. That's your birthday present, honey. Happy birthday. Oh, she made it 50 fucking feet before I could blink. Oh. Man. <laughs> but I had the other car parked down at the neighbor's house. That's that's awesome, dude. Uh, yes, that's fucking right? awesome. <laughs> Yeah, I saved up and everything. That's just what you wanted. <laughs> I, took her, I took her into a jewelry store one time with an old credit card. So I'm <laughs> buying her this fucking thing. I give him the credit card. He comes back and pulls me over to the side and he says, sir, this card's been declined. <laughs> I'm like, honey, put that back. We got to go home. Oh. <laughs> oh. Jesus Uncle Sir, if you're evil, look at you. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> That's April Fools. Come on, you got to <laughs> play that motherfucker. Uh -huh. You know what, man, uh the best April Fools uh joke that I ever pulled, um I didn't even try to do. I, I just got involved in it. I uh so um my best friend uh actually probably still now. But yeah, so his family was real religious. Like there's the, there's no dating until marriage. Like you can go out on a date, but you can't be dating somebody, you know, let alone kissing and making out all that shit. Right. Well, so, uh, we were at the, uh, armory. We were in RTC together. We we're at the armory and I walk into the armory and they're like making out hardcore, you know, the commandants are gone. No one's going to catch them. You know what I mean? They knew where to go. And so I was just like, Oh, whatever. His mom pulls up in a soccer mom van, of course. And so he comes out, and as he gets in the car, dude, he's got, like, lipstick all over, bro. And his mom goes, sweetie, what is on your face? And he's like, uh, uh, uh. She said, you look like a clown. And I was like, April Fool's. And she starts mm -hmm. laughing. <laughs> and it Ooh. saved his fucking ass. Oh my god, dude, he would have got his ass whooped so bad. <laughs> She's like, I was gonna say because it looks so ridiculous. It's so <laughs> much. <laughs> Funny shit. Chasing tails outdoors. What's Chasing up, my man? Tail. Cool. Good to see you, sir. How you doing? Yeah, I gotta turn the heat on in here. My daughter's birthday is coming up soon. Oh, what day? April, April 13th. 13th? Mine's the 5th. Thank God she's, it falls on a Saturday. Thank God. Yeah, how old is she going to be? 14. 14, wow. And she, oh, so all uh, girls are the same age, okay. And she is my mini-me, so look out, world. <laughs> Thanks a and lot. My, and hey, <laughs> get ready, because both of my kids are just like me. So good luck, world. <laughs> your mama, your mama got her revenge twice. <laughs> uh huh. Uncle Surf I'm, Summer uh -huh. Camp opening June 2024. You send uh -huh. them. No, my no, my kids are good. Thank you very uh, much. Uh, that's what everybody says until they show up. Uh. Um, I uh, believe me, I know how to handle my kids. They learn. They learn at a young age. Trust me on that. They know well, better. You know, they know. Uh, Good I, I would say uh, uh, I, I never spank my kids that much. And the reason is because they know I will fucking spank the shit out of them. <laughs> so they just don't uh, do anything bad. Uh, look, I taught my I taught my kids young. They went to Walmart with me one time and tried to act a fool. And I'm like, if y'all make yeah. me act outside of if y'all make me act out of pocket in this store, y'all will never come with me again. They wouldn't quit touching shit. Mm -hmm. I'm like, don't try me. Well, yeah, my wife tells to me find out. Go shopping. They had not been back with me <laughs> to the store since, and they were three uh -huh. and four years old. So what does that tell you? My kids <laughs> learned. <laughs> Need to shop a trip with their uncle Surf. Uh -uh. <laughs> oh, that'd be a fun shopping yeah. trip. <laughs> Coming out of that My... candy store with gunny sacks. <laughs> oh, they know better. They know better. They know Chase, better. Chase tail, man. I always, I always try to support those that support me, man. I can't be there all the time, but I do try. You know what sounds good for fourteen year old girl these days? A fucking drum set. Oh, drum she's set? got. She's got her art and she's got her sports. Yeah. She is doing good. You need to make some noise. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that's true, man. Uh, we have a drum set just to the right of me over here. And, uh, dude, when my daughter plays it, man, she gets she's set free. Hell yeah. Oh, she does her music and she does. She is, I'm telling you, she's me made over. She's taking choir, theater art. She's doing good. it all. She's in art. She's good. doing track. She just got That's done awesome. with her last track meet today. She went to district. She made district, so I'm proud of her. Cool, cool. But oh, congratulations! Uh, yeah, and she finished last, but she don't care because she's excited about soccer, which is coming up this week. So, mm -hmm. 
Very cool. I'm proud of her. And then when she gets in the high school, she's going to do drill team and whatever. I'm telling you, she's me way over. I swear to God. Rock and roll. Yeah. That's a way to be as a kid. Do as much as you can, you know, freaking whatever Mm -hmm. floats your boat. And because you never know where it's going to lead you until you get there, you know? Oh, Oh, yeah. And and, and, yeah. Yeah. And and you can always fall back because you're not an adult yet. And also, Mm -hmm. if the school's paying for it, especially, you know what I mean? Or at least the brunt of it, you know? Hell yeah, take advantage. Oh, yeah. She told me she's got a four day weekend coming up and she might be going to church camp. I'm like, okay. <laughs> if you feel you need that, then go ahead, whatever folks you hey, vote. Hey, did you <laughs> go to church camp when you were a kid? Yes, I, I did. did. Go to, I didn't go to church camp, but I did. Well, I guess you could because it was St. Mary's of the Pine, but they didn't, they didn't do, uh, they didn't do like all religious crap, you know. We it was it was pretty, <coughs> it was pretty much like a freaking. Uh, it was just an outdoor camp. You learned outdoor skills, you know. There was yeah, mass it, on. There was a mass on Sunday, but you know. Yeah. Freaking, well, we went. You know. I went to a Baptist church camp, and I got in trouble halfway through the week. So of course, you know. <laughs> oh fucking figure. Well, well, well uh, uh, l- l- lady C at a Baptist anything, it's easy to get in trouble. Oh, I know. Oh, I know. Trust me. I got in trouble. <laughs> and you have no idea. <laughs> uh-huh. Yeah, you know. Yeah, uh, was- we, we went to one kind of like yours, Jimmy C. Like it was, of course, it was a bunch of churches coming together or whatever. But it really wasn't religious. It was more like uh, team building and shit. Yeah, like uh, yeah, let's work well, together know, and figure yeah, out, you know, yeah. how to, yeah. It was a well, they that, tried- not jamborees. Like, you know, but it, it yeah. was cool. It was a cool place. They had a workshop. You could learn, you know, you could you could learn woodworking skills. There was a freaking there was a there was a tinkering shop where they put where they they fixed some stuff, you know, like they were working. Oh, out. that's cool, if man. I, if I remember right, we were repairing a bunch of um, bicycles for a fucking charity, you know, freaking so yeah, I was in, Oh, I would have loved to be a part of that, man. That's yeah, cool. And the as best shit. thing about it was you didn't you know, there were there were certain times of the day that we um when the, when these shops were going on, that you could you could just bounce through them if you wanted to, you know you didn't have to you weren't stuck here or stuck over there. If you got bored, you'd just go somewhere else, you know. Yeah, and, wow. And do something else, you know. If this one bored you, you could go. You can go freaking to the canoeing part where they learn how to canoe. Well, see, you know what? Canoeing. And in a weird way, didn't that help you understand what it means to be a man because you had your own freedom to go do these things? Well, you know yeah, what I mean? Like, yeah. like it, 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 you know, you, you were stuck there on the property. Well, you learned, but like you, you kind of yeah. You learned how to be accountable for your own act. You know, yeah, your own acts because your mommy and daddy weren't there, and if yeah. and if you fucked up. They were coming to get you, and you wouldn't be there for the rest of the two weeks. You know? <laughs> Ain't no one going for you. Because <laughs> two weeks away from mommy and daddy, freaking at eight, nine years old, was fucking awesome. You know? Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I was yeah. 16. I was 16, and we traveled from Texas to somewhere in the middle of Arkansas. No. And oh, shit. Oh, yeah, boy. And- we middle of Arkansas? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Jesus I Christ. I was somewhere in the middle of Arkansas. Couldn't tell yeah. you where, but... I'll be right back, the reason I, yeah. Okay. The reason I got in trouble, I didn't even know I had this issue at the time, and it was during the middle of the summer, and y'all know how it gets in the middle of summer in the south. It's hot as fuck. So, yeah. um, I was having heat exhaustion and didn't know it. Uh-huh. And I was not on time for one of their whatever they had me fucking doing. And uh-huh. they were like, oh, you're not going to show up for a whatever it was. And I'm like, I'm in here throwing up. What the fuck you want me to do? <laughs> you know what I mean? And the they're like, you they tried to tell me I was fake. And I'm like, really? <laughs> you want to come check on me before you assume? <laughs> and they had Go to ahead. like take me to the medic part and all that. And because they thought I was faking, I'm like, "How the hell do you fake, huh?" <laughs> yeah. yeah, you know, but yeah, we didn't. Uh, we the camps I went to because I also went to the Boy Scout camp, Camp Wataka. Freaking, you know, I was like, I don't know, it was probably like freaking. I did three, so I did like six summers. Freaking, you know, two week, you know, six summers in a row. I freaking was away from home for two weeks, you know, which was fucking awesome. Freaking, but yeah, I mean, freaking, 
you didn't just yeah there was the schedule the only thing that was scheduled was meal times man you know and you you know i, I, yeah, didn't, I, I didn't miss many of those I, did yeah, you buddy ain't, ain't no one missing meals man come on <laughs> not at that age you know come on you're Especially out, of, out in the woods doing shit you're yeah, always yeah eat like you know, a goddamn wolf yeah freaking the scouting was even better because there was a uh, you know, you had to be on time for the ones at the scouting thing, but you, you know, that's when you, everything you did was earning you a merit badge. Oh well, yeah. And, and by the time those three summers was over, freaking, I had a belt full of badges, you know? <laughs> what up, Bunyan? We used the sachet. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's what we did in camp. That's bar. the Girl Scouts, yeah. Well, yeah. Male mm-hmm. or female, you put the fucking, it's on like this, it's sachet. I don't care what you say. Yeah, <laughs> you went to a different scout pack. <laughs> I, yeah, you. you could you could say that. <laughs> no, we had the ones that went our on scout our scout packs were run by guys out of Vietnam. Uh-huh. But I'm just saying we had the we had the things that went on your belt and freaking and you know yeah you, you also got pins for your for your uniform. But <laughs> did somebody say sachet? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you've been out the P3. I gotta take a dog out. You ain't a lad unless you've fallen out a tree. What? <laughs> oh. Oh man, speaking of which, uh, we just paid a grand so that I wouldn't fall out of a tree today. And it was so worth it. Uh these guys cut like uh 20 feet off of our 50 foot tall trees. Oh, Oh, they topped it, was, it. Yeah, they topped it real nice. Yeah, oh, and man. and so I I kept trying to tell my wife I was just like, no, nah, I can probably handle it. And <laughs> it was I'll funny because so I, it sounded like an old uh like literally a 1970s but nowadays like mail truck if it was still driving like yeah. wow. And I was like, what the fuck is that? I went out front. The guys waved at me. I waved at them back, and they were like, hey man, you want the trees cut? And I was like. I think we can do that right now. <laughs> yes. Uh, oh, they were but, they were just like driving by solicited. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, they were just driving by kind of looking for some work, you know. Yeah, I, that's um, what I mean. That's what solicited did. Yeah. Freaking the old the old gypsy pavers used to do that. <laughs> they drive uh, by with a pavers? truckload of paving. No, gypsies uh, used to do it though. They drive by, they'd say they just finished a job and they wanna, you know, they got a truck full of tar, you wanna you want it? We'll sell it cheap. Oh, yeah. okay, okay. <laughs> you know, like the fun, no, no, no. Like the, 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 this one was different. Like uh, Dude, they had just so finished a job on the next street over. Yeah, yeah, I understand. So, so that's, they, that's, they, 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 they had stopped. Same thing, same thing, dude. Drinking. <laughs> yeah, they, they had stopped, the and uh, yeah, uh, uh-huh. like I yeah. said, I, I uh-huh. waved, and they waved back, and then they pulled over and stopped, and I was just kind of like, wow, it's meant to be. I want the service right now because normally uh, I, I can't stand solicitors. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like uh, mm-hmm. I already told you no, leave me alone. You know. <laughs> but that's what that is, freaking. Yeah. Hey, Crippy Rob, I, I'm I'm a full believer, full on believer that that was sabotage. All right. Oh, <laughs> someone, for sure, man. Yeah. Someone someone paid that dude to do that. Freaking. <laughs> Cheers. Something. Cheers. Uh, and I don't even know if it's. Mm-hmm. Anybody on the ship? Yeah, I'm with Disa Ray. The ship was hacked. I don't know. Yeah, the the, the, the ship, the the skipper was hacked. Freaking, and uh, you can what? send Disa Ray a link if you want. It, it is kind of funny that. Uh, oh, okay, cool. Um, oh shit, my messenger just shut down today. Grippy, uh, we need your assistance. <laughs> Jaws lottery tickets in Massachusetts. Jaws probably uh, but but yeah man uh the, the whole way the thing uh the way it moved man um a ship of that size doesn't turn that fast unless it's controlled it, mm-hmm. that's just that that's too much mass yeah mm-hmm. but see i wasn't I there mean, what happened when they say they had a power failure i don't yeah. know i don't know oh well see i uh, i was thinking jet skis it's not the same uh it's not the same propulsion of course but like a jet ski, when you when, when you lose the throttle, there's yeah. no steering. You know, so the same yeah. thing with the big ship. If the propellers uh, 
you yeah, know, there uh, is, yeah, there is. Yeah, there is. If those go out, then it's right. just dependent on the rudder. There's, there's very little. There's very little steering at that point. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It wasn't fully maintained. More than like, well, foreign flag ships. Uh, they don't have the same rules and regulations as the American uh, vessels. I'm pretty okay. sure. I'm pretty sure they don't know the whole gist of that just yet. No. Way okay. too early. <laughs> yeah, I can't see the chat. What the hell are y'all talking about? A ship turn around in the water? What the fuck are y'all talking about? Oh, I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm, Lady C, I'm, uh, where the fuck was that? In Baltimore. In Baltimore, yeah. a container ship destroyed a bridge that was, you know, had heavy traffic on it. Like in, oh, so shit. Uh, what did they say? So uh, a bunch uh, of cars went in the water. Yeah. Mm. With people in them. What's the body oh, count shit. at? Freaking... Uh, it, it was. It was actually. It's only six. That's it. Okay. Yeah. Yep, so in other words, so in other words, a lot of people it, were able to get the fuck out their car. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, see what was happening is uh, the six that passed away. Um, they were just repairing potholes on the bridge, so it was already partially shut down when this happened. So there was uh -huh. commuters, and they were told to get the fuck out of the way, and they did. But the construction guys stayed on, and yeah, sadly, man. Oh, I mean, they, oh, so yeah. they diverted. They diverted yeah. the traffic. Oh, yeah. oh! They saw it coming, and <laughs> uh, pretty much, yeah. And well, uh, yeah, it's a, you're gonna uh, see a big boat. Like yeah, yeah. You ain't but you see Titanic coming yeah. at you. Come on, man. You yeah, don't see it. What they call situational <laughs> awareness, right? But who? Yeah. But what are the odds of someone being on that bridge, being able to fucking shut it down? You know what I mean? Freaking yeah. yeah. So uh, uh, apparently the ship had called in a mayday, yeah. and then they said, "Okay, all all civilians off oh. the motherfucker." Oh, the construction okay. guys stayed on, oh, and then okay. it, it all happened within like thirty seconds after that. Oh, okay. It, it, well, that's from what that, that that's my deduction. I don't have any information, okay. guys. That's okay. just my deduction. Uh, okay. okay, I didn't get any. All I all I saw was a thirty second clip of the video. Yeah, which is, yeah. Uh, most yeah. people have seen. Yeah. Well, I haven't. I've been busy with you all day, I and I said came into most your people. So, um, the, there's two you. videos they're showing. There's two. <laughs> they hardly show them all consecutively, but there's one where there's ships coming in to hit the bridge, and there's a separate one where it's already crashed, and then the bridge falls on top of it. Oh shit! But okay. but 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 they hardly play the whole thing together. Wow. Well, that. Interesting. I ain't been on well, my phone. And, and it is, and, and it's not like I'm not talking conspiracy theory crap. I'm not, you know what I mean. But it's just like it's interesting how it's uh, being reported, you know, and, and and also how they're handling it. Like they're like, oh, yeah. we're praying for the 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 you know hopeful survivors, and it's like I'm, I hate to say it, guys, but if you fall 100 100 feet into fucking 50 degree water, you have like yeah. seven minutes at most, you know. Yeah, you better hope those first responders are already there to help you get out. <laughs> yeah, hey, I'm only trying to help you out, pal. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what, what, what did he say? I know he's probably talking shit. What did he say? I am talking. I just told Kate I'm, I'm trying to help him out. <laughs> I, that's what I asked you. What did he say? I Sir, can't see states that. the obvious. If you can't, you can't read that one. Uh, I'm on my phone. I can't see chat. Oh. <laughs> you had brand new, like, you like I say, I'm just helping Kane thing. out. I'm making sure Kane <laughs> understands. I'm just giving a hand. If he clicked a button and quit being scary, he we wouldn't be hey. having this conversation. Uh, 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 creepy Rob, uh, P. Diddy organized the uh, tanker crash into Baltimore, so everybody forget that he's in the Bahamas. Creepy. Oh, <laughs> creepy. oh, fuck, man. No, neither one. Oh, it's good. I can't believe they bring it to R. Kelly. R. Kelly. What the fuck? Oh, man. Yeah, I saw that too. Everybody's oh, asking me why, shit. why, why. And I'm like, I don't know. It's supposed to be an ongoing investigation that's 27 years old, man. Come on, dude. You already caught the motherfucker that did it. Move the fuck on. <laughs> oh, I don't know, man. Oh. That's that's a rough one for me. And he's situation. not allowed in Malaysia nowhere. He's been gone since it happened. <laughs> like y'all quit talking shit. Motherfucker ain't allowed on the planet no more. Oh, who's this? 
Tupac. Oh, Tupac, yeah. Yeah, leave Tupac they're alone. Still, they're still trying to pin P. Diddy for that shit. They already caught the dude that did it. Oh, yeah, yeah. It was like four dudes. They all, all knew who it was. And uh, three dudes died, and he was the last one, and he was a dumbass that <laughs> actually Thank said you. it on a podcast. <laughs> yeah, he got caught up, and they found him, and he's already dealt with. Dude, uh, like, why does everybody got to brag about their bullshit? Why do you got to brag about your bullshit? Just keep it bullshit. And it's, <laughs> and it's 27 years later. Like, come on, dude. Use yeah. common sense. <laughs> I don't know. Oh Lord! It, hey, it, isn't know. it funny watching the human animal? Oh man, <laughs> they never disappoint me. No, it's, sir, they do not. Yeah, it's rinse and repeat. They do the same shit <laughs> over and over again, thinking that they're going to be smarter than everybody else. Uh, uh well, uh, I'm 20. I'm 30. I got it figured out. Okay, have fun. <laughs> yeah, I laugh. <laughs> Man, I laugh at those type people. The youngins yeah. who think us old people don't know shit. Okay, well, you know what? Get... <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Sorry. It's like we didn't get this old by being dumb. <laughs> it wasn't by accident. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, a a twenties, I get it because you're trying to like make your place in the world. But by thirty, you got to admit some a uh, little bit of yeah, humility. Twenty, you want to be a sponge. You yeah. ought to be soaking no. up every bit of information you can. You should be getting that is a damn skill. You should yeah, be doing not, something with these things instead of this thing. Yeah. Knowledge is power, man. Yep. Hmm? Well, my dad I don't need said, to, I don't need to figure it all out. I got. To, I ain't got time to figure it all out. I'm gonna go out and have fun. I'm at this point. I'm having fun. Yeah. Uh, well, I had all my fun back in my twenties. I'm oh, pretty much. No. I ain't done. I'll just change direction. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> mm-hmm. Back then, I didn't I, have the time or the money because I was always working to make the money. Yeah. So I didn't do all the fun shit. So now I get to. Are they trying to get you on? Uh, well, back oh, in my twenties, I was trying to prove yeah. people wrong because everybody was trying to tell me that it wasn't possible what I was trying to do, and I proved their asses wrong. Don't tell me I can't because I'll do it twice, and that's nothing. What the fuck I did? <laughs> Are these and still, things? believe it or not, till this day, there's still some yeah. people who's wanting to debate and argue with me and say. Oh. It ain't possible. That ain't real. This ain't whatever it is, you know. And then right as soon as they say it, what I said will happen. And I'm like, okay, I'm wrong. Explain this then. (laughs) And it's just funny to me. I get to laugh at people. I'm like, I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. But y'all say I'm in fantasy world. Okay. Then explain to me how you're seeing this with your own eyes. Explain to me how I call this. <laughs> I find it fucking funny. I'm like, don't tell me I'm wrong. I know my vibe. <laughs> I find it fucking hilarious. Jimmy, you gonna keep Rez around? Pay him if you have to. He's cool, motherfucker. What? <laughs> fucking Wait. king. Did I get in trouble? No. No, you, you got a compliment. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> Kane, Kane's just, he, Kane likes to stir the pot. Uh huh. Don't pay no mind to Kane. Yeah. He's a. But, but he ain't got the balls ass. to come up here and be part of the no. pot. No. <laughs> yeah, he won't click the link. He's too scared. You know, ugly people are like that. <laughs> you ugly? Uh-huh. Uncle Sir said that. Uncle Sir said that. Remember that, Kane? Hey, I work at being <laughs> ugly every damn day. I don't know, Kane. Got half a chance. I did get a good nap. <laughs> five hours? What are you complaining about? You need five hours of sleep, bitch? No. <laughs> he's, just hoping, he's just hoping I'm still alive when he gets up. <laughs> yeah, good luck with that. Good luck with that. You know Jimmy nowadays. Good luck. Yeah, actually, well, 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 when I wake up lately, I wish I was dead. It's like, oh, this sucks. <laughs> Here I am again. 
Uh-huh. Believe it or not, on my three-year little adventure that I just came back home from last year, I used to use Jimmy as my sleep therapy. See, Teresa knows the deal. Kane oh, is yeah. a chicken shit, uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> and a lot of people, I would have his stream playing all the time. I'm like, how can you sleep through that? I'm like, I feel like I'm around family, and I got my big brother watching uh-huh. over me. That's what uh-huh. it made me feel safe. Trust me. <laughs> oh, uh- there's plenty of people that do it. I was looking at my analytics the other day, right? And freaking, and it was of the uh, you know the uh, the part where it shows you the videos that have been played in the last forty eight hours, right? Mm-hmm. And and there was freaking, there was about fifteen streams that people had fucking watched that were two, three, four years old. I'm like, yeah. Mm-hmm. Like oh, and then I so so out of curiosity, I go to what I go to the other page where you should, where it shows the uh, the amount of time people had watched, and most of those streams people had watched at least an hour or two of. And I'm mm-hmm. like, fucking, I don't know who it is. I don't care who it is. All I care about is the fact that they're watching them. You know, and it, mm-hmm. it blows my mind. They're dead streams. They're age ages old. You know, and but they're still. Because I'm not live, they they you know they turn it on. I know one person that says that's how they do their housework. They put on the stream and just and just you know you 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 know because they let it run because they never know when when something hilarious is gonna hit them. You know, freaking. So they they find it amusing. Big. Okay. What, what up, up sir? Ganja? What <laughs> up, you little shit stains? Oh, no, I said, you watch not it. Not be nice. Be nice. Huh? There's a female up here. Remember show that. Us, show us your whitey tighties in the laundry. You want to see my fucking whitey tighties? Uh, no, I don't want to see the streak. No. no, just no. leave them alone. No, leave them alone. no. Be careful what you out wish for. Yeah, yeah, they're probably all brown. Freaking. Well, I didn't think you in the middle because I thought you were a thong man. They're that only brown skin. in the middle where my butt cheeks yeah, go. Got more skin okay, marks. we don't need to know all oh, that. The, the, yeah, that's yeah, where it's supposed that. to go. Yeah, that's good. That's good yeah, news. There's, that's, there's more yeah. skin marks than a runway. Come on, man. Maybe, maybe maybe if you time. have the brown marks on the side, there's a problem. Yeah. Maybe it's time to go back to corn cobs. You ever think about that? <laughs> hey, all I know, all I know is that it's coming out the rooter and the tutor. Oh, oh. oh. oh Jesus! <laughs> Hear my dog. Shit, we don't need to know all that. Damn. <laughs> oh. oh. I think I need a drink after that one. There goes the show. God. <laughs> How much to drink your own pee? Oh, dude. How really? much do I have to donate for you to drink a cup of your own pee? Uh, you are going to make me throw up on this panel. Oh. Seriously. Oh, uh... <laughs> Uh, I think that's gonna be. Uh, I did it in the Marine Corps for nothing, but times that, have changed, well, bitch. Well, that was that was training. <laughs> uh, like I say, times have changed. Uh, you know, uh, uh, gargling your own urine is good to cure strep, uh, strep throat. Well, oh Jesus Christ! Uh-huh. What the Romans have used I to brush into? their teeth in it? So, Mike, where are you at? Shit! Uh-huh. What the fuck, Mike? Where are you at? Quick <laughs> link, somebody. Shit. The haircut. I can't believe what's, I'm even what, asking that. What's but... that other one? Peeing on a wound will help fucking help it heal too. Freaking yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. That's uh, a snake uh, bite. Also, yeah, if, you, uh, if you get stung by a if thing, you have, if, if you have athlete's jellyfish. foot, if you have athlete's foot, pee on your feet in the shower and oh. cure it up. That's why you get what the, the athlete. Is that gonna work? You're running water from the other motherfucker. He ain't gonna pee. be on there for but. Well, no. I mean, do, 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 don't pee on your foot under the water. Just you hop in the tub so you don't pee on your floor, Uncle Surf. <laughs> soak it. <laughs> hey, you soak the bunion. Just on a floor for at least sixteen years, okay? Well, how did we go? How did we go from picking on Kane to talking about what we're talking about now? Hey, well, wait till we get to butt. I, 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 I just like talking butt about part. That's I where just it's like talking about disgusting uh, yeah. healthy medicine. Lady she, you know, <laughs> you Speaking know, of butts, do you yeah. know that the Romans used a communal, <laughs> oh, no. the Romans used a communal you sponge you to wipe their ass in the communal shitters? They used yeah. the, yeah. 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 the same yeah. sponge. Well, you had to wipe I wonder it why the Roman Empire fell. I can give you three fucking <laughs> simple well, fucking communism. reasons. Mm-hmm. Communism Jim washes his ass in his face. She is, motherfuckers. With the same, same. <laughs> with the same 
Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't like the deal Doris so, showed us. Rez, Rez, what is that picture behind you? I love that artwork. What is that? Oh, I'm trying to take something to change the we're subject. Talking about. This is a, a a tapestry my son got me uh, for yeah. my birthday years back. That, that's a so uh, I'm a huge Dragon Ball Z fan, mm -hmm. and also I like the artwork. So it's a uh, it's Piccolo. Uh, it's uh, oh, that's Goku. Cool. Is that Goku. Piccolo? No, it's not Piccolo. That's Goku. Oh. And uh, right up here, you can see he has the third eye, like Tien. Uh, uh -huh. I have a brown and, eye. And, 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 of course, he has all the uh, Dragon Balls, but also he's <laughs> melting in there. <laughs> and it's funny because, uh, oh, shoot, this is like five years ago. This is the, Yeah, this is like five years old. And uh, it was funny because. Like uh, this when, Dury, when he shows up, I'm ready to go like. One five-year-old drew that. Um, wow. Yeah, wow. What up, Blind Straight? And we got Bill from Atlantic Adventures. Good to see ya. Hi, everybody in chat. How y'all doing? <laughs> Even though okay. I can't see, but anything uh -huh. to change the subject. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I was trying to bring up the chat, and uh, I'm reading on the TV, but I still can't follow it because y'all are crazy motherfuckers to keep up with. Hey. Yeah, huh? Wait a minute. Oh, yeah. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. We didn't come here to accuse each other. Of being. We all know we're crazy motherfuckers. We <laughs> Yeah, that's why we all in. in. You want some salt to go on top of that? Well, that, well no, that, that's why I came back. Jimmy <laughs> calls this group therapy, and I agree with it. So, oh, yeah, dude, no, uh, honestly, guys, uh, we don't uh, call each other crazy. Uh, we all know that. To, to be very You're serious, uh, uh, that is what I love about these kind of channels. We found our people. Hey, we We're, represent our right? crazy right. That's what right. we do. You ever hear come here. Murderers? Do you ever hear a bunch of murderers sitting around a park bench talking loud about the killings that they've done? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Well, which one do you want to talk about? <laughs> which one? <laughs> well, it ain't about we that talk other about one. That all day, but I ain't trying to get Jimmy Van, so yeah, we yeah. don't do that. I don't yeah. expect uh -huh. that. Uh -huh. I ain't listening to a fucking pussy that uses Zen. What? What? Oh, Jesus God. Uh, Smell your armpit again. <laughs> Make sure you're oh, you. I can, um, Damn. Yeah, Why don't you yeah, listen to like another that. Zen? Come on, man. I'm using them things too, man. I got I got three packs right here. Freaking yeah. Okay. <laughs> Bunch of homos. What? Bunch of non-smoking oh, homos. Like we're quitting. Uh, right. uh -huh. Yeah, and you can call me. Think for yourself, because I'm I'm smoking a cigarette succeeded. right now. I finally succeeded at quitting. So yeah, I'm a quitter. Uh, I'm there, there, was, there was a. Uh, uh, there you go. I don't like days. sins. Twenty six days. Fine, in, smoke your cigarettes. Yeah, I don't like cigarettes either. Well then. Well, then what the hell are you talking I'll about? I'll your goddamn pubic hairs around your butt. I don't know what you fucking smoke. <laughs> You're my Vince, business. Vins are weird, dude. You fucking little pillow of white nicotine okay. salt and shit in your lip like a fucking goddamn motherfucking hey, weirdo. It's just, it's just like them guys that chew the freaking uh -oh. tobacco, man. Only without the chewing. I don't know if somebody was using it. How much to drink your own pee pee? You know the best thing is you yeah, don't he have got to that guy spitting. How much did you get? Five hundred. I ain't that thirsty. Hi. Let's put it that way. Five hundred bucks. Five hundred bucks. Hello, right. hello. Five hundred bucks. Hi, Teresa. Hello. Hi. Good to see you, girl. How the heck are you? Good. If good. Lion Straits got five beers and three three grams. I gotta of catch up. White Widow. I've only had <laughs> one beer. And it's cake. I've had none. <laughs> I've had and none. I'm, I'm sipping on the four roses, so you know. Whiskey is no, on my no stinking beer, man. <laughs> the four roses. What are you drinking? Four are you getting roses, drunk? Four roses, small batch. Don't I get drunk every Tuesday? Let me talk to you about the Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, Jimmy. The Lord and Savior Jesus. Oh, I've been, <laughs> what the fuck? Hey, hey, I've been saved and it. And it had nothing to do with that mofo. Come on. Jeez. 
<laughs> we are not pulling that meanness going around. <laughs> I saw you know, one line, of the coolest right? things one of the coolest things growing up is the Mormons and Jehovah's Witnesses would come by the house and my dad was a uh, disabled and an introvert. Uh -huh. So they would always, you know, do you know Jesus and can we talk? And he was like, yeah, come inside. But one one condition, if you listen to me after you talk. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, my goodness, dude. Seth. Dude. Oh, <laughs> you're, I used to have, I boy, are you barking up the wrong tree, Seth. I could have, I could have <laughs> some fun. Back, back in the day, I would have fun with those guys. I'd fucking... Bro. They'd be so I lived my, on... They'd be I lived on the second floor and they came up and the, they were giving me this bullshit and I told them if you can ride your little fucking bike down these stairs and land it I'll convert to your fucking religion right oh, now. Oh shit. And he you, fucking you really got on his bike. Dad. He got on his bike, he put his helmet on and he yeeted himself down those stairs and flipped over himself. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, there's an art there's an art to riding bikes down the stairs. You have to know where to put your ass. Close my door. To yes. Uh, your ass needs to go over the back tire. Exactly. <laughs> okay. I'm about to turn my camera on, and I would answer the door looking like this. They would turn around and walk away. Well, I'd talk to them. Once, one time, I, I, I answered the door with the with the BB gun in the hand, you know, and and proceeded and in, in, in proceeded to shoot their shoes, freaking, while they was running down the driveway. Damn, <laughs> Damn. you're going to hell, bro. There was one time I was in the middle of cooking. I was chopping up vegetables for my mom, and she had ran off to the other end of the house real quick. So I answered the door with a knife in my hand. They didn't say much. They were like, "Do you? Never mind." <laughs> they turned around. Yeah. <laughs> Hard the fuck off. <laughs> well, but see, guys, but isn't that the true test, though? Because if you come with them with some weird ass shit like the, all, all y'all just talked about, shouldn't they still stay and try to fucking help you be saved? You know, isn't that the true test? Well, you know? yeah, yeah, bro, fucking put your arm back in your socket. <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean. <laughs> Cut that Bible, son. Uh, they did not want to risk it with me. They were like, "Oh no, we ain't doing this." <laughs> nope. Mm -mm. <laughs> Yeah, and of course, I'm not advocating for uh, missionaries to hurt themselves. I'm not yeah. saying that at all. Just I'm, I'm just advocating for missionary position, though. <laughs> well, uh, supposedly that's how they should be. That's 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 what they talk about. Speaking of that, did you know that Snoop Dogg and Dr. Dre is working on a new album, and that's what it's called, Missionary? Ooh. Interesting. Uh, the I don't Doggy think they're going to be working on that much longer with P. Diddy on the run. Oh, hey, that's P. true. He P. Diddy ain't got nothing to do with death row. Thank you yeah. very much. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Tommy Hamlin. Do you know hey. what's going on with P. Diddy? I missed it. Yeah, he just got both of his houses raided because it's on an arm he's a going fucking, investigation to Homeland Security, which is he's a homosexual pedophile. That's what P. Diddy is. Whatever. Freaking Harry Christmas, man. Was it, Harry uh, mm -hmm. Who misses the Harry Christmas? Williams Those guys out. were cool. Handing out flowers at the freaking bus stop and the train station. And yeah, the one with the with the hammer <laughs> wings at the Christmas. airport dancing around, and the, the, you know, they did a lot of murders yeah. and all that. Yeah, Dad, you yeah. seen the documentary? Right. No, I'm good, bro. <laughs> Been a long time, man. Been a long time. Yeah, dude, I, I, I haven't seen one of them, them in a the long time. time. He was uh, running like a sex dungeon. And they did murder. Uh, uh, what'd you say? Shit. A big bunion? A Hare Krishna sex dungeon? No, P. Diddy. That, that sounds interesting. P. Diddy. That's why Homeland Security uh, oh, got okay. him. He was running a fucking gay pedophilia sex dungeon at his house. Uh, who told yeah, you that? that? Is, Where uh, in the, the hell it's is that? It's a fucking that fact. The, Look that it is up. the accusation, oh, yeah. Look up well, the charges. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They were volunteered. It, they all volunteered for it. So. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Come on, man. Just like the island that just, got busted a few years one, ago. One, one, yeah, one, that's true. One dude, one dude didn't like getting slammed in the ass as hard as he actually got, and he cried about it. Well, so. you know, <laughs> honestly, uh, Jimmy C, I think you're on track there. Like, uh, yeah. uh, never you know, uh, 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 dude, dude uh, P Diddy was playing the game, and he said no, and they got mad at him. That's the only yeah, reason he got yeah, busted. You know. He didn't like the way he got spanked, you know, freaking. Yeah. You know, freaking. 
Yeah. Just Biden's America, man. He volunteered to be Will Smith. Is He's a volunteer. Will oh, Smith that's true. Too. Yeah, he is. Mr. Turner's neighborhoods in the house. Oh shit! Look at this handsome man just came in. Please. Damn, crispy. Uh huh. Crispy wrong. Interviewers, somebody died. That says, that says crispy. I'm, I'm gonna Thank put you. a new. I'm gonna put. Please. I'm gonna put a new. Uh, what is it called? I'm gonna put a new. A new picture there. I got like a little. <laughs> yeah. a, bro, if you see the <laughs> AI picture I got, dog. Yeah, 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 dude. Bring it up. Uh, this is like me graduating it, college or about to represent for a law firm or some shit. Oh my god. You look like you're about to tell me of my fortune hey. or a fucking my palm reading or <laughs> something. Rob, 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 dude, dude, come on, do it right. I'm gonna share it. I'm gonna share. Yeah, I'm gonna yeah, just. Yeah. I'm gonna airdrop it real quick to myself. <laughs> kind of palm yeah. reading you do. We don't want. Hey, to do it. I want to screenshot that and make that my background now. I'm gonna airdrop it. Watch, bro. I'm gonna give. I'm gonna give. I'm gonna give you one a screenshot right now, though. Right, I'm gonna shirt. catfish a bunch of hoes with that picture, Rob. Blind straight because you can look up a goat. Oh my god, uh... bro, we're still live, uh, man. <laughs> the deer did too. They ain't watching yet. Uh, yeah, deer got the rona too. Come on, man. Here. <laughs> Give me a second. What the hell the fuck is that? Wow. Mr. Sad. Turner's neighborhood is in what's town. Up? What's up? Oh, Mr. T, what's up, buddy? Peter uh -huh. the fool. <laughs> okay. I don't I don't pity fools. <laughs> don't okay. Listen. Hit the fucking link, Kane. You know that that dude was. Don't, don't uh, do that to Kane. Kane ain't even gonna play it. Hey, it, hey. Kane, yeah, Kane. it ain't my fucking chicken shit. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> hold on. This is a one-time deal. If Kane Kane kick, clicks the link, Blink. I'll show Teresa in a red dress. <laughs> there you go. One-time yeah. deal, one time only. <laughs> hey. No, I gotta do hey, it. He'll even, he even throw in the black dress, too. <laughs> well, <laughs> if K comes up, though. <laughs> what about the red thong? Oh, that it one's personal. Of, it ain't that type of thing. Uh -huh. Yeah, exactly. Hey, yo, I, didn't, bro. I, didn't, hey, I didn't say that. I don't know who said that. Wow. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Yeah, right? we've all been on that road with you. Uh -huh. so we know better. Shit. So guys, uh, 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 What's up, growl, growl is my growl is my straight male husband. What? What? Uh, yeah. How, how, how? Mm -hmm. So you know, no, we're, we're, no, we're how, gonna get, no matter how you slice that, it's gay, you know. No, hey, no, 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 it's, no, it's not gay. Fun, it's bro. like you know, I, like, I like we can we, we, we hold up, hold up. Just don't fucking uh, look at my ass. Uh, 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 we can fuck it. Oh, oh shit, uh, Okay, like, wait a minute. That picture. Uh, that that uh, sentence. Hold on. I'm gonna do it like this. I'm gonna do it like this. Alien like or something. What was that? Middle Eastern, Bollywood, goddamn Bollywood store. Like, what is that? Ralph Lauren? I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you. Right now. Like, this is too much. I look like fucking. Uh, I look like fucking. I look like fucking Rigoberto or some shit. I look like Enrique Iglesias if he had. I look like fucking like that. I just gotta go to Turkey, dog. That's what my hair's supposed to look like, bro. Turkey does those hair transplants. That's like probably forty pounds lighter with some hair. Gay man, kid, come on, man. Just that's me. How much just, fucking real estate balls. did you sell that year? Just buy the wig, man. <laughs> yeah. Dude, this uh, is honestly, another one. Uh, this is a more. Creepy. This is a one I used one for work. On the west side and used car. Oh, that's the one I used for work. No, see the same guy that went that uh, had Joe Biden go. Actually, no, see, uh, 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 yeah, you're creepy. Here's how you, here's how you do not it. The guy you want to go to. Uh, yeah, that one looks you, like a crooked. So you get your license. You get your license, right? And then you post the one with the hair. Uh, under your license, and then all your social media is with you bald, so it looks like you've been doing it for like 20 years. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Oh my god, bro. This shit is crazy. That's funny. I did that shit. I showed that shit at work at my at my fucking my morning meeting. I'm like, because this yeah. other dude brought it up, and I'm like, let me show this shit real quick. I brought everybody started fucking cracking up. <laughs> Teresa. Uh, oh did you god. shave oh, your head when Joe Rogan shaved his head? He went from model to politician real quick. <laughs> <laughs> Joe Rogan. Joe Rogan's always been. Boy, now he had a fade, right? He had like a low fade or something before. Yeah, he had the fear yeah, factor. Short hair, the fear oh, factor fuck. fade. Yeah, I forgot. I'm like, damn, the he's out to me. I'm, I, I just, I, I remember him always being bald, but growl. 
what is this straight male? Uh, see those <laughs> those three hey, words, they don't belong. It's the husband, in the same it's the no. husband part. Okay, uh, 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 Uncle uh, Surf, uh, Uncle hey. Surf. No, you're, you're looking. You're looking between the lines. No, so mm -hmm. we're two straight males that are benefiting from the uh, tax results, and also mm -hmm. we can have chicks, tax and results. then we can buy tax boats. Results, what? Uh, you're, you're, what? We can buy. We can buy boats. Uh, is there any uh, blood uh, stuff going on? How are you two getting tax no. credits? No. Well, because no. It, it, it it doesn't no. say that you you're have to be you're gay telling to get me that my tax money is going to you too. <laughs> you gotta remember, yeah. You gotta remember. Yeah. No, you're running a scam on me. Hold on, no. Remember, you better be fucking be each other, goddamn it! If you're getting those benefits, hold on. If there's right. if there's, <laughs> You're if fucking I, me. Hey, you might as well someone, fuck each other. If, anybody, if anyone's married, they're getting a tax benefit. If so we're just two no, straight males no, that got married. No, there's no Are you tax guys clapping benefit. cheeks? There's no tax No, benefit that's gay. Married. Freaking, but if there's a husband, that means there needs to be a wife. So you the wife. You yeah. the bitch now. Come on. Ooh. Well, no, no. Okay, okay. So here's how it works. Here's how it works. Uh, so uh, here's we're going to equally... Work. No, that's not how it works, right? It's a... No, 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 here's how it works. <laughs> simple, uh, dude. On, uh, on the day of the that's wedding, simple. on the uh, on the day of the wedding, who uh, we're uh, gonna have a race uh, from the doors to the altar, and whoever gets there first, that's the person that gets the master bedroom and husband status. The other one's the wife. So I just gotta fucking train uh, my legs, you know, so I can beat uh, him to the altar. And go then, for the uh, better, No, here's a key suggestion: run the other direction. Run the other direction. <laughs> oh. No, get like a pocket of marbles and throw it or a banana deal. peel. Grease is that. Shit. Throw the marbles down, a banana peel. And when he goes oh. to step off, he's going to whoop. Yeah. Well, I'm not going to kill my husband, dude. I, like I said, we are getting insurance. Get the insurance boat. first. Get the insurance yeah. going first. Run the other <laughs> Get the insurance going. <laughs> Run the other direction, I'm telling you. Oh, I, I'm telling you guys, man, like, if I want to wash my fucking car parts in the fucking dishwasher, <laughs> he's going to say yes. My female wife is going to say no. Who are you going to pick, uh -huh. guys? Well, <laughs> what car part are you washing in the dishwasher? You fix the dishwasher <laughs> after you ruined it with a header and a fucking bunch of pistons. No, dude, don't put your carburetor <laughs> in the dishwasher, man. Yeah, it ain't going to help it. <laughs> Y'all just talking dirty now. Well, no, we're men. We're just going to die one day. So fuck it. Let's go. <laughs> that's some fun. Okay. Do you live in Utah? Just saying. That's the only place that's legal at. <laughs> yeah. 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 yeah, you might, you might you have to go to uh, uh, Utah uh, to uh, make that uh, legally uh, binding. You know? uh, I identify with Utah adjacent. <laughs> San okay. Francisco, maybe. So you're what? Wisconsin? <laughs> No, I'm, not even, uh, I'm uh, not even asking any more questions. I'm done with it. <laughs> <laughs> it just goes deeper and deeper, and it fucking goes fucking scatter back and forth. And and what, everybody. What, so, when I was in the, when yeah, I was in the <laughs> army. Girl, 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 what are you going to do when he brings home another man? <laughs> well, then he'd call me a faggot and divorce me. <laughs> hey, um, I was gonna I ask you guys a, I was gonna I ask know. you guys a question. I wanted to ask you guys on chat, but do you think, um, and not to get like conspiratorial or nothing like that, but do you really think that that ship that crashed into the bridge, like it was, it was all like just yeah, like the lights you. went out? We already said, man. No, nah, I, I, I didn't. I didn't see. I didn't. We, I didn't we see all it. think it's an attack. A hacking, yeah. like a cyber attack or something. They... No, I'm thinking. I'm thinking the, the the captain was paid off, or they hacked the ship. Yeah, because apparently they had somebody there explaining today. Some a uh, captain. He was saying that like when you lose electricity, because they lost electricity at one point, and yeah. then everything else went. But like, I mean, they could have. Yeah, they could have hacked it. I guess. And oh. Oh. Some damage uh, okay, it. okay. So 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 oh. I'd believe it. I'd believe it if it just kept going out this way. But the lights went they throw out. The, anchor down? the lights went out, and then it fucking they, turns. They did, but they said that they were going like nine, eight, or nine knots, and that if they, if the the anchor, like, so it could, when the anchor gets dropped, it could hold it, and it could stay there at like one or two knots. But it was going like nine knots, so the guy said that that's it's impossible. Like it's surprising that he didn't yank the anchor off, like tear it off the boat. But it's just weird because they said it's been like a hundred. It's been a long time, or it's been decades and decades before since a ship ever crashed 
into a bridge like that, and you got to think, oh, bro, that, like, that kind that of shit same doesn't happen. Ship, bro, all those that big same ships have and and multiple problems. Wheel. Yeah, I, it's had multiple problems. I know, I know. All that those big ships have a bridge in Belgium. All those big ships have an actual wheel for backup when the power goes out. It's a direct connection, the steering wheel to the yeah, but if there's no to the rudder, if but if it's there's no, no power. power to the to the freaking no power to the it doesn't matter. It doesn't yeah, matter. It's no. pretty good unless you're in a yeah, swim. Because then you're, you're just going with the power of the current. Um, it doesn't matter, bro. It's not. It's mechanical. Do it doesn't. It doesn't require power. Yeah, yeah but uh, uh, I do want to agree with Big Bunyan <laughs> on that. Like, so the uh, unless, here, uh, and your propeller is uh, uh, here, and you're going that way. Yeah, well, if you don't you have got this, you ain't got. Yeah, but you could still turn the boat slowly, very slowly. If you don't have the fucking propellers <laughs> providing power, you just you freaking you're you're at the you're at the will of the freaking current. Right? Yes, yeah, so you turn the boat, so you're going with the current. It, it's the difference. I've got a boat that's got an outboard engine, an inboard outboard, and an inboard. When you cut the throttle on the inboard, you don't go. You ain't steering that boat because yeah. there's yeah, no it's propulsion going to the rudder. But those big yeah. ships are always have a backup. If you crank the wheel on an inboard well, okay. outboard, okay. Then throttle, it, it, and that's what makes me curious. That's what makes me curious <laughs> is the power goes out, and then suddenly the boat turns sharply. That's what makes me curious. Okay, if that's a, if that's the case, if it don't require electricity to turn the boat. At the way you're saying, Gonda, explain Titanic. That was fucking uh, like well, seventy years ago. Yeah, the Titanic. I'm, the Titanic I'm just, <laughs> I'm just saying if that's how the, the main Titanic way was of. I'm the just Titanic saying the main different. function of a of a cruise ship type boat, that big of a ship. It's not a cruise boat. It's a container I'm, carrier. I'm, I'm so just, it's stacked I'm saying, up with the containers. It's stacked up. I right. understand that, but I'm saying will, the size of the ship compared to an itty bitty boat, like <clears throat> one of those individuals would have. I'm saying the size, and that's the way that they work. Yeah, propulsion's propulsion. You need propulsion. So it, that's yeah. what I'm saying. Oh, what, what I'm curious like about Jimmy said, is that, uh, like, like Jimmy said, it would go with the current of the water put if it, you had yeah. no way to Put turn it this it. way: with propulsion, you could turn a boat around in a very small spot. Okay, but if you're at the mercy of the current. It's going to take you fucking miles to turn that boat around. That's what I'm saying. So ain't that kind of what no. happened at the Titanic? If that's how they work? No. 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 The Titanic hit icebergs in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean. Yeah. What I kind of just... what kind of current was in that late in that water, though? I mean, it's... River it's good uh, current. Uh, uh, that's uh, a river 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 current, bro. It is? Okay. I don't yeah. Oh, yeah. Good. Yeah. Yeah. It's a pretty what, good uh, current. It's pulling you straight I, into what, the rocks. What, what river tight. is it? Freaking! That's crazy. I, I just find it inch. weird that the I just find it weird that the mayor um the, I I think it was the mayor that they were just asking the media to not like share the video because it's traumatizing like don't yeah, share the video bro. no more don't yeah don't share the video no more that that yeah you know you can't say that shit now bro like that's already suspect when you're you don't want people to look at it to look at an examine shit now everybody's gonna go through that frame by that's frame by gone. frame. Just like they did with whatever they found <laughs> over Alaska, claiming they it's were just either that aliens or yeah. Chinese Chinese spy ship or whatever the fuck. Yeah, I don't even know what the hell they shot out the sky. I feel like there's like so many just <laughs> weird little things going on. Like it's like okay, that ship thing happened, but like you had all these railroad accidents like that's been happening over the last two years. All these farms, like poultry farms and meat farms, that are getting fucking they're catching fire out of nowhere. Like a lot of them all over the place. It's too Wild it's fires. too much, bro. And then this P P this P Diddy thing. Let me tell. you. You, bro, it's a lot bigger than people are fucking saying. It's just, and they're all happening like now. It, it feels like all these things are related the war, the P. Diddy sex trafficking shit, the accidents. Like, it's all, I don't know, it's weird. It's bro. all distractions. Like, distractions. It's, all, it's a shell game. It's yep. the three shell game. It's the three cups in a shell. They're trying to distract you from what's really going on. That's what they fucking do best. Yeah, event yeah, after you know, event after event. Yeah. Yeah, because you know this is the election him. year, and he's already caught up in some bullshit, and so is the past one. So I'm just yeah, but you always you always you. notice an election, something always happens though. Yeah, always, there, there, never there fails. There is always something happening, but this shit is like a little like there's a lot of stuff happening. It's like yeah. there are things that happen, but this the last three years, it's not just this year. Like the last three years, there's been a lot of just crazy shit happening. It's a lot of shit happening. Yeah. 
I saw a video of fucking uh, Justin Bieber with P. Diddy, like somebody posted it when he was 15, bro. And he spent like, <laughs> P. Diddy was like, fucking, oh, he's going to spend two days with me. I got custody. His parents gave me custody for 48 hours. We're going to do everything a 15 year old dream of doing. And then you look at it, you're looking at it now, and it's like, oh my God, what the fuck did oh, that? He, got the fuck? he definitely got it. He gave <laughs> some and he got some that, 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 that weekend. That's crazy, bro. Yeah. And they're all in it. They're all a part of that. Like all those celebrities, bro, all of them, all of those people are in there. It is wild. We're looking bro. at Cat like, Williams is uh, like he's crazy, but no, bro, he's not crazy, bro. That's the one who spilled the beans, Cat Williams. Who spilled the beans. He's talking about Will Smith and somebody else, and Will Smith getting smashed. Mm-hmm. They want to make uh, you look it, crazy for saying. You know, it, hey, what you do in your own bedroom is fine, but when it's all yeah. a ball mm-hmm. and it's a mm-hmm. fucking power fucking thing, and there's money, and well, then see, there's uh, and then there's kids. Yeah. There's kids involved. Oh, that's you're it, bro. With the yeah, kids, yeah, yeah. okay. That's yeah. It, yeah. Bro. Um, yeah. When there's kids involved, you're done. Like if you yeah. want to be a freak on your own time, that's one sure. thing. Uh them getting caught, they wanted to get caught. That's part of the thrill. But when you involve kids, you're fucking done. That's it. Uh-huh. <laughs> crazy, bro. And she's crazy. Uh uh, I don't want to say anything else. <laughs> about how that's yep. cheers. Cheers. I don't want to hit this bag on the camera. I don't want to get Jimmy in trouble if I hit this bag. What is that? A condom? Oh, yeah. You know what it is, dog. It's the volcano. What is that? <laughs> volcano bag. Condom. That, that's the size Crippy wears. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh, my God, bro. <laughs> I want to be careful. Rob, warning, warning. Rob, Rob. Yeah. Longest, Please don't go that route. Volcano bag you've made. Over. Say what? Oh, the, it's the longest gonna be- bag that you've made. Oh, I didn't. So I haven't. I haven't customized it because you could buy the bag and make a bigger one. But I, I, I think the biggest one I've gotten is the extra large. It's like three, four, three feet or four feet, okay. something like that. I think. Okay. Yeah, but I, I haven't yeah. bought the one that I can make it. I could buy the one to make it and tie up both ends and make a, a ridiculous one. But I haven't done that yet. <laughs> Dude, that's well, you've done crazy, it. Bro. You've done it already. You've done oh that man, before? I used to hang. I used to hang a big vinyl tote that you get at Lowe's, full of the rock or whatever. I'd hang it in my backyard and light the volcano up, let it get good and toasty, and then crawl up in there and couldn't see anything. <laughs> oh, hey. like this. Get stoned as hell. Crawl Damn, up bro. under that thing and just be like, whoa. I try, to, t- I try yeah. to tell people for me, the volcano has been, I've, I had the volcano back in 2010 when I, like, before I got locked up, I had it and I sold it and I got it again a year ago. The volcano is the best thing. Like, I don't, I smoke a, a joint here and there. A blunt here and there, very rare, but it's mainly out of that, bro. Like, I don't even want to waste my time with anything because it's just pure and it's it's like a nice, pure, clean high, but you like really potent, but not yeah, so potent you, enough. That you do like when like you're blunt. not at home, though. What I'm when I'm not at the crib, honestly, bro. Like, bro, honestly, bro, I don't. I I maybe take a pen when I leave. I take a pen and I'll hit the pen, but I don't even do that, bro. I don't. I don't really do shit anymore when I drive and I go out, bro. I just. I just personally, I'm telling you, like, if I'm out, I go out. I'll smoke and get high before I leave, but I don't even take edibles. I don't, I might hit the pen, but I don't really, I just do shit with family. I just do what I got to do and shit. And then I smoke when I come back. Like I've gotten less dependent, like, like less caring about needing to smoke. Like I don't even work, smoke when I wake up, I I wake up, I work and shit. And then when I'm done at four 35, but then I fucking like when I'm up at the end of the day, then I smoke and it feels good. You know, last time time the sheriff pulled me over, he says, you got any guns or drugs in the fucking car? (laughs) Well, one out of two. (laughs) <laughs> I, don't <wanna> <laughs> I don't carry any kind of fucking paraphernalia. I don't take a joint. I don't. Nope. Fucking no, it ain't car. worth a headache. Well, I mean, okay, okay. Did, you could hear because I have the card and I could. I have to get. But it ain't yeah, do you have to get an emergency stonage? You don't have to do that. Like, there's no, there's, it's like, oh man, you know, like mm-hmm. if I just had some weed, then I could do these things. Like, no, just fucking get high and then go do yeah. shit. Man, I ain't been, I ain't been high for like a month and a half, man. Oh fuck! Oh, well, that's what happens. I'm sorry for your loss. It is part of the problem, but you know, I'll deal. <laughs> I'm waiting on my new bag. You're stopping. You're stopping permanently, or you're just doing like a break. It, you know, it's just a, it's just a thing. You know, freaking mm-hmm. thing you. that happened. You know, got you. Yeah, I'm working to get my medical card say, here. Well, that's the thing. I don't. I don't. I'm dodging getting the card. So freaking. 
Don't get the card. I want, I, yeah. I want don't the do card. It. Yeah. I don't, I don't, don't want to get be the on The card list. doesn't give you any privileges. It doesn't get you out of fucking jail for you. Nope. Shit, shit. Yeah. It puts it's, you on I'm, a fucking list. It puts yeah, exactly. It puts you on the list. I'm already of, on a fucking it, list. Listen, no, but well, it puts you on a list. I'm on a list too. That's what I tell I people. But I don't, don't want to be on list, another bro. list, okay? I don't want to be on another <laughs> list. And um, you look like you're you know, on the list the already. Thing, if you got a driver's <laughs> license, you got on the list, dog. I know, but <laughs> well, you're on the list. Look at that's you. A, but that's just. <laughs> but that's just. I don't. That's another. Just another list. I don't want to be on. Okay. Nope. Look at. Freaking, you're on the do not fly list. You're on all of them. No, I'm not. But freaking, I don't want to be on that list because you know it's just another freaking thing. You know, freaking. My mom sent me this I shit. <laughs> I don't want to deal with. Oh, that's cool. And, and all the all the all that Little list. Skinny. You know, you can't even name three Leonard Skinner songs. Yeah, but all, oh, that's, all that, that's all sweet that gives you. Oh my God! Come on now, bro. I can all name that, two. <laughs> all, that, all that having a medical card gives you is the right to buy overpriced. Don't we just grippy on music knowledge? You can walk into a fucking business and buy pot. Overpriced and pay pot more than you would yeah. if you had a hookup. Every overpriced. Yeah, we always well, knew we had the weed. That's we why. I, yeah, but see here for me, thanks to my therapist. It, it's my get out of jail free card. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I understand. Okay, but you can't Trust buy me, gun anymore. You can't buy a gun anymore. I'm already where I can't buy a gun because I'm a crazy psycho. Here's the thing with that, Uncle Surf. Here's the Horrified thing with that, right? That, so you could. You know. So here's the thing with that. Actually, and I I know because a lot of people ask me that. So at least in Florida, the head of the the the, the person who was in charge of the Department of Agriculture, she. Oh, yeah. Is like an advocate, like a big cannabis advocate. I think you she got why? her license, but she almost had her concealed weapons. But this is the thing: you you technically aren't sub when you have a card, like when you when you buy the gun, right? And you fill out the do the background check and everything, and they ask you. I think they I think the question is: Are you using? Are you like using? Are you drugs, addicted? Right? Are you and addicted? I'm not gonna say I am. Yeah, I'm not gonna <laughs> say I am. Obviously, I smoke everything, but I'm so, not gonna say I am. But so, the so card doesn't prevent you from. Uh, the card doesn't prevent you from doing it in Florida, though. You can have a medical card and have your well. You don't even need a concealed weapons anymore because it's open. It's constitutional That's carry now, but yeah. what? No, no, it's but, not open carry. It's concealed. But, yeah, it's got to be concealed carry. You just don't need what that. Happens, what happens? What happens when you get caught with a gun carry. and a bag of pot? <laughs> No, 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 you can't. No, 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 for sure. You can't get caught with a, you're not, it's because you're not, yeah, that's the different thing. But yeah, that's when you get caught so, with it. But you can have the card. You can have be an active medical card holder and you can still go buy the gun. It's all a matter of don't get yeah, caught with the fucking in gun. Texas, but, well, but, if, but if the cops in, come in, in Texas, your house, scary you're, out of 49. you're still committing yeah. a felony, dude. Freaking yeah. Yeah, 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 you are if you do it. Yeah. The scary go. thing in Texas, yeah. so um, uh, uh, THCA is legal and Delta 9 and 8 and 10 and all that shit is still legal. But, um, if you're caught with like street weed and you have a uh, a firearm on you, they consider the firearm is there to protect your stash. So that's like a double felony. Oh, well, just, that's Texas, yeah. bro. Yeah. yeah, yeah bro. I'm, I'm Guns and drugs, man. Freaking, you know? Yeah. You're a dealer. I'm, in, up. Yeah. <laughs> I'm in Texas. So us having a medical card for what we can get for here medically. They have a medical yeah. card in Texas now? It's medical? Uh, yeah. Yeah, uh, but it's only, they're, only medical, they're... but it's like in different. If it's it's not it's not statewide, but yes, oh. the state allowed it, but it's by county by county. Yeah. Oh yeah. shit! Okay, that's crazy. I don't know. Yeah, that. and there's only seven right. things medically on the list that you can get it for, and luckily they added PTSD and something oh, else. Man. So I'm getting it for that. Yeah, anyone anyone with a disability can get a medical card. Please. Not in Texas. They have a so, certain list, and you can only get it yeah. with those certain things. But but still, you're on a list, uh, as we were saying. Yeah. And uh, what concerns uh -huh. me is that crazy bitch that got off because she was fucking high off two bong rips and killed her fucking boyfriend. When that's like, that's what scares what? me. Is that, well, when they let her go, that tells me they're going to try to say that it's free for madness all over again. Yep. Oh no! It oh, is. They, they they can't control themselves. See, yeah. that that's some <clears throat> fucked up shit. See, but they that's where that, that that's can't what... be the real reason why they let her go. But uh -uh, yeah. there's more to that uh, case. Yeah. But see, this is my socialization. I'll be right back. Yep. This is my yes, socialization. Sir. I don't fuck with nobody around here. So mm. as long as you leave me the fuck alone, shit, we have no issues. This is the most <laughs> social I get. <laughs> and I ain't nowhere near none of y'all, so <laughs> I'm good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, I feel you. Well, uh, 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 for the record, Lady C, I do love you, so we're cool. <laughs> yeah, I'm cool with everybody. I'm a fool. Like, <laughs> don't 
don't doubt my integrity and we have no issues. <laughs> you tell him. Remember, you're a psycho bitch. <laughs> I'm a psycho motherfucker. You, you cross me and I'm usually cool and laid back unless you cross me. You wake up, you wake, you you, what, you, you wake up like that, that you wake up like that, Lady C? Every day. I'm uh, fucking with you. I wake like, up fuck every day. Me. Fuck with me. Uh, <laughs> it's it's <laughs> fuck with me and find out. Tell him, Lady C. I can't yeah, wait for a motherfucker to try. Fucking find out. I'm not fucking around to find out, bitch. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Everybody yeah. will tell you. Everybody will tell you that. I'm cool laid back until you piss me off and look out. <laughs> well, you know what? Uh, 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 you remind me a lot of the way you said that. You remind me a lot of my uh, second mothers, if you will. You know what I mean? All, all my neighborhood mothers. Yeah. It's like, uh-huh. uh, oh, they're sweet as fuck, but fuck around with them and see how that works out. <laughs> exactly. I'm, I'm Gen X. Don't, don't fuck around and find out. We don't play. <laughs> 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 I love everybody until you cross that line. I'm friendly with everybody. <laughs> I haven't been to the um I haven't been to the dispensary, but I got my card and I renew it and shit just to have it. Just I don't even know why, just to have it, but I don't go anymore, bro. Ever since I fucking mm-hmm. yeah. I was chilling with you in 420 and shit, I learned the shit, bro, and I don't I don't never go, bro. And I got I get fired out, bro. Are you growing fire, dog? Been doing it for like you a year got- and a half. Mephisto, I, go to, I, I get it from Mephisto. I just get autos from Mephisto. Fams, I got right now. Oh. I get. It. I don't do it like that because it's like, bro, I'm not. It's not like. Oh. I do it for quick for just for myself, so it's it's better than going to the dispensary. But it's fire, bro. It comes out like I had my first run. You know, it was not good. The second run was like I had a couple that came out good, and the other ones were whatever. I've tried it in the closet. I I I got it, but I got two tents now, and I got a two by four, and I the last three have been fire bro like what you would want like what you would want to buy on the street from the dispensary like that it comes out oh, like yeah. that and i found the schedule like the i got i got everything down dog like i learned it and i i just repeat it like now i don't even i was babying it so much in the beginning and i realized like oh my god bro it's fucking unnecessary all the shit that i was doing overfeeding it yeah <laughs> yeah oh, but it's okay. good now now, yeah, now so i know what i'm doing so. want some cow doo-doo in there and chicken doo-doo and uh-huh the next step is the uh, is the hydroponics. I want to learn how to start doing that and get into breeding and all that shit. But that's when they change the laws, bro. Like, no, hey, it's if not, you want a good, if you want a not, recommendation you know. to get good seeds that are damn near every one of them comes around. Sensible seeds. They're out of Spain. Sensible and, seeds. Yeah, sensible seeds. I've got strains from there that are thirty eight percent. Thirty eight percent. Thirty eight percent. They rock your fucking socks off. Oh, like, shit. Like this, this is some of the shit that I got now. I don't know if I can, if I can. Let me see. This is Ghost Tooth. Uh, I, I get, I'm getting everything from gen, uh, Mephisto Genetics now because I was getting it from. Okay. I tried some from I forgot what company. Um, I don't know I what stage company. you were at, man, but uh, the shit that you had when we were in Florida was just boss, dude. It was already good. But um, I fucking yeah, the shit is now it's like it comes out fire, bro. The nugs like I was, you know, the first time shit came out larfy, and I figured that like, oh, I'm I'm cutting it too uh, early. I'm doing this, I'm doing that, and, like naturally, like just trial and error, trial and error. But now it's like the buds come out fat, hard. I I time the drying perfectly. Like I I put it in my bathroom, bro, and I put the the I I, I leave it in my bathroom with the lights off for a couple weeks with the fan on, and that shit's at like I keep it at like sixty or no, I keep it at like. 50 between 55 highest like 60 degrees but or no no i keep it at like 65 degrees in the bathroom like around 65 in there 65 the highest sort of goes like 69 but i keep it around there in the humidity around 45 when it's drying out over yeah. 50 to 45 like i bring it down i think i think that's what i do and then i bro i just like i don't know i don't, I don't even measure shit anymore just like you just know what what it is it's now oh, i yeah, understand it's like you after you do it a few times you like yeah you're learning you're learning the plant yeah 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 it's crazy it's crazy exactly, how it works yeah. bro it's crazy how it works. This is the uh, shit I, I have. Uh, you can't really see Ooh, it, like that's now, pretty. But, but it's fire, dog. Well, you know, it's nice and, and crystally that, and fat. You just yeah. Is that indigo or sativa? This uh, this is an indica. This uh, this is ghost tooth from. Uh, yes, I love being in the couch. Keeps me out of trouble. It's uh, <laughs> you can't really see it. You can't really tell, dog. But it's fucking. Uh, you see, I like the hybrid. <laughs> you know, a little of this, little of that. Oh yeah, that's red word. Yes, good seventy thirty on the indica heavy. 
That's a good one. That... These are between 25 and 30%, I would say. They're between 25 and 30, <laughs> I think, from what the... I like being in the couch. That's safe for me. <laughs> and I always... What I do now is I do three sativa, three indica. Um, I just do six every time, and I get a decent amount. I'm getting now... Like, before, I was getting maybe a, an O from each plant, but now they're growing a lot. Like, bro, I, I didn't train them before... I was cropping it. Now I don't crop them at all. I just train them. I just, I just put the, I buy the, um, those blue clips and I put the blue clips on everything and then I take them off little by little and then I tie them down with a tie at a certain stage and I put the little twist tie. But now they grow fucking tall and I get like at least two and a half, three from them from the from the plants instead of like one. Yeah. So, so, so like, is, is it the same over. plants, or or you're like regrowing and uh, starting the process over again? New seed uh, every time. New seed, new seed every time with this. Like I reuse the soil okay. too. Like I can re, I reuse the soil and shit, okay. but it's just I got soil in there, and then I just put a new seed every time. And the way I do it now, I did all the, the germination a bunch of different ways, but I prefer to just put it in the fucking ground. I put some mycorrhizae in there, the great white, and the dirt. I put the seed in there. I cover it up, and then I just water it and let it come. You know, let it germinate in there and come out from there. And that's been to me like the best way. I feel like just putting it in there, doing it from there. It takes like three oh, yeah. days, and that's it. Fuck, Mike, it is not the third best weed channel. You know, come on, man. Come on. <laughs> this ain't a weed channel. We're just about Damn it. Yeah. Damn it. <laughs> it's perfect. Hey, I get it right. We're not, we're we're not just showing about any things. marijuana growing. No one's no, no one's showing is... off. Uh uh-uh, uh, this yeah. is group oh. therapy, and we're talking about medicine. It's all about how you word it. The VA is my medical records, which is my that follows me wherever go. The VA says, oh, <laughs> patients' marijuana usage, dosage, anytime. <laughs> That's anytime. what my therapist told me to do. Once I was able to buy the volcano, I bought it again because I didn't want I want to vape. I don't want to keep smoking, bro. That's the thing. I was smoking like uh the you know blunts and joints, but even then it's still you know I just the combustion aspect of it. Like now I'm just vaping it is different. Yeah, still in the lungs. And freaking Grawl says <laughs> I got to go back in the chat here a bit. Grawl says I piss off all my hippie friends. Hey, remember it was about f the man. Man, f the man, man in the environment, right? Now it's <laughs> plastic, every plastic containers everywhere, right? And the hippies are still pissed yeah. at that, but well, they nobody the ones, can, they nobody were the can ones go anywhere. That, nobody can remember. go anywhere without a fucking plastic bottle of water or a cup right. of goddamn right. five dollar right. right. Starbucks but, overpriced fucking. But remember, these same fucking hippies, these same motherfucking hippies are the ones that cried about the fucking trees and brought about all this fucking <laughs> plastic, okay. <laughs> Yeah, and <laughs> those same hippies are in Washington D.C. Well, the old they, motherfuckers, yeah. oh uh, hippies, uh, Uncle Sir. Uh, uh, th- so this pisses me off. Um, so there's a company they claim to be uh, Texas since like 2000 whatever, and it's called H T T E A O. So oh, yeah. like H two O, but H T O. Um, oh my god, they have a fucking line that goes out to the fucking street blocking traffic, and yeah. it's all some fucking bougie ass fucking California fucking what are you they know selling? uh spice tea well, crap. Well, you know, freaking what are they selling? Cunts are everywhere. Just tea. All they sell is tea and cookies. That's all they yeah. sell. Cunts are everywhere, dude. Trust me. Freaking and, Yeah. Yeah. Um, you know what's freaking, really popular? Oh I, oh, oh, oh. I got I got a freaking super chat from fucking Woody. Woo, Woody, cheers, buddy. Cheers, cheers Woody. Oh, Woody's cheers, been digging buddy. around his. He's cheers. been digging around the seats of his truck. Uh-huh. <laughs> Woo! What's uh popular down here? I don't know about where y'all are at, but what's they got a lot of here now are cava bars, where they sell kratom and cava. You guys are familiar with that? Yeah. Uh, uh, Jesus that's actually started. Uh, okay, first of that all, that is I'm, starting I'm, here. I'm, I am true blood Texan. If you ain't read me, I don't want nothing to do with you. No, no, no. So what it is is it's like a it's like a tea, right? Well, the two they're two different types of teas, but they're in the coffee family. And then some people compare them to opiates because a lot of people who are who are addicts and are trying to get off the drug, they they turn to that and drink that because it does give you a it, it, it's like to me it makes me it, it could feel like you're like a little you're a little bit whited out or on Percocet or something mm-hmm. like similar depending on which one you take. Some make Mike, you feel very relaxed, but Mike, it's a natural Mike. tea. Mike's got a good idea. We should start growing opium. Fucking sounds like 
That's brilliant. Fuck it, dude. Let's go. What Where's the, the feed? Some Ozark the feed, shit, Mike. <laughs> some some Ozark <laughs> shit. Remember? Oh, my God. <laughs> history is that? repeating itself. So. I'd, I'd I'd rather smoke the opium. Okay, freaking no. Uh, no. Oh yeah, opium is actually pretty no. good. Uh, uh, I tried it. Uh, don't I get shit that. done. I don't no, want to get shit I, done. That's the with, point. With opium, uh, <laughs> opium. I, I, I couldn't understand. Done. How can you be addicted to opium? Like it just feels good. Like I don't get the addiction. Yeah, yeah. The, thing, uh, the addiction I would say happens when you don't fucking handle your business. Now, if you're not handling your business, then you're not. Yeah, then you're got a problem. Okay. That's it. That's all it is, bro. Well, you want the yeah, opium? That, that makes sense. Gonna, you ain't gonna be handling your business. <laughs> Yeah, if you're not going to be handling like your this. business, and that's it. I look at it like this. We're all humans on this earth dealing with our own everyday struggles. And whatever yeah. we need to do to get through the day is what we got to do. I'm pretty yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah. You can't you know handle what? nobody. If you, you know got what? a crush and I got a crush and it ain't the same thing, then it is what it is. Whatever it is we got to do to get through the day. That's Mike, what it is. Mike, if, I didn't have to to, if I didn't have to go to Columbia to get the coca plant, okay, or Mexico... Freaking, you can order you know, that shit online. Shit, what you talking you about? You ain't getting no coca plant online. What? Uh, dark web, motherfucker. Check it out. What? I don't want to. I, I, I ain't getting on no dark, dark web. web. Check it out. But I mean, you can. You can send it to I'm me. Just, I'm, mm-hmm. I'm not into that shit, but I'm just saying. Yeah, I'm There's just saying. There's ways to get it. Uh, you can get anything you want on the dark web. Anything. Uh-huh. Be surprised. Body parts. And my homeboy. Anything. My homeboy. Well, he's a private <laughs> investigator, but he showed me the. He got on the dark web with me. I went to script and he showed me the dark web. I'm like, fuck, dog. This is crazy. Yeah, you don't just. You don't just, you don't just access that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You, you got to know people. Know people. Know people to get that kind of shit. Well, yeah, yeah. Well, <laughs> you, you got to find the right portal. But yeah. Yeah. Like, my yeah. point exactly. Carry <laughs> in. Carry in. I carry in. <laughs> It's all about, you know, that just agree the people thing. (laughs) You got to know the right people. (laughs) That's the right connection. (laughs) Grohl's got it right. You can order it, but it'll be delivered by uh, Department of Homeland Security in the ATF. Uh (laughs) Yeah, I'm I'm more like, I just woke up. Make sure I ain't got no Starbucks. I'm like, I just woke up. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> hey, y'all, I gotta, Come I gotta, on, I gotta fucking brother. jump off, bro. I gotta fucking wake up in the morning, but I gotta, I gotta hit it. All right, all right Rob. Thanks for having I me, up, Jimmy. Night. Good night. Yeah, have a good one. All right. Good night, everybody. Have a good one. Yeah. Peace. Right, good night. Good night. Surf, Rez, fucking uh, five six two, Teresa, Woody. <laughs> Later. Bye, Kirby. Right, uh huh. There we go. Forbin says, I worked for a cooking show 20 years ago, and comedy <laughs> were being introduced from Hawaii. Mostly just makes you sleepy. Mm-hmm. I don't know. Never heard of it. But a diff- uh, co- Hawaii grows a lot of coffee. Mm-hmm. And coffee is one of the processed coffees. You, uh, it's like an instant coffee. When I had it, it was an oh. instant coffee, like Folgers. Okay. okay. The good stuff. I, like I could finish a whole pie and fall right back What's to that, sleep um, like nothing. <laughs> What's oh, that, yeah. Um, I, I drank coffee Nescafe. in the Nesc- I love Nescafe. It's expensive as I, fuck, though. Uh, yeah. I drank they coffee in the morning to wake up, and I drank coffee to go to just sleep. Saying. I just had a Starbucks. Just a, as a matter of fact, I just had a frappe hey, just a couple hours hey, ago. I'm the, guy, I'm the guy that coffee usually freaking keeps up wide awake, right? But I was so tired today because oh. at, at lunch... I had I had three cups of coffee at lunch, okay, and freaking and when we came I came home and I fucking you saw me making that video, freaking I was trashed, I was beat. I actually <laughs> Jimmy couldn't even talk. I saw that one. <laughs> like, I was like fucking. I was like fuck, man, boom, and that's after three cups of coffee, man. It didn't. It I was so yeah. so beat. I was fucking just done. Mm-hmm. Well, like uh, in, in, in the morning, in, in the morning. Uh, yeah. Sorry. I buy mine at 25 pounds a bag beans. And I got yeah. 50 pounds oh, nice. sitting over here waiting yeah. to get roasted. I do the I do my own roast and my own mm-hmm. grind. It's all good, carry in. Y'all oh, yeah, very good. Good drugs I don't resell it. I, I mean, don't resell what I do. All the plants my coffee. Have uh-huh. you tried setting fire to just to see if it has an effect? Dude, yes. the science has yes. already been done, Mike. You don't have to fucking reinvent the wheel. Motherfuckers <laughs> already done it. You know? Why do you think we knew to smoke coffee? Other motherfuckers <laughs> already did it. <laughs> All right? 
If we're not Hello, the first man. set of fucking potheads on the planet, you know, Mike. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, he's been smoking it, twisting it, using it for ropes right. and sails uh, and fucking how religious. Been done. You know the how wars. Do you, how do you, you think? Know the how wars. do you think? Man, check out the wars. Things. Check. Look up marijuana wars, and not just this fucking oh, war yeah, that, that, on yeah, drugs, but the way. marijuana wars that they used to fight for yeah. marijuana. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. Wars between nations. Yeah. Come for on, marijuana. Man. Yeah, it's insane, man. Uh, just, <laughs> uh, it, it's a great rope. It's a great uh, shirt. It's a great uh, medicine. It's a great balm. And, mm -hmm. and so you have to ask yourself, why is it illegal? If it does yeah. everything so good, why is it illegal? Well, it's, it's illegal it's really because weird, man. it's because they were, you know, after prohibition, they needed something else to cry about. Okay, <laughs> maybe okay. you're right, Jimmy. C. No, it's, it know, is. Man. It is, yeah. dude. It is okay. In freaking, you know, they wanted to leave it all. Just you know, there's a lot of there's a lot of political reasons for it. It's all political, political. and big money. Well, uh, I, I do know. remember uh, there was a Navy admiral that made hemp illegal. Uh, he, he like pushed it in the Congress uh, back before World War II because uh, uh, he he wanted a better uh, what is it? Uh, Are you talking uh, about Harry Anslinger? Anslinger? That sounds right. That sounds right. That got it done. That sounds <laughs> right. Anslinger's the guy that got fucking marijuana fucking banned because well, the, oh oh Anslinger was he, and, was he an admiral? Was he an admiral in the Navy? I don't remember his background. I don't know if he was, but he was big friends with the uh, publisher at the time, the New York, the new, the newspaper guy uh, up in California, Hearst. It, it sounds like Hearst. Hearst didn't want the marijuana plants around because then his lumber business would get ruined. There was a bunch of different factors in it, but yeah, very yeah. Jerry in, in the was the motherfucker that got it. Goddamn, yeah. In the rope so, factory, uh, the, the hemp, the hemp was a big thing too. They didn't, you know, freaking. It was all political. Yeah, uh, the the one that political. I heard was that a a, a Navy admiral um, was a uh, kind of a uh, involved in a uh, uh, what is it jute? Uh, what what do they make the the ropes out of now? Yeah, uh, but he was involved in that business, and so he went to Congress to uh, make sure that hemp was out, and yeah. uh, everybody in the Navy, that's everyone in the Navy yeah, was like, "Fuck it. that! That's like hemp is it. the best rope." That's part of it. Terry yeah. Burden, what's up, Terry? Good to see you, man. The uh, the Manila hemp rope, some of the best in the world. They, yeah, There's yeah. I, I, I've only thing. heard. I've never experienced, but I've only yeah. heard. That's the, a Manila rope, Manila hemp rope. And you got to have rope on a boat. You got to have. Yeah, for a rope, rope. The bigger the rope. Damn. Dude, um, so uh, we have a canoe, and uh, uh, we only have little bitty man-made lakes around here. So you know, no one's gonna drown, you know. <laughs> but <laughs> yeah, right. And, and 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 so, well, well, I I know I know what you're talking about, Uncle Surf. But so uh, we got the uh, cheap ass ropes, and you weigh your anchor, and it sets, and then you feel it like oh. <laughs> like stretch a little bit further. <laughs> Yeah, nobody ever died. Nobody ever drowns on those little farm ponds. Yeah, no one ever, yeah. especially not. Uh, yeah. Well, never mind. I don't want to go there. But <laughs> damn, you you'd be surprised what gets done in Texas in the small town that people think we're too slow and don't know what's going on. <laughs> you have no idea. Try that in a small town. See how far you make it down the road. No. Right. Exactly. <laughs> Hey, us Texans are pretty badass, okay? Yeah. Yes, we are, girl. I'm going to yes. 244 yes. people. That's our town, 244 people. Wow. We got a bank, seven churches, two gas stations, a liquor store, a, a burger wagon, what, a roach coach that's set up permanently, <laughs> mm -hmm. and uh, a restaurant that opened up without a liquor license right next to a church. Like they spent money redoing this building. I mean, they dumped so much money in this place and then they didn't get their liquor license. 
So now they're trying to sell food in a town oh. with 244 fucking people. Uh-huh. That sucks. In my county, in the two main cities, together, there's probably about 300 uh, 300,000 people here. <laughs> where I met. Okay. Whenever I was on my little three year adventure where I was in South Carolina, whenever I got there, I asked how many people was in that town. They said 68. Yeah. And they were wondering why it was such a shock for me. Are you serious? Going from 300,000 to 68? Are you serious? Really? It's a bit of a change. I went yeah. from 20 million to 244. And I well, come back, and now we are a suburb of Dallas. We are a suburb of Dallas now. Uh huh. You were which before. Is, <laughs> yeah, which is weird. We've been a small nowhere town for a long ass time. It just so happens we're in the president from here. Yeah. Uh, yeah. See, but, uh, around here, like a uh, uh, we live in San Antonio, so it's a. Big ass bustling city, nothing like uh, Houston or Dallas or Austin, but uh, we're still a bustling city. But if you drive just ten minutes that way, <laughs> you know, <laughs> yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. by straight too, exactly. A bunch yeah. of stupid. the stupid runs deep around here. Trust me when I t- and I let people around. I I don't hold back. Oh, when I know you're dumb, fuck. I make sure to remind you. Everybody knows, including you. Yeah. Oh, this stupid runs deep out here. It just fucking amazes me. Uh, Same here in El Paso. Same here where I'm at. Oh, you're in El Paso, (laughs) Teresa? Yeah, I'm in El Paso. No shit. My Teresa, right next to me, is also a native of El Paso. (laughs) And grow. She's coming to say hello. A bunch of people is called a cult. <laughs> <laughs> Come on down. I was in a cult. Say hi to your yeah. sister. I got brainwashed. Cult of personality. <laughs> I was too. I was once a member of the freaking. Oh, the I'm Catholic not talking church. about the church. I'm not talking I, about Catholics. Me and you. Oh, you me were in. The, you were in. So the how long? How long have you all been in El Paso? The Marines is another cult. Uh, two years ago, three years ago, two years ago. Talk about a cult of fucking death. Yeah, I was there mm. till '97, and I moved here, and then I went uh-huh. back and forth a lot of times to visit my grandmother. Mm. My bestie is still out there. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Mm. Yeah, uh, 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 game I, bigger and bigger over here. here. I've been stuck here my whole life. Uh, what do you say? It's getting bigger and bigger over it here. Yeah. I'm in the other anywhere. I'm in the other part of the state from y'all. I'm on the Texas Oklahoma border, an hour north of Dallas. Oh wow! Okay. That should kind of give y'all an idea. Yeah, then Russell's in Houston, (laughs) so then we got the state covered almost. Yeah. Yeah. You know what's funny is in all these channels, we don't have any Austinites. No, not a single one. Already weird. That's weird. That's (laughs) curious. What do the Austinites do? Oh, I could get someone up here that's from Austin. The South by Southwest. That's what they do. The South by Southwest. We could ask them. Don't they go to the Riverwalk and... No, the Riverwalk's in San San Antonio Antonio right here. That's in San Antonio. That's true. That's true. Austin is our capital. And it's an hour and a half away from San Antonio, depending on how fast you drive. Yeah. It, It could be 30 minutes if you're good. (laughs) <laughs> Unless there's a lot of construction, then it's two and a half hours. Oh, there's always <laughs> construction unless, over here. Oh my unless god! Unless you yes. know the back roads. Unless you know the back roads. That's also true. Yes, that's no. Uh, I, when I get through, to, I Where go through see? Texas. I don't even want to stop for fucking gas. I want to, and that's not possible because the route. Yeah, you can't uh, do it. Uh, Texas uh, is well, way too big for that. Okay. They had Where a family member that came in from the I think Colorado. Yeah, and then they had to stop, and they had a they had rented a vehicle, but it was electric vehicle, so they had to stop somewhere and power up. Yeah, yeah. Uh, she, yeah. And, and she straight up on board with the e vehicle thing, but she was like, "Dude, we got down the road and we were fucking terrified. Like, where are we gonna fucking <laughs> charge up?" Uh-huh. Yeah, mm-hmm. and the Bucky's one time when we drove through, 
they all the charging stations were broken or in use. It's like, mm -hmm. man, thank God for gas. Yeah, the EV is great for local driving. Yeah, yeah. Well, see, and that's the thing, Jimmy. See, is that uh, I'm all for the electric vehicles. It's mm -hmm. just uh, we're not ready for. Uh, yeah, we're not ready for all of it to be electric. That's all. No. Nope. Uh -uh. Because from where not yet. where from where I'm at to even get to where they are, it takes six hours. Besides that, to yeah. get to where Teresa's at, it would take me eight to ten hours. Mm -hmm. right. you, yeah. would, you would handicap the shipping, the trucking industry. Trucking. Completely. You know, you would never it take, you know, you take your, it takes a while to get your shit from Amazon now. Trucking, yeah. Uh, uh -huh. That's true. And we have a warehouse now. like right by us mm -hmm. too. It's crazy. Wait to that, wait till that guy's got a freaking, you know, stop freaking every couple hours to charge up for an hour, you know, so you mm -hmm. go another 20 minutes, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Shit, charge for an hour. They say it's three hours. Yeah, yeah, and that's it's like crazy. Using gas, driving from San Antonio to El Paso, I usually stop every two to three hours. Junction to Sonora, yeah. Azuna. Uh huh. Yeah, well, it, 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 is, you know, that's the that's the killer though, and that's that's always been the drawback to electric cars from day one. Remember, they made the electric cars back in the fucking thirties. All right. Yeah, and the problem was. The freaking, you can't go far enough, long enough. Same uh -uh. shit. Nope. Uh -uh. They're great. Not well, see, uh, uh, I'm still yeah. down with uh, 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 tag team truck drivers. Like, you know, one guy drives 12 hours, the next guy drives 12 hours. Let's go. You know? <laughs> There's nothing wrong with that. They do the, the they've been part. doing that for years, dude. Hot shots. <laughs> yeah. You know, that's what team driving's all about. Right. Like it killed me because that's what I wanted to do for, you know, when I when I couldn't be a mover no more. I wanted to freaking grab, you know, get the old lady a CDL and us, her and I just go fucking team driving across the country for the rest of our lives. But no, nope, they took my CDL, yeah. so got to play B. <laughs> they regulate it so hard. You, you get into access, it's not even your fault, and you get revoked. It's crazy. Well, the accident, they ain't worried about the eyes. Medical. Medical is the reason I don't have it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. They you got, you got a heart condition. They take, your, they take your medical card. Jeez. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's where my dad never got his uh, pilot's license back because uh, he had uh, agoraphobia and anxiety. So, um, so once you're a pilot, you're a pilot for life. Right. But you still have to pass your medical. Yeah, you got so to pass your physicals. Like, yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. So he was afraid yeah. if he failed that, he would lose it. So he just never went back, you know? Oh. Hey, Grohl, uh, Grohl says, they just did a test of, of, took a top EV, drove them from Denver to Cheyenne, Wyoming, Wyoming, Wyoming. Wyoming. until dead. The Silverado actually got the mileage you claimed. All right. Wow. How long did it oh. take to do it, though? How I many mean, stops did they have to make? Yeah. Uh huh. Now, what's that? What's that drive? How long did it take to charge the fucker mm -hmm. when they got into the charging station? That's what I meant. How uh -huh. long? How long did it take to get from point A to point B? Oh, ground. What's now the get weather a like bro. when they did it? Come on. And, and, and then, and then, what does it take to do that in a freaking gas power car? Mm -hmm. uh, well, I, I know love for, uh, I love you, hubby, but now you gotta verify. <laughs> well, I know for a fact, back whenever I was in my twenties, me and a few friends went to go visit a friend here locally that lived out at the lake, and he went home. He was in another. He was in Oklahoma visiting his mom, and his dad mm -hmm. gave us gas money to go pick him up. Well, we got lost on the back roads after we got him. We got there just fine, no problem, and then. When we got there, I was too fucked up to drive, so I let somebody else drive. <laughs> Whenever I woke up the next morning, we were in South Dakota. We, I, I didn't tired. even know that we were. Oh, yeah, shit. we. Uh, yeah, I woke up the next morning. Were you we drinking? Twenty. <laughs> I was fucked up. Mad Dog Twenty Twenty, and his mama gave me wine. So yeah, I was oh, really fucked up. And Ooh. I have I've been medicating. We'll say. So, yeah, I was a little too fucked up. So I let somebody else drive. Uh, I woke up the next morning. We were parked at some store, and I didn't recognize the surroundings. So I'm like, where the fuck are we at? And I go in to use uh, the bathroom, and I asked the person, 
I'm like, excuse me, oh, man, where are we at? They were like, you're in South Dakota. I said, hold the fuck up. I went out to the car full of people. I said, um, where did we make a wrong yeah. turn at? Mm-hmm. <laughs> because of <laughs> and, and hold were... on, hold on, no, you see, freaking, I got to jump in for a second here. Well, it's well, I just because I just looked it up. The the from Denver to Cheyenne is only a hundred miles, so it's only an hour and a half travel. Okay, so freaking. That's no big deal. We understand that the car can go an hour and a half. That's fucking gravy. It's it's the it's the fucking drive across the country. Okay. Well, he did say that they they did a loop, so until it died, but yeah, I didn't get looping, to read how many looping. loops they did. Yeah, they drove around until the thing fucking fell apart or, or ran out rather. I understand, but it's like it's were like they, come on, be real. Were they towing anything? <laughs> yeah. Or were they driving yeah. it like somebody's Daily driver makes a difference. I don't know. All I know is whenever I found out where we were, we had to call his dad for gas money, and he sent his gas money to come back home. So yeah, and I drove all the way back. I'm like, fuck y'all, we ain't getting lost. Shit, yeah, that's, <laughs> that's <laughs> crazy. Just because just I, because it got the mileage that they're claiming don't mean dick. You know, mm-hmm. I mean, it's it's the charging in between those miles. <laughs> Yeah, there's a reason why I call my channel uh, what I call it. <laughs> it. You know, it takes it takes five minutes to fill up a fucking tank of gas. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. In a big truck, it might take ten. Okay, but <laughs> takes me a little longer on the number. Oh, we all know the corn mm-hmm. gas is junk. They'll tell you right off the top. It, it fucking it, um, ethanol oh. has less uh, BTUs, man. Premium gas. That's everything from the freaking chainsaw, the weed eater, to the fucking Hummer, to the boats, the uh, tractors. It's all. I think, I think some of them premium gases even have some fucking corn in it. Nope. Ethanol free. Says so on the pump, and I know the guy that owns the station. If it says so on the pump, yeah. And but, but in the northeast, in the northeast, they say like Exxon and um Shell say that their 91 is ethanol free, but it doesn't say that on the pump. Okay. And and but they say it when you ask them. No, out here they gotta tell and you. I don't I, believe I don't believe them. The regular because, has the regular has that crap in it. I know, I know, I know. I'm out here in North Dakota. There, you can. There's pumps. They have right beside each other. You got fucking the ethanol over here yeah. and the non-ethanol over here. Yeah, are right next yeah. to each other. Freaking, and the and ethanol is that. usually on the regular gas, the unleaded regular. I haven't, I haven't put freaking unleaded. Uh, I haven't put ethanol in in that truck since uh, we got here. Because I know it's BS. Because it fucks you on your fuel mileage. Ooh. Ooh. The ones that the engines that hate it though is your small oh your small engines. Small engines just aren't yeah. meant to deal with it. No. That's why I run I used to run race gas in all my small engines. Oh. Was way, you know, it was way more pricey for the fuel, but I never had to worry about it, you know. Yep. I, I could, I could leave that fuel in that fucking tank for a fucking year, and it fired oh. right up. Yeah. <laughs> YouTube police twenty eight and twenty nine. What do you got? Oh, like twenty eight and twenty nine. Thank you, sir. YouTube even... police. Yeah. What? He's, he's, whoop, whoop. He, he used to be a cop. Police. <laughs> Piggy bacon. Mm. Start a pull. What? How, oh. why did I say that? How you doing, my man? Yeah, he's got a he's got a bunch of different channels, man. Freaking uh, good dude, though. He does uh does live stream on oh, no, on another channel. He does live stream and whatnot. He pokes up and live streams with this one though. 
I was like, no, two after Timmy. What, huh? Tiffany, what do you got? What did I miss? Unleaded is better. Premium is just Virgin more. That's BS. That's BS. The octane boost, the octane rating freaking is is uh, what we're talking about here, okay? Regular unleaded is 87 octane. Most most vehicles yeah. can run just fine on it. Fine but your, your higher performance when, engines need better fuel, okay? If you don't want knocking and pinging and bang, yeah, uh-huh. Trust me, I had a Cadillac that was designed to run on a high octane. And if you didn't put it in it, you knew that you didn't put it in it. What up, John Wiggs? Good to see you, man. Yep. Well, YouTube police is just another content creator. Uh-huh. Kind of. We lost more. We lost someone else. Who did we lose? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. The couple. Surf is still here and Rez is still here. They just got their cameras off at the moment. I'm mm -hmm. here. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Becca. What up, Becca? I think I said Hey Becca. Becca. You feel like Becca. Another Texan. Yes. Uh -huh. Yeah, uh, I went to go pee at dinner. Who what? I went to go pick at dinner. Oh, okay. Oh, got it. Yeah. Kong, so, uh, how many texts did we got here? We, yeah. uh, we, I'm counting four so far. Five. Who what? Becca's from Texas, too. Mm -hmm. Rock and roll. Yeah, Becca Mud Tramp. Yeah, she's an outdoor girl. So, uh, uh, in the Crippy Crew, um, we all try to get together in Texas. So it'd be kind of cool to have a Jimmy C get well, together in Texas. Well, she's she's moving to Arkansas. So. Premium gas will mm -hmm. have a bit of ethanol in it if you don't clear the hose of whoever pumped before you. Yeah, um, that's probably that's probably what fucked me. But Megan, Ozzy 12, got Kroger. What, huh? Don't, sorry. <laughs> what up, Megan? <laughs> okay, you yeah. gotta speak alien to introduce somebody. Okay. Yeah, 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 it's Doc Roger or what? I don't know. Freaking, but Megan, oh. Ozzy, good to see you. Thanks for coming in here. Appreciate you dropping in. Hopefully, you. Find some comedic value or at least some Kathy. therapeutic value from our like our shenanigans or buffoonery. Oh, um, yeah. Uh -huh. We try Hi, to Kathy. keep shit on the light side over here. I attend mm -hmm. a YouTubers meetup every year in Texas. Well, there you go. I don't know. Mm -hmm. uh, let, let Rez in on that wherever it is. <laughs> Uh, other Texans would probably love to join. <laughs> Ain't nobody from Texas. Only only freedom lovers move there, right? What? Huh? What? I'm born what? and raised. You better check yourself. Yes. I agree. I was like, shit, man. Okay, uh, the other day uh, I was pretty sure I, like, pretty sure I was uh, born here. Yeah, okay, me too. Yep. I was born bad. here too. Not too bad. Apparently I got her name right the second time. <laughs> I was on a live stream the other day and someone tried to t somebody I never met who I only heard about and he heard that I wanted to meet him and all they said was this Texas girl wants to meet you and he was like oh shit I saw deliverance all southerners mm -hmm. are like that I'm like you got me <laughs> fucked up <laughs> I'm I'm so not yeah. what you're expecting <laughs> yeah. and I had to correct his ass hello Kathy uh, love uh, considering where you, you guys were all yeah. at, um, uh, we could honestly do a Goliad State Becca. Park. Uh, uh, Goliad State Park, and we'll get a couple of pavilions, and we'll be like, you know, uh, have like a little uh, commune for the weekend. That'd be cool. Oh, uh, where is that at? Uh, uh, Goliad is like uh, between uh, 
So it's almost a right in the middle between Austin, San Antonio, and Houston. It's right in the middle. That's six hours away from me. <laughs> well, well, that's uh, about an hour uh, away from me. <laughs> well, I was gonna say, uh, yeah, uh, uh, both of y'all are a uh, uh, good ways away. So, uh, but West Texas will be better for uh, Teresa. But then uh, Northeast Texas, I guess, would be good for you, Lady C. So, I mean, you know, we can navigate these you, things. You just go in the middle somewhere and fucking oh, there's, uh, get there. somewhere along the lines, mm -hmm. Midland. <laughs> Yeah. My dad okay. used to well, live well, there. But, but, but no, nothing happens in Odessa. What are we going to do there? Just walk in the desert? Oh, there's Watch, a lot of shit to do there. We'll Mike... make our own party. Thank Hold you. On. Hold on. <laughs> yeah, the, middle, the middle of the desert is the perfect place to have a freaking party. Okay? Hell yeah. Bought the uh, fire yeah, and everything. Uh, <laughs> Uh -huh. I mean, that's you, one of the biggest you know, football, high school football places. Odessa Permian, what are you talking about? Yeah, that's true. She's right. She's right. She's right. She's right. She's all the way up there just to watch them play. And that's like, I don't know, like oh, four, five, six hours from me. I'm John Wiggs. Hold on. John Wiggs says he has to sing. Get out of the surf. Before we yeah, go. Yeah, I got to get. I gotta um, get it depends. John he wants to sing one of the songs that I won't eat. Um, I don't know how to send you a link. Um, I can send him one. You can send John Wiggs, Wiggs a link. Well, well so, I, the same link you sent me. Yeah. Yeah. Copy, paste, ship. Yep. I got to open everything back up. Well, I was going to tell you, um, I'm waiting on a phone call. So uh -huh. as soon as that call comes in, I got to jump down. Well, get, uh, hopefully you, uh, John can, um, um, can sing to you first. I mean, <laughs> I mean, oh, just what are you waiting? Wait, no, phone call. I'm not a Joe Wick. I'm not a mommy. Yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah, sir, I am. Hopefully, it's going to be short and sweet and you can come back. I'm not really sure yet <laughs> until I get the call. <laughs> All right. All right. Well, send John a link, anyways, please. Uh, Hold on. I got to figure out how to. Because uh, I done closed everything now. So. I understand. So I could I'm come up yeah, yeah. Uh, we lost Woody again. Woody must be going to bed. Ooh, that's what she said. Let's see if I close uh, the... No, I can't close that. If it's six hours from you, how far from me? Uh, Miss Ozzy, you're, you're roughly 14 hours ahead of us. Depending on where in that piece of that I you're, you you know? you're in the future. Yeah. And you're opposite. <laughs> yeah, daylight starts over there first. So <laughs> you're opposite. When y'all have winter, we have summer. So um yeah. <laughs> I gotta leave. Jimmy C is ignoring me. Kathy Bates, I didn't see you coming in until just now. Sorry. Come on up, Kathy. Okay, I just I just sent Mr. John Moyne. Speaking of which, uh, I think that I should pass out because I'm not going to get any cooler as the night goes on. What? Well, yeah, I uh, need to get out of here pretty soon too. I get up at five in the morning. Oh goodness, girl! I don't got that problem. Damn. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm a healthcare provider, and I have to be up early. Oh, and, okay. And, Damn. And Kathy, okay. I'm sorry. Uh, you blended right in with all the other, uh, you know, because I was trying to speak to Megan and, and or Megan rather, and freaking, you know, sorry, Kathy. It happened. Well, me and Teresa spoke to her. And then I got excited because John mm -hmm. Wick come in and a whole mm -hmm. bunch of new people came in. And well, you know you what? Were, and Kathy, hold on, but Kathy was part of them. And because she was blue, my, I just, you know, freaking, I was, I was looking at the new people. Sorry. Well, and if it makes you feel any better, um, I'm so mad at my husband, Growl, because uh, oh, he, YouTube pull is nice. He, 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 he's a day schedule guy, and I'm, I'm wondering why he's up so late. So he needs yeah. to get his rest. All right, and Kathy, so, I, I am truly sorry. So we can get a boat. Oh it's okay. yeah. It's okay that you're not coming up. So you get a <laughs> boat. Come on, man. Hi there, Miss Tiffany. I just saw that you said hi to me. I was I had to take my screen down. Mm -hmm. Hi, Becca. Oh, okay. hey. oh trust me, Miss Megan. 
Or, sorry, Megan. Why well, don't you fucking you not let me? Another another Megan has me say Megan every time I see that. But freaking um, no, 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 no. It's 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 impossible to say hi to every freaking one that comes in here, especially when the conversation gets a rolling. I do miss people. Freaking, um, I do my best to freaking you know keep up with the chat over there, but uh, the, the 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 shenanigans that goes on here. People, people get left behind. Okay. Oh like, yeah. Oh like, yeah. Like, like, like I We're, I we are so innocent, Jimmy. What are you talking <laughs> right. about? Right, but I haven't commented. <laughs> I haven't commented a thing on the on the on the 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 rhetoric coming out of Blind Straits freaking keyboard tonight. You know, because I know <laughs> I know he just likes to vent, and I don't have to talk to him. You know. People oh my goodness! Early. I had like two hundred people once uh, in my live stream. They were uh -huh. all chatting. There's there was probably about oh a good seventy five, eighty, or whatever. There. Oh, there's my call. Yeah. All right. Oh. Bye. 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 <laughs> right. Uh huh. John, she said she did. Yeah, she said she did. Um, can, does Kathy have your link? If you're on Instagram, John, you can you can message me on Instagram. I, Nightbot generally drops my drops my Insta. In fact, you could just scroll up a little bit and find my Insta and say hello on Insta, and then we'll be connected, and I can send you the link myself. What's the difference between? A University of Houston sorority sister and a scarecrow. One lives in a field, the other is stuffed with hay. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, one lives in a field and is stuffed with oh. hay. The other mm -hmm. frightens birds and small animals. Oh. Mm -hmm. The grip, mm -hmm. put the link in the chat and delete it real quick. No, I ain't. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Dealt with that the other night and didn't want to deal. Don't want to deal with it. <laughs> oh no! You never put your real stuff in private in, in a public well, chat. No, you you can mm. you can yeah you know, on stream yards on this one. It's a little more annoying. Yeah. Nope. Nope. What? Nope. Yeah. Nope. Mm -hmm. Well, it's like, you know, like, uh, I don't care if uh, anybody on panel knows my real name, but there's a reason why I'm Jesus Itago. Well, you yeah, know, yeah. it just, <laughs> it just but makes still, it, yeah. you know, yeah. if somebody wants to find you, they're going to find you, but anonymity is pretty cool. Well, you know, my name's out there. I I and like Google, my privacy. <laughs> Google connects us, okay? Google connects us. <laughs> I'm a private yeah. person. You're I come here Google. not to talk about You're reality. On Google freaking... <laughs> You know, they'll put you in this one, that one. Sorry, my nephew just called. All right, me, Megan, freaking uh, hopefully you can make it back in. Mm -hmm. I'm or if you, it's or if you missed a second, it's all good. Megan is right. Oh. Okay. Oh, so okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Megan it is. <laughs> is it Megan or Megan? She she wrote, uh, you just got to scroll up a little bit. She said, Megan oh. is right. Yeah, okay. Okay. All right. We got you. Stumbling around looking for what for B. I can't see that with in the closet. Looking for beer in the closet. Woo! <sighs> Dude, uh, I remember uh, being uh, 15, waiting till my dad fell asleep so I could sneak some of his beers. <laughs> I used to pull them. My mom used to drink white Russians and Colorado Bulldogs. Believe me, she was not having very strong ones. So those bottles were filled with water. Uh -huh. <laughs> just curious, are you using a green screen or just a background? I I use uh, XSplit uh, VCam for for my background stuff. Uh, YouTube Police. That's how I can I can switch through. Here, if I go over here, I could switch through stuff real quick, you know? Freaking. Yeah. You know? Freaking. I got tons of them all lined up, man. Freaking. You know, I got, I could put GIFs in there, you know? Freaking. 
Mm. Oh, oh shit. Yeah. I'm gonna have I'm gonna have the seizures looking at that yeah. shit. Uh-huh, yeah, but I can <laughs> I'm just keeping it real. <laughs> I could be I could be in Uncle Surf's garage in a heartbeat, you know. <laughs> <laughs> and we can and you know we can we can oh sorry, we uh huh. <laughs> You know, we can we can do shenanigans real quick. Oh, uh, yeah! You should never try to ride a moose. Don't do that, people. Well, do that. you know, there's, <laughs> there's a big story about that. Yeah, that's, that's, that's not what uh, you think it is. I remember that story, Jimmy C. Yeah. Hey, how did that go, anyways? Well, you know, we'll let Kathy tell you. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I better get going because I need to get sleep. Ah, uh, well, thanks for coming up and beautifying the yes. city, Teresa. It's always great Same to have you. Same here, actually. No, you're beautiful. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, thank you. Yeah, you're beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> nice Aww. to see you, Teresa. My lady, see. Always a pleasure to see y'all. Yep. Yeah, good I'll night. see y'all. Yeah, have a good night, everybody. Good, good night, good night. Night, night. night, night. Ride night, a night. <laughs> Ride a moose, save a cowboy. What? Gonna... See, look at my shirt. Look at my oh, shirt. Look at my shirt. Well, I mean, it is what it is. is, what it is oh, right? uh, <laughs> okay, okay, I'm gone. Uh, oh. All right, guys. Uh, I'm out too. Thank you, Jimmy C. Later, Rez. You guys Thanks were a blast. Up, Bye, Rez. Nice to meet you. Oh, yeah. Good to meet you too, Lady C. Uh, you guys take care. We'll see y'all soon. Okay, you too. <laughs> where's my, where's my, where's my? Yeah, we got this one. I like this one. This one affects people a little bit. Yeah. Right, you guys take care. We'll see y'all soon. Okay. All right. Rez, you gotta hit the leave button. Yeah, you act, no, you actually gotta leave. <laughs> yeah. There he goes. There you go. <laughs> oh, what the hell? <laughs> this is a good loop, Ray. My God, kids, dad is from Houston. There you go. John Wiggs, bite me. What? <laughs> Teresa's a hot hottie, without a doubt. <clears throat> I've been trying to get people to pay, you know, a super chat to see her in a red dress. It ain't worked. Like, I can't believe the motherfucker's that cheap. <laughs> Even tried to bribe Kane. That Come shit on, was man. funny. <laughs> Ooh, this will scare people right here. Oh, Jesus, God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what the hell? <laughs> what up, Ben T? <laughs> Is that what the fuck, Mike? No. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, what the hell? Oh, good God. <laughs> Jesus Christ. What the fuck are we? What? <laughs> mm. Just do a stream yard link. What the fuck? Fuck that. This ain't stream yards. Fuck that crap. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's your stream yard link right there, buddy. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> 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 they live in Seattle now. Mm -hmm. Line straight to get his power back on. Yeah, can we stick to that one? Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's a cool city. Yeah, this is this is courtesy of uh not a great gamer. Well, that's the cool setting. Mm -hmm. That's the one that picked you the best. Yeah, man, this was awesome. 
got me and the wife up there on a shelf under where it says cocktails. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Actually, that's not a good version of it. Let me uh, try to, <clears throat> I got to edit that. Why is it? Why is it so fucked up? Maybe. Yeah. There we go. Oh, that must have been. I was trying to get it all in the picture. That got it. That got adjusted kind of weird. <laughs> oh, I must have been trying to get the Jimmy C in there. Can we see it all now? And you got to lower a little bit. Oh, to oh, that, oh, yep. That's why I had it adjusted that high. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Turn it back. Whoop, wrong way. Yeah, wrong way. <laughs> no, it yeah. kills me because my view, where I'm adjusting it, my view is different than what it looks like on panel. Yeah, right there. Mm -hmm. All right. There you go. Yeah, see where it says cocktail? That's a little picture of me and Doris. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Y'all's little avatars. Yep. Yeah. Oh, you know why I had it? Because of the smoke. The smoke comes out of the motorcycle in the other direction. Mm -hmm. And and there's a freaking a uh, what wrong way? Wrong way. <laughs> Oh, there we go. Now we got, well, you can't see all the cocktail, but you can see me and Doris, and you can see the YouTube button flashing in the mirror now, too. And yeah. A little bit, and a little bit of the smoke coming out of the exhaust. There we go. Mm -hmm. Finally, finally tuned. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Hey, Jimmy, had the pick so you could only read cock. What? Come on, man. I don't remember that one. <laughs> Eventing drunk once or twice a week helps us all. Hell yeah, man. Mm -hmm. If you think this is crazy, come back Thursday. <laughs> well, Jimmy, that's a masterpiece. Wish it was a little bit clearer. Um, yeah, that's a lighting type of thing, the way the guy made it. You know, you're in a it's basically you're in a dark bar room, you know what I mean? So it's I think it's part of the effect. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> You know, you got the the Harley fucking sign flashing. There's a lot of shit going on in this video. The, uh -huh. the exhaust There's, coming out of the motorcycle, fucking, you know, fucking the Harley sign flashing, the freaking, the YouTube button flashing. Yeah. Plus, it's got snow in it like it was freaking on an old TV, you know? Mm -hmm. Like you're not old. Yeah, yeah, like you're in an old bar room. Yeah. So like yeah. you're sitting at a on a bar stool. Yeah. Or exactly. <laughs> Dark one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thursday's a bad day at cooking a bar hungover, huh? Mm -hmm. That could be a t shirt. Heck yeah, it could. Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, let me let me show you my um one of my I I had t shirts once upon a time. But that girl, that girl quit doing it, and I had I had this on the back of it, with uh, with my um, my channel logo on the front where the where the uh, where the pocket would be. And they were pretty cool. They would I sold I sold a good few of them, but freaking, she went from making when uh, when the Rona hit, you know she she used to sell a lot of T-shirts for like. For like teams and in, in in sporting events and or um, or uh, parties, you know. So she sold, you know, like she was used to doing them in in big groups, and she really didn't like doing mine. Um, you know, one here, one there, type of thing. But when the Rona hit, she lost all of her business. Freaking no one, no one was buying, so she shut it down and uh, moved to something else. She sells rocks and. Shit like that now. So, no, I didn't have her. I didn't have her make any, any uh, pre-made ones because I, you know, I didn't, I didn't put any money into it. You know, freaking. 
this this could be on a shirt too by itself you know yeah. Yeah. i could definitely sell these for shirts too <laughs> uh -huh. Uh -huh. or the one of you on the motorcycle <laughs> this one oh even yeah that one even that one needs a little adjusting eh? yeah a little zoom out no he just needs to come down so you can see that and yeah oh maybe a little out huh so you can actually see the jimmy c yeah I mean, that's what i mean <laughs> there you go yeah. that's perfect right there uh -huh. i like that one i do too because it really looks like me <laughs> yes except she's not as bad as i am <laughs> that was you 20 years ago <laughs> pretty much pretty much you know 20 years ago I was a 1x mm. then, then I got then I I got well you know probably yeah yeah might have been a little longer that I want the biker Jimmy on a vinyl print yeah buddy <laughs> Sounds good to me. Freaking, I'm pretty sure 30 bucks plus shipping and handling will get her done. <laughs> I'm just saying, because I, I do have someone that can make shirts, you know? They can. Hopefully, she can, she can take that, that, that. Mick M cart thing out of the MC art. <laughs> Hopefully yeah. she can hide that in the freaking <laughs> in the doings. Yeah. But uh yeah, Mark uh Lisa's Mark get uh hooked that up for me. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, that picture. Too. That's my favorite outside of the bar one. Uh. But I also like the cartoon version of you on a mini chopper. Oh, let me try and I'm I'm surprised I don't have that one in, loaded in here. Let me, <laughs> let me let me see if I can fucking find it and bring it in. I know I got it somewhere. Cause that used to be your symbol a long time ago. Oh, that'll need some editing. Yeah, that one. Oh, it's, it, it still is. It's freaking. Still is. I can try to zoom it out. <laughs> yeah. Get it framed in there. Yeah, maybe zoom it out just a little more. About right there, yeah. Maybe. Well, to get the whole freaking. Right there. there. I like it. Yeah. We'll put that one on the front pocket and and then the motorcycle, the other motorcycle on the uh back. On the back, yeah. Yeah. The cartoon version and then you twenty years ago. <laughs> Give or take. Guesstimating. <laughs> all right, all right, Rez. Make it happen. Age 57, mirror looks horrible. What? <laughs> they do it age 48, two blind straight. <laughs> Come on, man. I look good for 54. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> I hope somebody else comes up here because I don't know how much longer I'm going to last. Talk soon, Megan. What are you out of here? <laughs> Age is but a number. Yeah, well, you know. Freaking... Yep. <clears throat> I'm enjoying it while I got it. 
you my yeah. avatar. There's your proof right there. What? <laughs> All right, now I gotta go click. Yeah, go click some buttons. What? Huh? Reminds me of uh freaking what's it? What's the uh, freaking uh, Benny Loco? <laughs> That's the homie right there. Ooh, look at this. July 4th, 2020. In other words, this is a Rona channel. Oh, Lord. <laughs> She's bored as fuck during the Rona and joined YouTube. Uh -huh. <laughs> well, <laughs> what else you going to do when you're stuck at home and can't oh, go I understand. I understand a lot of, a lot of channels like that. Next month is my eighth year. Eighth year? Yep, eighth year anniversary on YouTube. Let me now I gotta go check. <laughs> I know I I know I've only been uploading since um September of two thousand eighteen. But um I I was on here much longer than that. I mean, oh oh yeah, before I knew YouTube was a thing. Yeah, yeah, I've been on here a long time. But whenever I made this channel it's been eight years. Yeah. Now uploading content, that's a whole nother story. <laughs> we ain't gonna go to that level. It is what right. it is. Yeah. <laughs> what does it say? We can... I hate that they change the way the about section works. They can... When they did that, they chopped off my whole, a whole big list of shit that I had written up on there and looked like, yeah. Let's see. I joined August of 2016. It's when I found YouTube. When I found YouTube was useful for more than freaking, you know, um, music. Just no, I was actually I'd only I'd only I thought YouTube was just uh, videos of kids doing stupid shit. Until then, that's when I found freaking the uh, nomad community because I had mm -hmm. nothing to do. I was stuck at home, freaking riding the pine, you know, freaking. Mm -hmm. So freaking. Uh, and I found the I found the nomads and you know decided I wanted to type in the chat in the UMAD <laughs> nomad community you know so freaking mm -hmm. I because I wanted them to you know because I had I I've been I'm an experienced camper I've been camping my whole fucking life you know so uh, I mean you know I've been there and done that to a lot of the stuff that they were talking about so I had input you know. Mm -hmm. JCT's back. What's up, girl? How you doing? And uh, and because I did that, freaking, you know, somewhere along the line, I didn't even know it could happen, but somewhere along the line, someone subscribed to me, and freaking, I could tell the story about what how it blew up from there. But most of y'all have heard it a fucking million times, so I'll just say, I'll just leave it at that. Freaking. Someone subscribed to me and then someone else subscribed. I uploaded a video because, you know, you know, because I got shamed into it. And so I uploaded a video and freaking it went on. It just blew up from there. Mm -hmm. Then I found live streaming. Mm -hmm. You know, freaking what? September, October, November. It was probably the middle of November, December when I found live streaming and I was hooked instantly, you know. I remember how I found you, and then it took me a year or so to get up here. <laughs> oh, we had to drag you out of the chat. Uh huh. Because yeah. y'all were intimidating, man. It took me a minute. Mm -hmm. I had, it took me that long to get used to y'all and how y'all are. Uh huh. 
but I could relate to y'all a lot better than the communities I was in. So yeah. I was like, okay, this is a cool environment. I like this environment. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Luke Duke, what's up, my brother? How you doing? You gonna join us this evening? Come on, man. I actually don't smoke. It's okay. You don't have to smoke, man. Well, you don't have to smoke to be here. You don't have to do nothing. You know, freaking uh, whatever your vice is, keep it to you. Know, you can keep it to yourself. But we're not all potheads here. Freaking, mm -mm. you know, there are quite a few. You know, but uh, no. Mm -mm. I found them in like 2018. Who, me? You've been hanging around that long, blind straight? Come on, man. Yeah, yeah no surprise fine. though, you two police. You are you are a former police officer, so you know, I'd expect you to be actually um a drunk to tell you the truth. <laughs> Thank you for phrasing it that way. Former yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, he's an old dog now, you yeah? know. He's he if he was still in the police, he'd probably be, you know, the dude sitting behind a desk, you know. Mm, or or running the show, you know, the chief of police type of thing. Mm, mm, I'm gonna mm. have to love you and leave you. All right, Gavin, catch you later, my brother. Bye, Gavin. Have a good night or a day, wherever you're at. <laughs> oh, oh, you actually am a current police officer. Oh, I thought you were said ex police. All right. Oh, well, see, see. Yeah, I am old though. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> mm hmm. Mm hmm. My real name, I learned to get that off. Yeah, buddy, I hear you. <laughs> I do run my shift, but not the whole department. Uh-huh, all right, there you go. <laughs> you ain't in a squad car no more, right? <laughs> I'm just, no, no offense, but you don't look like you're in any shape to be chasing them guys down the road. <laughs> Well, maybe in a car, but not on foot. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to keep quiet. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, well, it, <laughs> someday I hope to retire in a few years. Yeah, buddy. Retirement's freaking, you know. The thing about retirement, though, with the, with the you know, if you're if you're an old dog and, and you and you really like working. Oh, you went to two calls tonight. There you go. All right. Cool, man. I have no jurisdiction on the internet. <laughs> I don't care. You still still wear the badge. Mm. No offense. I just have ODD mm. and that's how it started. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Childhood trauma. We'll leave it at that. <laughs> oh, it's all good, uh uh you two please. Uh someone's gonna keep the conversation going, man. <laughs> it's all good because you know, if you if I ain't talking to you, uh I'm talking to Blind Straight, and he's just he's just a rambler, you know. Freaking, you never know what the hell comes out of there. <laughs> Luke Duke, I know we joined up somewhere, freaking, and I know you want to. You said you'd come up here one of these times. Now's a good time. Yeah, you better catch it on a quiet night. <laughs> oh yeah, Megan. I got your, I got your, uh, your, uh, uh, what is it, the legacy century, uh, century torch relay thing playing just to make sure it sticks. I saw you were under a hundred, so I figured I'd help out. Kind of ramble as well. Yeah, everybody. I and I type too quickly. I hate typing. That's why I'm up here. 
The innocent nun. Problem is, the nun ain't innocent. Right, Tracy T? Everyone's welcome. Well, yeah, 90%. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have very many people banned. I generally we generally just time people out. <laughs> I'll let them come back, you know, because a click's a click. A views of you. Oh, I think you you guys are um Yeah. I think you're a little too PG for me. I I dropped too many f bombs, but maybe. <laughs> I almost clicked the link the other night when I was in there. But it's good that we got to know each other a little better before I did that too. You know. Oh, oh, you too, please. It's all about the moose. Oh dang, JCT, sorry about that. I don't get rid of you blind straight. You keep the chat rolling. Come on, man. You might be talking to the wall, but you keep it going. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah, I was just telling somebody today, they're like, how do you do YouTube and still deal with your real life? I'm like, in our community, it's real life first, then YouTube. Mm-hmm. Exactly. YouTube and is like, secondary. Yeah, and they're like, how does that make sense? How do you still do what you do? And I'm like, because YouTube, you can go into it when you want to. There ain't no time of it. You make your own schedule. You catch it when you catch it. <laughs> There's an art to live streaming, Megan. There truly is. Some are good at it. Some aren't. You know, um, you know. But uploading, uploading stuff in your life—that's you know—that could be great. Severe anxiety. Yeah, I hear you. I was never. You know, the funniest thing about me is, is there's there's maybe besides school pictures. Um, there's only a handful of pictures of Jimmy C, freaking a handful, and 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 after school, after school out was over, there's very very few pictures of me, freaking. Um, there are a couple, you know, there are a couple, but there, there's very few. I was never one to be in front of a camera, and then and then YouTube happened, and here I am, freaking. In front of a camera every freaking day. One way or another. <laughs> oh, there's Belt Loop, also known as YouTube Police. <laughs> Maybe this channel name will make people a little more comfortable. Well, <laughs> it's better than uh, hanging it, out with the police. <laughs> yeah, uh, some of us don't handle that well. Uh -huh. <laughs> Just putting that out there. Yeah, some of us. Some of us had some questionable upbringing, you know. <laughs> mm -hmm. Some of us. I mean, got I, some... I could, I could tell you some stories, man. <laughs> I'm just I gonna say, childhood... I don't want to incriminate myself. Mm -mm. I'm just gonna say, childhood trauma led me to have ODD, mm -hmm. and that's why I don't talk to people in that career field <laughs> if I don't have to. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> Sure, you like you like puppies. Everybody likes puppies, all right? Yeah, I well, just, uh, um, I just don't like them in my house. Okay, <laughs> puppies and McGruff the crime dog are two different things. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, just putting that out there. <laughs> 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 you know you gotta be old you gotta be old to remember that one well for those that know they know shit. 
<laughs> Blind straights taking the fifth. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> See that one. That one fits in good here. We got. We got. We got a lot of people that uh, grow gardens and whatnot. <laughs> yeah people like growing stuff exactly uh -huh. oh. that's been a trend lately you know mm -hmm. going off grid living off land uh -huh. do what you gotta do just saying <laughs> the economy's bad you know <laughs> right <laughs> I was trying to figure out how I could freaking be a nomad and 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 grow at the same time. <laughs> it means I need a bigger trailer <laughs> <laughs> and, and a bigger battery bank. <laughs> I like growing stuff, growing veggies. I hear you, man. Your wife grows the herbs. There you go. <laughs> Before we got married, there you go. Mm -hmm. Fast cars, that's always a good topic. The sheriff had to go through steps to come back and visit me. Like I said, he will be here till Friday, then back to North Carolina. Woohoo! Five plants in Illinois, only a misdemeanor. I thought you guys could grow out there. You can't grow out there. Where? He said Illinois. Oh, I thought they just made it legal there. <laughs> Didn't that just pass? Mm -hmm. I like that. You may not have juris jurisdiction, but you have police in your name, which is enough to make me behave. Uh huh. <laughs> uh huh. That's if I stop talking. Sometimes when you grow stuff, you eat. Yeah, man. Jimmy would love to come up and say hi. All right, Megan, uh, you're on Instagram. That's the best way to get a link because I don't, I don't put it in the chat. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't put it in the chat. But you could, uh, but if you're on Instagram. Start an Instagram thing, you know, it's freaking pretty simple. And uh my nightbot drops it pretty regular, freaking. You can find me on it. It's on it's Jimmy C and Friends on, on Instagram too. You just put uh what is it that the lower hash mark in between all the freaking words. Mm -hmm, the space. Yeah, what is it? Just put Jimmy C space in friends and that's how it comes up. Oh, okay. Well, I when I wrote it, it was freaking, you know, the the line underneath thing. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. The space, yeah. the space mark. Oh, okay. Is that what that thing's called? Yeah, that's what I call it. I don't know what it's I called, know. but that's what I call it. The well, space it's the mark. line on the bottom. You know that little line that goes on the bottom. Yeah. Yeah. The one that looks like filling the blank button. <laughs> Mm hmm Funny thing is, I don't recall if I said hello from this channel or not. No, you didn't. But you can I hope you're giving me thumbs up with all these channels coming in. Come on. <laughs> Just saying. Yeah, this is where I come to get away from reality. Uh-huh. Yeah, well, it's group therapy for Misfit Island. Uh huh. I know that. That's how I, uh, yeah. whenever I'm promoting your channel, that's what I say. Welcome to group therapy for Misfit Island. You're distraction from reality. Great people, good buzz, and you can fuck around and have a good time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, buddy. Mm -hmm. 
Ay. So you always use Zoom? Pretty much. I've I've been known to use the stream yards on Saturday on Sunday night, but I don't know. After the last one, I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, I like the uh I like the uh the audio and the picture quality on the Zoom better than the stream yards. And, and it doesn't beat up it doesn't beat up my my brand with, bandwidth so much. Because StreamYard just eats up your bandwidth, man, freaking. And if you got, you know, if your if your internet connection is is uh, is uh, how we say less than freaking optimum, freaking uh, it it makes it makes a uh, it makes a big difference, you know, freaking. It, StreamYard used to used to really really beat up. It was so bad. I thought it was my PC. It used to really, you know, it was always freaking. Always pinwheeling and freaking my camera would always, you know, be freaking stalled and it, and it was all because StreamYards was beating up my freaking broadband. You know what I'm saying? And uh, uh, Zoom doesn't do that because Zoom, Zoom, you know, it's it's different. It doesn't do that, freaking. And I and let's just say, I have I have my own OBS stuff, so I don't need. I don't need StreamYards to do all that crap. You know, it's nice. StreamYards does make all that OBS stuff easy to do. Um, but you know, I don't I don't necessarily like all that other crap anyway. But if I wanted it, I I could have banners running and and you know, all the videos pop up videos put up in front of me, freaking I just you know, I just don't Jimmy, I'm gonna drop down have a hose of a computer. Yeah, it makes a difference. All right, Lady C, appreciate you hanging out. It was great. It was good no seeing you again. You know, I'm glad to be here. Thanks for having even, me. Even though I'll, we I'll only, see you again. Yeah, even though we only saw you for like a second, but you know. Well, I was trying to make a point. I know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll see you later. Thanks for having me. Go. All right, bye bye. Mm. Bye, everybody. Bye. He is allergic to puppies aside from greyhounds. Well, the best thing is just get some puppies that you're allergic to and live with it. My wife does. She's allergic to all dogs, and we got two of them. We've we've pretty much had two dogs um, for most of the time we've been together. We had one to begin with, and freaking actually no, yeah, we started with one. Of, well, yeah, we started. We started with two dogs. What am I thinking? Because I had mine, she had hers. Freaking, yeah. And and, uh, and then we got rid of hers because hers was just not fit for apartment living. And then we got a house. Then we ended up that my dog died, and we got it. Then we got two dogs, you know, because freaking, I was like, huh? And then uh, one of them died, and then the other one finally died, and so we went like freaking. We went like a year and a half without a dog at all, and now we have two dogs again. Mm -hmm. I was like, huh? I tried to dodge it, but mm. oh, look at that! We got one coming back in. Uh huh. Hi, this Becca. Hey, where'd everybody go? Welcome. Well, they all bailed on me, you know, something about it being one o'clock in the morning. Or, or sorry, we're yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, some of them were at, you know, I don't know, they just can't hang. Oh it's well, fun. it is really all it is almost one o'clock, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, mean, I didn't think it was that late. Two Boston Terriers. Ooh, little guys. We got one pork and cheese and and, and then the other one's a some kind of how mix. Yeah. What kind of cheese? Pork and cheese. I didn't know they mixed pork with cheese. Well, it's a, it's actually called a bull nose cur, cur. Yeah. Oh, uh, okay. Cur. Okay, but it's just as it's a it's a sausage looking dog. You know, she's short and roly poly looking. She looks like a big old freaking sausage. That's why I call it pork and cheese for some reason. But you know, little porky little thing. 
Yeah, I bet she looks a lot. Well, I don't know. She's probably smaller than what my basin hound was. She's cute. <laughs> yeah, I miss my basin hound. I'm always the best rabbit dog I ever had. All mine are really old now. That yeah, one is, uh, she's like, I don't know, what is she now, 15? And then oh, yeah. uh, Tater's like, I think he's like 12. And uh, the other little one, she's she's like, I don't know, she's like 12 or something, or 13. I don't know. Something right out, out up on up in there. Yeah, we got, uh, what did they say? The mother, they think she's about five years old. And her son, which is the, the, um, well, sorry, the, the cur, the black nose cur is, they think is five or six years old. And they think the, um, her, her son, the, 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 the hound mix freaking, what was he? I think he was only two years old uh -huh. or something to that effect. Did uh, did Mr. John say he ever got the? I sent him that link, and uh, he's. I, it, it, it looks like he saw it, so I didn't know if he uh, ever. I don't or know. he doesn't know how to do Zoom. Maybe he doesn't want to do Zoom. I don't know. I mean, That's what I said. He might not know how to it, do it, the it, Zoom. Yeah, apparently he didn't want to deal with it. You know, it's not. Some people just don't want to deal with it. You know, what I mean. I well, know. it is a little. It is a little harder, of course, than Streamyard. Mm -hmm. Um, but yeah. But I All think right. you said it's a lot cheaper. Yeah, it is cheaper, way cheaper. Belt Loop, have a good night, man. Appreciate you coming over, hanging out, and and holding up the chat for a bit, man. <laughs> Appreciate that. And uh, Megan, I sent you a link in the uh, on the Insta. You want to come up and give it a shot, Mister Nightbot? You need to uh, put another O on that too, and y'all talk too much. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, let's just say I was drunk when I wrote that, all right? Oh, you're Mr. Nightboy? <laughs> no, but I wrote, I'm the one that writes those things. Like, I know, I said. know. It's like fucking, you know. Like, That's yeah. one thing I do know. I've, I know I talk too much. <laughs> mm -hmm. And like even my buddy, like Joe, you know, my buddy Joseph Girl, uh -huh. he, he's always saying woo. It, he just does the W O O O. I was drunk. I put an H on it. W H O O O. Fuck it. I stuck like that because I ain't going back in there and fixing it. <laughs> Hi there, Miss Megan. Hello, hello. Nice to meet you. Uh, it's nice to meet you too, girl. Yeah. Uh -huh. Hello. Hello. Sorry, I look like a wreck. Please excuse what? the mood. I don't think I, you don't know. Come on. Uh, no, it's um, 5 p.m. down here in the future. So, uh, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, you got a happy, smiley face. You know, that's not a train. Oh, uh, I'm on. exhausted. But mm -hmm. thank you, Jimmy. You're very kind. Come on. Man. Um, yeah. I just wanted to pop in and say hello. And I like. You Americans love my accent, and I love the Texan accent. Well, so. hey, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, my um, I have three godchildren whose dad was born in Houston. They live in Seattle now, and um, I love their accent. Oh, oh, oh most excellent. We love yeah. our Aussie friends, though. Freaking, really oh, do. thank you. Yeah, you know, I, I mean, I, that's, I, see, that's the greatest thing about YouTube, right here, right? Freaking. You meet people from all over the world, all the different walks and talks. Man. Yep. You're 100% you right. Granted, we can't touch, but we can get very close. You can get we very can touch. close to you're people like this. Look, what the hell uh, are you right? talking about? Look, yeah, I'm touching Reach a finger. Here, Reach out yeah. and touch, brother. Yeah, you know, Here, you pull my finger. Touch, right? <laughs> I mean, I mean, I've you lost... Jimmy, time out. Becca, are you sure that's your finger? I'm just asking to be sure. I don't put. Yes, got I'm, a a I'm a female. Tr mm. uh, trust me, I'm a female. No, 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 darling. That's not what I'm implying. I don't want anything to happen with our police officer friend in the chat. That's all. I'm oh, okay. I thought you meant I'm behaving, my dear. Pull my phone or something. <laughs> I don't know. No judgment here, but you know, I'm just mm. meeting you for the first time. I want to keep. <laughs> 
myself out of YouTube jail. But um uh. <laughs> but no, it's yeah, you're a hundred percent you are a hundred percent right with that, Jimmy. I was in the States mm. two years ago. I had a month in LA and a month in Seattle and people that I'd only met met online. Mm. Um I was able to meet in person and, mm-hmm. you know, um, I, in case you can't tell about the 12 in my name, it's because I'm a Seahawks fan and I got to meet so many great 12s when I was in Seattle uh-huh. um, that I chat with all the time uh-huh. on um, streams, but to meet them in person and say, oh, that's Jimmy. That's Jimmy's face. So when I chat to mm-hmm. you, I can, I can, um, um put the name to the face so yeah yeah, yeah. exactly i mean like you know, i've been doing this like five years now right freaking yep and i've yep, I've, yep. I've 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 actually lost people you know like i had i had a brother not a real brother but he was a brother he was on mm-hmm. every live stream i did my buddy anthony when he passed away it was literally like losing my brother it tore me up for weeks I um, yeah yeah I I have a relationship oh, a relationship friendship mm-hmm. like that with a friend of mine um that we stream mm-hmm. together um most days um and mm-hmm. I got to go to the I got to go to a Seahawks game with him in Seattle he lives yep. he, he lives in Spokane but came over to Seattle and. We had met online, but mm-hmm. not personally. And that's a, that's spent, a nice ride, by the way, from Spokane to Seattle. That's a yeah, nice he ride. Flew in, he mm-hmm. flew in for the baseball the day before, uh-huh. did 18 and a half innings at the Mariners uh-huh. the day before, and then took me to the football. But it we it really felt like I'd known him for 10, 15 mm-hmm. years instead of the three years we'd actually known yep. each other, you know, and um. It was beautiful, and we uh, he uh, my dad passed away seven years ago yesterday, and he was the first person to text me yesterday because I've yeah. been off my mm-hmm. yeah you know what mm-hmm. I mean and I do I do and I was like we we have our my... brother we had a brother Gary now Gary never been on a live stream never but he was right. in my chat the owner when he was in my chat he was in my chat every time I went live he never mm-hmm. missed a show unless he was sick. And even then, he probably made it in. You know, <laughs> no, no, no. But, he was there. He yeah. just you didn't when, know he when, was. When he died, you know, he left a mark, man. Freaking everybody cried. Freaking people made videos for him. And freaking, mm-hmm. like, like, guy never been on camera. You know, he barely, no, but when he made videos, on camera. you never saw his face on a video. But he's in the chat. He was just as much a brother, you know. Um. You, the beautiful thing about it is if you're not like if you got a face like mine got hit with the ugly stick don't oh say whatever it. oh you are gorgeous and, you know, oh stuck. whatever now i know you're lying <laughs> well your picture is gorgeous okay yeah, photoshop uh, as we've seen yeah no, I'm kidding, say Becca, I'm kidding. Uh, um but people uh, i've been offline because it's coming up to easter it was my dad's anniversary and i've had people texting me all day yesterday and today going are you okay we haven't seen you yeah i just <laughs> which That's is the other lovely, thing. <laughs> which is lovely to mm-hmm. know you missed but it's also yep. back off I want exactly. to talk. well yeah but you know that's the other thing when you ain't when you're around all the time you know and then then you, people don't see you for a couple of days they get concerned, you know. Freaking Which out. is lovely. Don't get me wrong, Jimmy. Mm-hmm. I love that they care, but right now mm-hmm. it's just like back off. And oh yeah, up. yeah, yeah, yeah. But you know, you know, it's uh, <laughs> it's it's lovely that they care, but, and I yeah, do take yeah. it. In- in the spirit it, in which it's intended, but it can be a bit much. It, but it, it, to think about it, that it can get that real with people you met on the internet, you know? Yeah. <laughs> well, well I, I still have my best friend from school, and we keep in touch. Oh, bless you, sir. I, I'm only on the Coke Zero, but enjoy. Hey, to um, each his own. Um, you know, my two best friends from school, then everyone online, mm-hmm. because it's interesting I would rather talk to people I've met like just met like yourself than people I've known for forty years. <laughs> and so that's that funny because I, I have um, but this, the, well, the house that I'm in now is my folks' house, 
and, and everybody else knows, but my folks passed away and I'm, I'm, so, I'm, yep. I'm going through everything and I'm moving to Arkansas. Yep. But anyway, um, so I'm in my folks house right now. Right. Mm -hmm. And um, across the street used to be what used to be our baseball field. And in our pasture right. used to be our softball field. <laughs> well, yep. the um the the neighbors that are like, I don't know, that was like two or three houses down or whatever. Um, their son, who I grew up with since grade school, he bought the he bought the land that's across the street. So I literally live across the street from the same the same guy that you know I went to grade school with. And my mm. mechanic yep. is also um another yep. guy who's his mama lives a couple of houses down and he's same thing i went to grade school with him and he's actually my mechanic so mm -hmm. i've known them forever it's funny you say that becca because my younger brother lives in the house that he and i grew up in which was my mm -hmm. dad's house my parents got divorced when we were yep. young with my dad whatever my brother moved back into our house and he has the nephew i spoke of that kept bringing me yep. is um, Oliver Damien John Gork Roger, my nephew. John Damien is my father's name backwards, mm -hmm. which is a tradition that the young ones in our family get grandparents' names. And he was born three days after my father's birthday, two years and three days after my father passed away. Mm -hmm. But now they're living in the house that my brother and I grew up in, in yeah. the cul-de-sac we grew up in with some, but not all of the people, like you said, Becca, mm -hmm. that we grew up knowing. And it's just, it's mind blowing to go back to that street and think, yeah. oh, they live there and mm -hmm. there. And, oh, they uh, died. Yeah. You know, yeah. It, it's mind blowing. Yeah. There's a lot of people on, you know, this, this road right here is that I've known them forever. I'm just, I'm just reading over there. What do you mean, blind straight, that your kids are not human anymore? Oh, what no. did I miss? Don't, don't worry, no, he, uh, says all in, he says they're all in jail. So, uh, oh, okay. Oh, I, I thought maybe they oh, passed away or something, yeah. and they're. Oh, in. yeah. I was wondering whether they were teenagers or yeah. passed away themselves yeah. because no teenager is human. Or maybe, or maybe the fact that he just wrote them off because they're pieces of shit. But yeah, you know, who knows? But, judge uh, not. Judge not. JCT, yeah. uh, um, Woody, Woody, uh, it's past Woody's bedtime. He faded out probably about 45 minutes ago. He was here. What time is it there? It's 10 past 5 p.m. It's, it's 10 past, huh? It's How just a hair after 1 a.m. Yeah. He's piking. Yeah, I thought you said you were in Seattle. No, no, no! I'm not in Seattle. I was oh. in Seattle. I, oh, no, oh, okay, okay, okay. I'm in okay. Australia. If okay. I couldn't live in Seattle, mm -hmm. brother, you'd be your sweet. Yeah, yeah. Backside, right. I'd right. be out of this country. Okay. No, I got you. I'm okay. a Seattle Seahawks. I love everything about Seattle, as you can see mm -hmm. behind me. And mm -hmm. if I, but I'm living in Australia. And, well, I was okay. going to say, unfortunately, but not unfortunately. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what Blind Straight was saying. I saw him at earlier top. I think it was him that topped in there, the Ann Wilson. Mm -hmm. You know, um, I think she's. I think she's born in. Uh, um, she was born in California, but she. I think she's like from or something Seattle or something like that. Ann, Ann Wilson. Wilson, yeah, the, the lead singer of Heart. Uh, yeah. Yes, uh, her and her sister uh, born in California, but I think were raised in Seattle. They play. Right. Uh, at, at, at uh, some of the Kraken hockey games, like mm. the Winter Classic. Yeah, Seattle will claim them, but I believe born mm. in LA, I think, without looking no, no. that up. But yeah, no, no. yep. That's old school shit, though. <laughs> it's great. Oh, there ain't nothing wrong with being old school. <laughs> uh, listen, at least hey, we three may be old farts, speaking for myself particularly here, mm. but we grew up when there was decent music. None of this type. Look, if you love Taylor Swift, good luck to you. I don't. <laughs> None of that bullshit that they listen to now. Yeah. Cranky old well, woman. Cranky well, old yeah. woman ranking. The easy, easiest, the easiest way to put it is we we listen to music before auto tune. <laughs> Amen, brother. I listened. I grew up. I was born in '76 and grew up in the '80s and had um, Queen, um, yeah. Heart. Uh -huh. Oh, trust me. I actually got. <laughs> We've all we're all there. We're all yeah. as country when country wasn't is, cool. Beck is the young in here though. Freaking. 
Yeah, she, she's all the. I was going to say twelve. I'm guessing. I'm guessing she's twelve. <laughs> twelve, but that's being rude. That's too old. I'm kidding, Becca. I can't be I, I'm forty-eight in December, and that's old mm. enough. But um, I'm, I'm I'm one of the last people to be born in, in the sixties. Oh, nice! Ooh, you were, Lou sounds like you were born the perfect year, huh? Well, <laughs> but I tell you what, I was born for forty-six years too late because I love thirties and forties jazz. Like Ella mm -hmm. Fitzgerald, Duke Ellington, you know, all the great jazz mm -hmm. players and singers. I was born too late for that. That's uh, my new. My father listened to a lot of that when I was young. Yeah, yeah my Terry's uh, Woodburn and says Ozzy. He was, you know, some, and some of the ones that, you know. Mm -hmm. Oh, hell yeah. Freaking. Yeah, oh, uh, freaking Deep Purple, Led Zeppelin. Come on. Oh, Ping, y'all hadn't even Pink mentioned Pink Pink anybody Boy. in country. Yeah. Um, well, sorry, Becca, I'm not a country uh, fan. Penny Rogers, <laughs> freaking Merle Haggard. John Denver, George yeah, Strait. You know, John Denver was awesome. He was, I mm -hmm. love, um, love his song he did about Jacques Cousteau, Calypso. We sang that in choir at school mm -hmm. one year, and I can still remember the phrasing and how to sing it. And you can't forget the man in black, Johnny Cash. Come on. Yeah. Do you know oh, I read an article it. that came out? I, I don't think it came out today. I don't know. It came across my news page today where they said that, that there was like the, I think it was 30 most iconic singers or something of all time or, or best singers of all time or something. And Johnny mm -hmm. Cash was, now those, I'm sure that's a, that's a poll that they took or something, you yeah, know, yeah. but, yeah, but yeah, yeah Johnny yeah. Cash made that list. Oh, why that. wouldn't he? I mean, you but you know them. what they they put Beyonce on that list, and I'm just not sure if I would consider that the top no. thirty. I mean, I, uh -uh. that's just me. Yeah, but so, but Becca, I've always had a, a problem with those type of things because yeah, Beyonce mm -hmm. versus Johnny Cash, who's winning that? And it ain't Beyonce. I love Beyonce, by the way. But what are you yeah. looking at when you're ranking them? Two different styles of music, two different times of music. Mm -hmm. Like, what criteria are you basing them on? Right, right. Right. Oh, she sings good. I just don't know if I would, uh, yeah, if I would rank yeah, that in the I'm top 30 no, of all you. time. Of all no. time, Johnny uh -huh. Cash would be got, outside. Johnny Cash wins. Yeah. And I'm not a huge country fan, but I do like Johnny Cash. Yeah, but there's but so Johnny many. Johnny Cash of all time and Beyonce. so many. There's so many people that were way better than Beyonce, okay? Yeah, and as I said, Jimmy, I'm mm -hmm. I'm a fan. I like her music, but I love Johnny Cash's music. There's a difference well, between yeah. like you know they actually they even had Kelly Clarkson on there, and and, and I'm like, love. yeah, Kelly Clarkson can sing, okay? I'm not because I, I mean, good? hey. She's from here, but, yeah, but uh, kind of I just don't know if I would put her on the top. Right. Thirty. That's what I mean. Right. I, I mean, remember. I remember they had the top 100 guitarists of all time. I love guitarists. And they had people like Jimi Hendrix and Hank Marvin, you know. And they had Brian May of Queen, who is my favourite guitarist, mm -hmm. well, one of them. They had him at 27 and had all these young kids above him. Mm -hmm. How does that work? Firstly, he made his guitar from scratch with his father. Number one, that's not a, the red special. I have a signed copy of one sitting in my yeah. living room. But it's like, how do you rank some young kid who's been playing five years over someone like Brian May who's played for 50 plus? Right. And that's like, why I hate those mm -hmm. lists. Yeah, Roy, there you go. Roy Clark's a hell of a guitarist, freaking right there, Brian May. <laughs> Brian May, I was you 100, know? I saw Queen live here a couple of years ago. Was a hundred feet away from Brian May and burst into tears and did not stop crying. Thank God it was mm -hmm. raining because I would have looked pathetic. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but yeah, or you know, um, Eric. They had all these young kids ranked above Eric Clapton and mm -hmm. Jimi Hendrix and Brian May, and it's like who ranks these? Yeah, I'm not not saying the young kids aren't good, but compared to Jimi Hendrix, one of the greatest of all time. No. <laughs> My voice is sexy. Oh, JCT, you freaking, you're a beautiful girl. Freaking, you are, come on. For an old broad, anyway, you know, freaking. You got to go yeah. on, girl. I seen, I seen you, JCT. I know the deal. 
<laughs> yeah, sum up my hat on that list. I just, you know, as I said, it's it's just one of those things. Yeah, they're, they're all arbitrary. The you know what I mean? Now arbitrary. they did have, and I do agree. Now I don't listen to opera, okay, at all. But I know I when I was I was doing one of my videos once, and uh, there was two that. I had to research the history of who sang the songs that I was uh, doing on my video. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah. And so they did have two of the opera singers on there. And I will agree that those, I, you know, you got to be a special kind of breed to be able to sing that stuff. Yeah. Well, yeah, also, yeah. Um, also you do years of training. One of my friends here in the town I live in is training as an opera singer and she's she's in her mid 30s and she started training like getting her voice sort of all worked out and whatnot mm. at age 18 and she's been doing it now for 16 years and she will tell you she's nowhere near singing some of these high notes and she's a soprano like a top soprano right and right. yeah and, i got yeah terry terry you're right it was sad that toby keith passed way too young oh. Yeah, now Toby Keith is a country fellow I would listen mm -hmm. to. I, yes, I was very sad to hear that. Uh -huh. Kelly Clarkson, Johnny Cash. You. Oh, you right. Know. Blind State, Steve Vai, one of the greatest guitarists to ever live, right there. Uh, he's, um, Brian May rates him. I kind of like him. Um, Joe well, Sacchiati. Joe yeah, Sacchiati, just Sanctiani, about Sanctiani, Steve Vai, but they're all Ingr good. Ingvay Malstein, you know, freaking. Oh, I mean. You. You know, that's the, I mean, granted, they're masters of what they did, but, you know, freaking, uh, you know, what, what impact did they really have on music? Freaking, that's what I think should be included when you, when you're talking a great, you know, who's the greatest, what, what kind of impact they do, they, yeah. did they have? How and many I'll people, going, how many people imitate them, you know, freaking. And are um, we going to remember them in one, three, five, 10, 15, 20, 50 years? That's how I write, you know, someone like Hendrix, my brother, my brother who likes to claim he knows a bit about music, asked me mm -hmm. who the hell Jimi Hendrix was. Footprints on the ceiling? I forget who sang that. But... <laughs> it's like, how do you not know Jimi Hendrix? You don't have to be a fan, but you talk, yeah. like you said. Yeah, but so like Hendrix, Hendrix really wasn't that great of a guitarist. He just, no. he just had... He just had his own unique style and, you know. Well, his version to... of Star Spangled Banner is still quoted as one of the best. Well, you know, uh, but I've, it, I've, I've heard, I've heard other people play it better. Freaking. I oh, think he, yeah. wow. You're going to say this to someone who I'm loves just saying, I've heard, we... I've heard other people play it better. I mean, freaking, you know, uh, making that good. guitar really I... weep, you know, freaking, I'm not, you know, Hendrix is good, but. Freaking, yeah, yeah, you know. yeah. No, I'm just saying that because I went to um, near where I was staying. There was a big statue of him playing his guitar on the street, and I had to go and have my photo taken. Oh. <laughs> have my photo taken with that. Oh, yeah. We got, we got Bark Mark in here. What up, Mark? And Terry, Terry. Where apparently we're amusing Terry while he's working on a diamond painting. Woohoo! Oh, hey there, well, Mr. Mark. Mark. Diamond painting. Terry, mm. that makes my eyes cross and gives me migraines. So enjoy mm. your work, sir. I hope hope you're going well right. with it. Right? That's what I can, that's where, yeah, I agree. Hi Little there, Miss Noel. Pebbles. Oh, this stinky and what up? Mm -hmm. What is diamond painting? Is that, I mean, you're not really painting diamonds, right? No, I mean, no, no, no. It no it's, you, you get a canvas and these oh. tiny little pieces that you have to stick yeah, on. Yeah, yeah. It's and really it's, fiddly. Oh. And they're all, they're all color coded and freaking, you have to, you know, freaking mix. It, 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 it's like, it's like a jigsaw puzzle for. Oh, so um, it's like actual, like looking stuck like stone looking things that are put yes, on there. Yes, yeah. yes. Okay, yeah. I and see. They, and they're all different colors and whatnot. And, and it's like um how to kind of like jeweled. Um, put it this way, it, yeah, it's like jewel. Yes, um, yes. Yeah. It's you know like it like you know it's like for someone like like uh 
with the with the Down syndrome, you know, so you could just get focused right into it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, autism, it's tedious. Um, Very autistic. Thank you. That's what I was trying to think of. Yeah, yeah. I, I've got. I get bad migraines, and the pieces are like literally like this big, bigger. And yeah. Mm -hmm. I've tried it, and they give me my like even with glasses. It yeah, I makes, couldn't. No, I can't do them. No, couldn't. No. I mean, you know. They're beautiful. I got, I got that. I got that. I got that ADD. You know, freaking. So it's like, oh, you yeah, got yeah. I well, you know, it's fucking undiagnosed because I didn't do that shit back in my day. But I know something like that. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna walk away from it, freaking, be like, oh, I'll never get something like that done. You know, freaking. No, like I, a I, I don't have ADHD, you know? but as I said, I get severe migraines, and they, if they were a little bit bigger, hmm. maybe. But yeah. It's like trying to do one of them giant jigsaw puzzles. I'd never, I'd never get one of them done either. You know, freaking, like, mm -hmm. uh, get the, I'd I'd get the be... border. If I get the border done and freaking be lucky, you get go beyond. If that, you get you the know? border and the sky done, Jimmy, you've yeah. done real well. Or the water, <laughs> all the same color, and you've got yeah, to like, uh, put the piece. No, they're all the no. fucking same, man. Freaking, I ain't no, gonna touch. I, I, what do I gotta do? I, stack these things up so I can go through every fucking one of them <laughs> to see what. There's fits. always one that drops on the floor that you yeah. miss until you like you've almost the finished. And you've got two no, I'd much rather paint the real paint the brush in my hand on a canvas. Yeah, my parents watch Hendrix at the mon yeah. You you told us you were at Mont the Mont Mont the, that, as I said, I came to Hendrix late, but got to see a lot of places he played and um, the statues and whatnot yeah. in um, Seattle, and it was amazing. Um, uh, Mopop, which is the Museum of uh, Pop Culture in Seattle, has six of his guitars on the wall oh. and just to oh, walk cool. past them. Yeah, it was pretty mm. special. But, yeah, all along the Watchtower. And um, I still – I take your point. Jimmy, that's others have played the Star Spangled Banner better, but not just give me Hendrix, okay? You can have whoever you like. I'll have Hendrix. <laughs> just say it. I mean, I'm, I'm, I've yeah. seen, I've seen a guy play that, and and you know, let's just say the uh, the uh, the Star Spangled Banner. You know, if you you know it, you know, you you know it, and you know when it was written and how it was the, the story of it, right? Mm -hmm. Um. It, it it can bring tears to a guy's eyes, especially from over here. Okay, and, yeah. And let's yeah. just say I know a guy that can play it so sweet he makes your eyes water. <laughs> yeah, and that's powerful. Yeah, but, uh, yeah. That's you know, the power of music. Yeah, you know? yeah. I can I can hear the Australian national anthem. It's the first two bars of that and be bawling like a baby. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, yeah. yeah. Thank you, thank you. It says right there, Megan Ozzy twelve. I sticks and say, uh, let me answer her, her some of her questions first. Uh, Miss Miss uh, Noel, uh, what did I do today? Stuff. What am I gonna do tomorrow? More stuff. More stuff. <laughs> did I have a good day? Yes, I did. Thank you so much for asking, ma'am. And uh, there. Oh, what who's the other girl? Lunch? That's uh, Miss. That's Miss Megan. She's from Australia. Yeah. yeah. Nice to. I can't see the chat, so no, someone's it's okay. gonna. It's okay. It's, <laughs> there's things there for me. Hello. Yeah, um, well, what am I we'll doing? You know. What am I doing six weeks from tomorrow on Sunday? Stuff. <laughs> and uh, Miss about... Noel, Miss JCT is a girl. Uh, oh, the, she's oh. a very lovely girl, by the way. Uh -huh. Oh, thank you for telling me that, Baker. I think I may have called her a male by mistake. My Man. mistake, Jay. My mistake. Usually, Sorry. Usually, the only one that gets mistaken for a female around here. Is is Smitty Shannon Smitty? <laughs> oh, it's a guy. Well, and the other one, Miss <laughs> uh, Mister Nora, just because of the name. Oh, Nora, yeah, 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 well, yes. You know, oh, easy mistakes dots, to make. <laughs> there's dots in that. All those, you know, Nora. We I judge not the names, yeah. but yeah, okay. he's also known as Peaches. So, <laughs> okay, that's a story you're gonna have to tell me when well, they're here to defend themselves. I've I've known him a long time, so. <laughs> oh, okay. Black Black Jimmy's Panthers hated Jimmy hanging out with white people. Yeah, probably. You know. Probably did. Yeah. yeah. Probably did. Like <laughs> at that time, yeah. I could probably understand yeah. why they did yeah. as well. JCT Noel's not known for her manners. 
or sorry, Stinky Ann, <laughs> which is Noelle freaking. She's not known for her bands, but that's all right. Hey, I'm, you you will soon find uh, out, ladies and gentlemen, no, that the well, the no, Aussie has a, no filter whatsoever, and well, that's no, she's, because um, of Aussie. She's um, how say she's special, okay. One of God's special ones, as I would call yeah, my yeah. mother. Well, she'll she'll yeah. tell you she's got a disability. She'll yeah. tell you. Oh, okay. yeah. yeah, yeah. That's why I meant. Yeah, she yeah. doesn't hide it or anything. No, I call my mother one of God's special ones, but I'm not sure who God would probably be. Mm-hmm. No, I kid. Yeah. I kid. But I used to call my ex-husband. Yeah, you're special, all right. You're you're mm-hmm. good, one of, truly one of God's special ones, mother. Not sure. I mean that as a compliment, but there you go. <laughs> Oh no, my mother's all right. But, yeah, so so sorry guys, if you're asking me questions in the chat, I'm on no, Zoom. We'll let you know. We you know can't see it. Um what are you on? What are you what what are you using to stream with? Uh I'm actually uh, so I'm on Zoom, but I don't have a laptop anymore. I have a Surface Pro tablet because I travel a lot and yeah, uh, okay. I, I write a lot. Yeah. So the tablet okay. makes more sense. Yeah, it's yeah. Um, yeah, it's too yeah. small to pull up another window, right? Oh, I probably could, but if I disconnect myself, Jimmy, I will um Yeah, you can just yeah. click the link and come back in. Yeah, I'll um rejoin, but yeah, I, I haven't see. used Zoom for a while because I've used um the and we can one. always read the chat to you. It's not a big deal. Yeah, yeah. it's oh, it's not huge. I just don't want anyone to think I'm ignoring them in the chat because honestly I just can't see nice. it. It's just Miss Noel does ask a lot of questions, and yeah. she I just she just wanted Noelle. you to know that she does have a learning. Uh, she's got learning issues and speech, you know, problems, and she's got ADHD, and so she just wants yeah. you to know that. Well, thank mm-hmm. you for letting me know, Noel. No problem. As I said, sorry if I. I'm gonna. No, I'm not gonna mess with it because. Yeah. I okay. Won't not a problem. And I won't uh, be able Noel. To find it. Noelle, she's in Australia. Depending on where she's at, she's okay, roughly so... 14. Well, hold on. We, we got four time zones over here, just like you do. So it depends on where you're at and where she's at, but it's roughly 14 hours uh, um, ahead of us. It's about 16 and a half because we're on daylight savings. So well, yeah, I... but it, we, do, we do daylight savings here too. So Oh, it's, of course. You know, it, um, it, so it, I... it depends on where you're at here. And I will which, tell you where I'm at. Yeah. So I'm in a town yeah. called Inverell, where my family has been for almost 100 years. If you know right. where Brisbane is, yeah. that's interstate. That's six yeah. hours north of me. North, she says, okay. pointing in the blade. And if you know where Sydney is, it's nine and a half hours south. Um, Inverell is nine and a half hours north yeah. west of Sydney. Yeah. So yeah. I'm on the yeah. east. The eastern side of Australia, not on the coast. We're yeah. inland, six hundred miles. So, yeah, and it's five thirty. Okay. Here we here, oh five thirty. Five thirty p.m. Wednesday. Yeah, so freaking, I mean, I'm at one thirty a.m. on freaking Thursday. Wednesday. So morning. Wednesday. Sorry, yeah. yeah. Wednesday, so yeah. how in your five thirty? What the fuck? Someone do the freaking math. <laughs> I would be able to tell you if I could get to my 12, 30, 40, 15 hours freaking. Um, Seattle from is me. 16 from you. So, yeah, Seattle on the West Coast is 17 and a half hours yeah. on daylight saving. Yeah. So, a couple of yeah. hours. Yeah, I'm in, the, I'm in the central zone. So, okay. Yeah. No, Pacific is 17 hours, 16 and a half hours. Yeah. And, yeah. So, you're, you're still. And how yeah. many times do, do I hear people from your part of the world ask me what the future is like? Yeah. Yeah. Where's the. T- with the lottery number, come on. Problem do you do on. you sit there and tell them it's so bright you got to wear shades? Mm. <laughs> if I never hear an American tell me to throw another shrimp on the barbie, I'll be happy because <laughs> we don't call them shrimp. Okay, I want to give you a basic Australian English lesson here, my friends. Shrimp are prawns here in uh-huh. Australia. Yes, so I know that. Them- most of us know so that. ask me to throw a prawn on the barbie you'll get more more uh-huh. of an affirmative answer than telling me to throw a shrimp on the barbie uh-huh. 
And they just many... get that. They get that from the Dukes of Hazard movie that yeah. the, when they did the remake of that oh, no, movie. Dundee. No, that's no, they, that's Crocodile Dundee. It's Crocodile Dundee. Oh uh, well, then they they also said it in the Dukes of Hazard movie. They yeah, but that's fucking it. thirty yes, years they later. Do. That's they where do. I remember it from. That's thirty but, years later, though. Come on. Yeah, but then again, I had the Dukes of Hazard horn on my one of my four wheelers. <laughs> yeah, but but how old yeah, were you? Yeah, uh, there's a guy who's got this big, not the General Lee, obviously, but this big like car, very yeah. similar to the General Lee, that makes that sound at like four o'clock every morning when he goes to work. How do I know? Because that's my damn alarm clock. When I hear him go past my house, it's time to get up. Yeah, I love Dukes of Hazard back in the day. I know. I, I do. I have the I have the original Dukes of Hazard watch that's still oh, in the no. original box. Yeah. You know, my uh, brother uh, has a plastic general late um, Becca, toy car. Becca, yeah. you were probably quite young when Crocodile Dundee came out because it came out I, in nineteen eighty. Uh, I mean, wasn't as young as you thought. I was twelve when the first Crocodile well, Dundee. Yeah, came. well, I know you, what? but but her. Oh, Becca's, well, yeah. Becca's, I mean, everybody's seen the movie, and Becca's, I did. To be honest with you, I used to have a crush on Paul Hogan. Okay. Well, the young, the young Paul Hogan, like from the Paul movies. Hogan. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, my mother used to live in a different town, as I said. My parents got divorced, and the local cinema had the bar from Crocodile Dundee, like the actual bar that was used in the movie, they had that for their concession stand at the cinema we used to go to as kids yeah. when we would visit our mother. Well, yeah. I'm telling you, I loved his really big life. What up, Koski? <laughs> and, and hey there, Mr. Koski. <laughs> Megan, Megan, how many, how, many, how many people do you know that actually drink Fosters? None, because we... Mm -hmm. None. And you know why? Because we export nasty. it to the wonderful Americans that think it's the best drink ever. No, none like of us. Trust me. Trust me. No one here really likes it. There, hold on. No. Very, I, very, I had a, very I had few a people here. Once because yeah. the bar was out of beer. And it's like, uh -huh. you know how Russians give you yeah. the crappy vodka and keep the yeah. good stuff for themselves? Yeah. I'm like, yep. I get completely why my country yeah, sends it to it's, America. It's, it's yeah. horrible. It, it is. Yeah. Anyone, anyone that knows anything about beer knows Foster's is garbage. Okay. Yeah, I got and, some and, experience and, with um with Australia because uh well back when I was married, okay, me and my ex husband we uh we hosted two Australian students and we oh, let them stay with us for a month while they were over here. Uh, yeah, from from their yeah from their school and stuff and mm -hmm. so they told us so much they of course they brought us you know presents or whatever gifts and yep. um yep. so yeah but they told us all about you know over there and and, uh, what i love about americans when you, they talk about australia you know it's the koalas mm. and it's the kangaroos you know all the cute stuff <laughs> but i have a friend the joke in australia is there are 50,000 ways to die from animals in Australia before you leave your house. Yeah. You yes. Know, I, I, live, I live near the bush. I don't live in the bush. But that is actually true. We, we have, have a friend. Some of the most venomous animals. But I had a friend who wanted to come to Australia to cuddle mm -hmm. a koala. You know, yeah, good luck with that. <laughs> typical tourist thing. And I said, yeah. you could do that. Do you like your face? And he looked yeah. at me like, what are you talking about? And I said, they may look cute and cuddly, but near where yeah. I live, there was yeah. a young three-year-old child who had one side of their face ripped off yeah. by, by a koala. Yeah. The koala was yeah. not attacking, but the little one wanted to have the koala. Yeah, of course. Did. Trust me. And we the have... koala took a fence and scratched at her face and took three yeah. quarters of her face off. We have Sorry. donkeys up. We have dumbass people up here that try to pet the buffalo in, in, in Yellowstone Park. It's like, yeah. Okay, it's a fucking two thousand pound fucking animal. You're gonna go over there and try and pet it? It's a wild you know what animal. I reckon, you know what I reckon should happen in that case, Jimmy? Take oh, all all the warning signs off the enclosures, oh. or fences. There's no enclosures. It's an open park. No, no, no. You know what I mean, like the warning signs. You. And let natural and let Charles Darwin's theory of natural I'm, selection. I'm with you, okay. We gotta if we yeah. gotta give up all that safety crap, okay. Just to thin the hurdle. Oh, I'm not okay? saying we you should have... give up seat belts and helmets and everything, okay? Freaking, no, no, no. Some of yeah. special, just let, special just ones. Just let it happen. Helmets. 
just learn but it. No, it. it's great. Mm -hmm. You really, oh, I had a, mm -hmm. a young friend say, I want to box a kangaroo. Yeah, go you for do it. Know I've, those seen, kangaroos. I've seen the videos. You know, male kangaroos standing on their back legs. If they kick you, yeah, I'll see you, you in you five toast. years. Exactly. We have you, a friend. You know, we have a friend from over there, Josie, freaking that has them in her backyard. <laughs> my brother had. The, yeah. My brother told the story. He used to mm -hmm. live up near one of our local waterways, and mm -hmm. he woke up one morning half asleep, hadn't had his coffee, went out to have a cigarette, and there was a kangaroo lying on his front porch, uh -huh. like sleeping you know yeah the kangaroo looked at him he looked at the kangaroo and went their separate ways but right but what i don't think americans understand and i'm not sort of saying all americans don't understand this <laughs> but yeah you want to cuddle the koala okay yeah <laughs> we're known for the koalas yeah. you want to box a kangaroo i hope your life insurance is paid up they yeah. we have fifty thousand of the mm -hmm. most dangerous animals in the world. And that's not including in our oceans. And you uh -huh. want to come here to mess with our wildlife. <laughs> yeah. Good luck. Have fun. Nice knowing you. But, yeah, no, um, yeah, friends of mine are like, you've got 50,000 animals that can kill you before you walk out your front door. Yeah, and that doesn't include the spiders, the lizards, the snakes. Yeah, but um, yeah, we're very, we are very blessed. We have some of the most beautiful nature. <laughs> Fucking bark, Mark. I owned a four twenty seven sixty nine Caprice back in where I'm sitting. I can see where I drove it off a cliff over my neighbor's family's gathering upside down. Ooh, that sounds like fun, Bark. That's like fun. <laughs> you obviously survived if you're telling the yeah. story. Yeah, I mean, I barrel rolled the freaking. A uh, seventy-one Cutlass once upon a time. <laughs> cutlass is how did you? Uh, no, that's, but how I do you barrel? You want to know how, how you barrel roll, roll a cutlass? A cutlass, it's a tank, isn't it? Well, it's made. It's made to go straight. Okay, it's oh, made to go straight. Yeah. Okay, and um, let's just say I was young and dumb and didn't know that, and um, we were drag you racing. To go see me. We were you drag went. racing, and um, uh, at the end of the strip, I never let off. I never let off oh, it, because there was a, there's an off ramp that led you onto the highway and I, you know, to the, to the exit ramp. And I was, I just wanted to be the first to get to the ramp and, you know, it was a little further and you're supposed to back off on the corner. I was, I went through it a little too hot a and it went sideways, hot. it went sideways, hit the, the side, you know, hit the curb sideways and just rolled through. Luckily, okay. it landed, yeah, I, can... I, I was lucky it landed on its wheel. Freaking, and the guy I was racing, freaking, had the mind enough to hit the brakes and stop and see if I was okay. And all I did is grab the. When you see, okay, there's your first mistake. The Aussie would go, "Wow, that's impressive." I'm well, yeah, 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 yeah. Well, well, he was the only one that saw it, you know. So it was like two oh, o'clock. Okay. It was yeah, like two yeah. o'clock in the morning, you know, freaking. And uh, but he stopped and freaking come over to get me. I was in a little bit of shock, but I was freaking. I didn't so know what's the boat. Did you get yourself at all aside from the shock? Were you injured at all? No, 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 because I was I was strapped in. I wasn't oh, no I helmet or nothing, okay. but I was strapped in. And freaking, luckily, luckily, I had enough wits about me to just get out of the car and fucking get in his car and get the fuck out of there. <laughs> yeah, it's just like um, I do actually own this car. I'm still paying it off. <laughs> you know what? No, I, don't I, care. I, I no, I only pay. I only paid fifty bucks for it. I was lucky to fucking. Oh, okay. It. You yeah, know, yeah, yeah. It, it was it was a rust, complete rust bucket, freaking. Oh, so if you and, had a, well, not it, so much if you had it written yourself off, but if you had it written that off, it would have been a well, same. Yeah, you know, I didn't give a fuck. I was like fucking fifteen. I didn't even have a. I didn't even have a legal driver's license right at at the time. Hey, hey, no, the we have the popo. Oh. We have the popo in the uh, chat. I don't know if he's still there. Are you wanting to admit this and incriminate yourself on uh, camera? Oh, so? oh, it's all good, freaking. It's way back. This is freaking oh, 40, 40 something years ago. Yeah, freaking. Besides, I didn't name the town it happened in. Freaking. <laughs> but no, yeah, I barrel. I barrel rolled. I didn't. I, I didn't have a driver's license, and the car wasn't even registered. The plate on it was borrowed from the apartments down the street. <laughs> Again, you want to yeah. recruit? I couldn't uh, stick around. I <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, gosh. Mm -hmm. oh, excuse me. 
Oh, they were solid, but this thing, this thing I was driving, Bark Mark, was a complete freaking piece of shit. And they, the, the rust on the rear quarters above the tires went like all the way up to like an inch from the trunk. <laughs> it was fucking hard, but it, but it, you know, it ran good. <laughs> it didn't look good though. It was fucking complete turd. Like I said, but it that was the thing about cars in, the, cars in those days. They were built. My brother hit a oh, yeah. Talk about uh, can, um, kangaroos. My brother has a like an SUV. We call them utes, utility vehicles. Yeah, he has a has a bull bar and a rhubar, basically a bull bar that admits a, a a beam to knock out the kangaroos. And he hit a roo outside of town. Excuse me, at a reasonable speed, like he wasn't breaking the law or anything. And he came back into town and he said, have a look at the fifty uh at the four thousand dollars worth of damage to my car. And I'm looking going, you know, it's all in one piece. And he I said, I can't see it. Where is it? I had to get down at eye level of the bumper bar and the engine had pushed back to where he would have been sitting if he was in the passenger seat. And it would have hit him in the gut. Yeah. And it was four grades worth of damage that you couldn't see mm. out the front. But the thing was, where most of the damage was, was the bumper bar. But mm -hmm. it's all one piece with these yep. little screws. And if you bend the screw, one screw in the middle, you've got to take the whole thing off and replace it. Because yeah. you can't get a single screw to do it. Yeah, yeah, and it's challenging. Cars can be yeah. a pain in the ass nowadays, man. you gotta, you got to take it. Come on, there are cars you got to take the whole front end apart just to change a headlight. Freaking... But JCT, yeah, you did good, girl. Freaking a teenager wrecked your car. But hey, uh, did you buy that pickup truck? Come on, that freaking. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah, she was saying that the angel saved her. And you know what? They yeah. saved her for a reason. Yeah, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, someone's got to take care of them dogs that she freaking takes care of. She's mm -hmm. got a bunch of, she's got a bunch of misfit dogs she takes care of. Never mind the little garden that she does, Ricky. Oh, excuse me. I had to go get another can. I don't want to want a dress. Come on, girl. You look good in a dress. Just saying. Okay. Cheers. I've Cheers. got I've got to wear a dress four days straight, not the same one for church for Easter. Okay. No one you needs know. to see that ever. Well, hey, come on, you know. Not enough women wear them these days, I'll say that. No, well, it's because y'all y'all want to see the little black, black dress. <laughs> hey, Coco Chanel had it right when hey. she said every lady should have a little black dress. I've got <laughs> six in my got six and I've never yeah. seen the light of day in my wardrobe, but mm. just saying. Yeah. It ain't a race car, right? Uh-huh. Oh, oh, here we go. Hang on. What are those little dresses? I can't think of what those dresses are called. They were, they were, I don't know if they're still popular mm -hmm. now, but a lot of men said that they really loved them. And they're the ones that go all the way to the, um, to the, to the floor, you know, the, yeah. um, oh, maxi dress. Oh, no. yeah, maxi dress. Yeah. There's maxi a lot, there's dress. a lot of men that say that they actually really love those. Women look good in a dress. It doesn't have to be a mini dress. Um, Jimmy, freaking... I just saw the chat stinky. I don't have a job at the moment. I, I live stream, I do streaming to Seattle, but I'm also, well, I'm kind of a author. I'm writing a book. So stinky. I just saw your question, dude. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, we... That's no, up. I managed right. to find how to yeah. have a quick look at the chat before I press the wrong yeah, button. Yeah, it's way up. Well, hey, well, um, you could... okay, yeah. So, what do you got it in behind you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I just you found how to. You know, you know what? If you have it behind you, do you know how to minimize screens? Yeah, that's what I just did. That is yeah, literally what that's, I just did. That's how I have it here, freaking. Yeah. I, you know, freaking. I got. I need really need to get another monitor, but. Oh, I probably should get something. It's just um, I'm just gonna quickly just mm -hmm. flick through and see while I've got it. Uh, Miss JCT, do, do do women actually wear pantyhose anymore? Are, yes, are they, are yes. They? yes. Oh, well, speaking, I'm not sure if you could call me a lady, Becca, but yeah, depending on the dress and how short it is, I will wear yeah. a pair and the shoes I'm wearing. Yeah, 
Yeah. yeah. Sure. Oh, okay. Yeah, I didn't think about the being the shortness of them. Yeah. yeah. If it's down well, below my knees, leg, you know, uh, you know. Uh, um, if it's below my knees, I probably wouldn't. Um, but if mm. I'm wearing heels, I probably would. It just depends, uh, and it depends also um, where I am. Like, I probably won't probably won't in church because I'm wearing longer well, dresses. Even if it, you know, I mean, if you. If you think you're gonna get lucky that night, even if you got a full length dress, there, there's some sexy, you know. Uh, I wonder. Just Becca, saying, do you know? inquiring minds need to know what Jimmy's talking just about saying. now? He knows, just or saying. we just let it go. There's, there's, I'm just <laughs> saying, you know. I, know. I was say the last thing I think I used pantyhose for mm -hmm. was uh. No, oh, two things actually. One was to put mothballs in for the squirrels underneath the hood of the the, the truck, and the other thing was a uh, fish bait. Uh-huh. Yeah, you put fish bait no, in them. Um, well, you know, um, if I'm wearing stiletto heels because that makes me, yeah. you know, a little taller. Yeah. Yes. But usually below the if I'm wearing a skirt, which again happens rarely but has happened, um mm -hmm. maybe it depends though, because I don't as a general rule wear heels because I've got ankle problems. Yeah, it just depends. <laughs> Just, just say, two no, minutes. Hey. Come on, JCT. You got to be with better than the than the minute, man. Come on. <laughs> as know? I said, I'm going to be in chat for four days okay. and three and a half, and then they're going to be in confession. I can just yeah, see. Well, you know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, who am I kidding? Four days of confession and maybe some oh, church. Oh, come on. <laughs> you, just, you just roll that all up and run. Doctor, Father, I have sinned. Father, I have sinned. I know that, Jimmy. You know? Father, I have sinned. I have no. Yeah. I know Jimmy, and I'm about to go back on his stream. Yeah. Forgive uh, me. I'm out later. I, I've been a drunk. I've been, a, you know. Um, you I have sinned, Father. Let's really, just stop right there. Yeah, you really don't have to. You really don't have to itemize, okay? You know. No, it's just like, look, Lord, I've sinned. You've seen what I've done before. I've done it. Why yeah. do I have to tell you? Yeah. I'm out yeah. later. You know, right. Um, so I'd, I'd go in there and I'd just say, I've sinned. Enough said. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. well, well, no, it's like, Lord, you are all knowing, all powerful, and all wise. So mm -hmm. why do you need to me to remind mm -hmm. you of what I've already done and what I'm right. about well, to do? That's, that's I, I have not sinned. Well, there goes my first one. Yeah, yeah uh -huh. I have not sinned, Lord. <laughs> Whatever you saw mm -hmm. was not me. Yeah, okay. Let's just, say, let's just say I ain't I ain't telling that to no priest, all right? I'll no, talk to the I'll talk to I'll the talk Lord to the, in my I, own time. Exactly, Jimmy. Cut out the middleman. Talk to the you big know, man himself. I exactly not. I ain't been in a church in fucking thirty freaking years, man. Oh well, blind straights are used them for fishing as well. So yeah. okay, okay. For the non-fisher person here, Becca, how do you use stupid question? Sorry, from the Aussie. How do you use pantyhose for fishing? You put your bait inside of it. It's like the the bait that that really doesn't go on a hook. You can't really keep it on a hook. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that... hmm. Yeah. Wow. A lot of people will use either pantyhose or they'll use what they call tubular gauze. You know, yeah, stuff yeah. like that. Yeah, yeah stuff okay. like that. Yeah. What I've up? Never Chas had... Chasing America's in the house. What's up, girl? How you doing? Hey. Hey there, Miss Erica. How you doing, Wynn? Mm hmm Patty Hose stays in the tackle box. Well, there you go. I learned something today that you can use panty hose to go fishing. There you yeah. go. You know what you could else you can use it. Yeah, for. that's what I said. And if you get squirrels or stuff that are rats or whatever that, that gets under you know, some people's get under their hood, you know, their vehicle, uh, in their mm -hmm. engines and stuff and they chew up their hose. So you can actually put the like mothballs or you know, stuff like yeah. that in the panty hose and put them underneath your hood. Mm -hmm. See, I'm learning so much stuff from you guys already, and I've been here what an hour. If you, that, you, you know, another thing you can use it for is um, you put rock salt in it and you throw them on your roof to help melt the ice. Oh, <laughs> I had heard of that. Yeah. All right. Somebody... and, and and you can also fill them fill them full of freaking sand and throw them up at the bats when they're flying by to get the bats to come down, and you can catch a bat that way. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, Wake yeah. Up free. No, yeah, when you I'm got, sorry, when I'm you got a bunch of bats you, flying overhead, throw one of them We've got fruit bats that come to town yeah. and wreck everything. Yeah, yeah okay. You throw, you throw a shot, nylon yeah, through yeah. a fucking, because they'll bite onto it and it brings them to the ground because they think they're biting a prey and they come to the ground to eat it and freaking, and then you catch it. We used to catch bats all the time that way. Okay. Yeah, As I said, cool. I'm learning so mm-hmm. been here. Just met you and learned tackle boxes have pantyhose yeah, yeah. in them. See, if uh, I hadn't seen that without knowing what you're using yeah. it for, I'd be thinking, what kind of freak, fisherman freak are you with pantyhose? And you but, can also, um, you know, like you if you get runs in them, them too. You, you know, when you get runs in them, them, most people most people just throw them away. You know, once you get runs or holes or stuff <laughs> like that in them. Uh, well, you know, they're so soft, you can actually use them as polishing cloths as well. So you don't, Polish once they cloth, get, yeah, my, once they get a run in them or something like that, to, you don't have to throw them away. My grandmother used to use them for polishing cloths and jewel, uh, jewelry cleaners for like rings and uh-huh. things. And I think at one point she used to use them for cleaning, you know, like the fine um, silverware for like Christmas and stuff as well to polish the, the silverware as well. Uh-huh. Yeah. Or like when you have um uh my my uh daddy taught me this one. If you like sometimes you know how when you have like backs of your earrings or stuff like that, or you know, you got yeah. something really tiny and maybe it's even a little tiny screw or something, and you drop it on the floor and you can't find it. Yeah. I mean, how many times mm-hmm. we drop something on the floor, no matter where we look, we can't find it, right? Well, you can mm-hmm. actually put the panty hose on your vacuum cleaner hose oh, and like yes, put a rubber band yes. around it and then as it sucks up I it'll suck those mine. little items up but it won't go into your vacuum yeah because you'll be luck. able to find them good, good luck idea, finding yeah. stuff like that in your vacuum cleaner in the dust and bleh. yeah yeah that's all a right. good one too all right we're gonna have a little musical interlude it's a short one i don't know i should didn't do the whole song but um uh freaking Chase in America if you can sing does a lot of singing. So uh, All right. Well I'm gonna duck out for just one moment to use the facilities and I will be right back. All right. Well, yeah, and I'm gonna go get me something to drink. Fine. I'll play it myself. Sandra D. Uh-huh. All right, I guess that was the whole song. <laughs> My bad. But anyways, Jason America, folks. Check her out. Oh, what's up, the Hinderer Collector 41, also known as Skywarp. How the hell are you, brother? Good to see you. What have you been up to? Uh huh. Wait, did I miss anything? If I lean or small, what? Huh? Right, I didn't miss much. Yeah, I got my dancing shoes on. There you go. Mm hmm. Yeah, all in 24 hours, JCT, mothballs are small, 
Yeah, and they smell bad. <laughs> well, fly. What? Yo, Jimmy, I'm a good man. Good to hear. Good to hear, Skywalk. Good to hear. Man. Freaking. It's great seeing you over here. Huh? Freaking. Rare day you come in here, man. Freaking. Especially two o'clock in the morning. Hell yeah. Oh, yeah, Tiffany's a great, she's a great mod, man, freaking. All right, you want to hear another? Yeah, well, we should probably wait till Becky gets in here, but we can play another one. I, simply because I love listening to her. Chasing America, that is. She did a great version of Look at Me, I'm Sandra D. I was walking uh, past tonight. Oh, uh, you did hear it? Yeah, she's I heard she's a little awesome. bit of it, yeah, it's fantastic. Yeah, she's awesome like that, freaking. Freaking, uh, let's see, freaking find another, find another one. Oh, I, I ain't played this one. Oh, maybe I did. Maybe I'll did. play it again because you haven't played it Oh, you me. know what? I didn't play the video of it. Freaking, I didn't play the video of it because, oh, what, play what? Well, yeah, okay. Freaking. Oh, come on. Come on, stop, stop messing with me. There we go. Freaking. Nope, not that that one. You freaking come on. Yeah, that one. Hey, honey, J and J, how are you? Good to see you. What up, JJ? Good to see you, friend. Sitting in the morning sun I'll be sitting when the evening comes Yeah, watching the ships roll in And I'll watch them roll away again Yeah, sitting on the dock of the bay Watching the tide Um, vi video clip with all the different yeah, yeah. war loop. That is awesome and what yeah. a beautiful voice. Yeah, she does well. She does well. In fact, I'll I'll put her I'll put her link in the private chat to make it easier for you to click. Yeah, it. I'll definitely go and check her out. I love that Otis Redding. That's that's my that is music compared right. to what oh, crap. Yeah. The original that. and that beautiful version. That is way better than the Hey, one. hey, uh, Erica, you did a good job. 
Uh, you did You've impressed job. me, whistle, Eric. Oh, well whistle, done. The whistling was just fine. Just fine. Oh, I can't whistle, Eric. So the yeah. fact that you can in tune. Mm -hmm. Yeah, way better well, job than I do at it. That's for sure. <laughs> My idea of whistling is, hey, you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, she does, she does do really well. The only thing I, I think I really, well, I don't know. I just sing up here for fun, but uh, the only thing I truly ever really, everybody wants me to always sing is just that devil went down to Georgia. <laughs> well, that's right. With or without the fiddle, though, girlfriend, because if you're not doing the fiddle, I'm not listening. Sorry. Not sorry I can't do the fiddle. Oh, can't or I also don't have the real devil here either. <laughs> what? No. There was a line I was going to say about Jimmy. But I, this is my first time here, and I'd like to come back. Oh, yeah. No problem. <laughs> You're welcome back. But, um, no, you, that... never know, you never know what's happening, Annie, over here or who's I used here to... or what. So. Love That's watching what my daddy whistle. Life. My daddy could whistle, like, all these different things and yeah, in different ways. And, yeah, yeah and then he could, he could wiggle his ears. I always loved watching him wiggle oh, his ears, and he could wiggle his ears while he was whistling, mm -hmm. and that I thought that was just the neatest thing. I can't wiggle my ears like he did. Oh, I can't wiggle my ears, but I can do this, which is a genetic trait that not many have. Mm -hmm. the, the tongue curl. It's genetics. I don't know if Erica did any. I can curl my I'm looking at it now. <laughs> I can curl yeah, mine, but they don't go all the way together like yours. What? Mine looks more like a U shape. Oh, I'm yeah. I'm pushing that together, like. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Oh, you're doing it with the inside of your cheeks. Yeah, I'm doing it with my cheeks. This is it normally without it. So you can see when my cheeks suck in. That's when it gets closer. <laughs> and Jimmy, just have a I'm just going to let them talk, and I'm not going to say away. Yeah, I can't Sorry. do the full the full curvature where they're like going into each other, but I can. My tongue is really long, and I can do something else. Jimmy, cover your ears. Mm. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> what? No, don't worry. Jimmy's like, what? What are we talking about? No, don't worry. Don't worry. We'll, we'll tell you in private chat, Jimmy. Mm -hmm. Oh, he knows mm. how I am. <laughs> mm. Oh, Becca, I can tell we're going to get along just fine. Yeah, just, that's, I usually, I, well, I don't. I'm usually, uh, and I'm not doing it now, but I usually don't drink. That's why I don't drink up on panels because I get a oh, lot I drink worse. On panels. Mm -hmm. I drink on panels and then remind myself of how bad I was when I'm watching mm -hmm. a replay. But I, I can't drink a lot, thankfully. So, oh no, it just takes me a little, and, and I get, I, I get a lot worse. I mean, I, I so I, that's why I usually don't do that up here. I think I'd probably get his stream shut down. <laughs> oh my oh excuse me for one moment i'm just freaking out because i just got a um a uh instagram notification and i'm just about to hyperventilate here people that oh. one of my favorite voiceover actors in video games has just responded to a message I sent him this morning. Oh my OMG, I'm gonna pass out here in a minute. Just give me one second to compose my, <laughs> to compose myself because he and I actually share a birthday. He's two years younger than I am. And I'm just hyperventilating. Just give me one second, Jimmy. Oh uh, yeah, do what you gotta do. <laughs> I'll be with you in a minute when I stop. I'm yeah. gonna mute. Because I'm going to start screaming uh, in delight. That... <laughs> okay, I'm fine. I'm just going internally <laughs> berserk, but I'm good. <laughs> yeah, I, I freaked oh, out when some when some big YouTubers have joined up in here. Freaking but Alice uh, Caper, wow! I love oh, me some so Alice Caper. Oh. I'm so excited right now. That's insane yeah. because he messaged me twice on X or Twitter or whatever the heck yeah. it's called. And he's just messaged me twice on Instagram. So, yeah. Yeah. okay, I'm good. I'm fine. Okay. I'm fine. Crush. Go ahead, crush. Oh. Uh. <laughs> 
Geeko, how anyway, you sorry, to Jimmy, it? I completely <laughs> derailed that. No, it's all right. I, it's all right. Chasing Nick America. Allen, text your set. This, uh, Chasing America, I just am about to subscribe and have a look at more of your magnificent mm -hmm. singing. Oh, because, she's got um, a lot. She's She does a she, lot of different a, genres, too, you know, freaking. Or, well, or, the fact that, yeah. uh, as I said, I walk, was walking to the bathroom, which is just out this door, and heard, look at me, I'm Sandra D. Pitch uh -huh. perfect. And then sitting on the dock of the bay. Yeah. Well done. I wish I could sing like Why do you hear her do Fleetwood Mac? <laughs> I'm looking forward. I will definitely be subscribing and I am yeah. definitely going to be. She does She does Fleetwood Mac so good that I get a, I'll get a copyright claim for it being an original. <laughs> From Fleetwood Mac and you'll say Basically, it's... yeah. You know, they're, yeah. You know, whoever oh, they're, wow. they're, uh, they're, you know, whoever does their shit, but yeah. Yeah, no, I love, I love listening to people like that, Jimmy. I mean, I, I yeah. sing in church, but if you've got an iota of talent, which she does. Mm -hmm. Someday, someday she'll either retire or get, or get a day job and be able to join us. <laughs> yeah, but, no. I, I, but she's at work right now. Freaking so. Oh, is she? Oh, yeah. that's a shame, yeah. but. Yeah, no, I'm definitely subbing. I won't do it now, but um, oh, I love people like that. Yep. Yeah, she's got some skills, without a doubt. I am going to have to love you and leave you, Jimmy. Don't be. All right, don't be. Well, I don't. Well, it's six, six o'clock, and it's time for dinner. So yeah, I need okay. To... I appreciate you coming up. It was nice meeting you. Well, thank you. Yeah, and, thank um, you for having me, and um. It was nice meeting you, Miss Megan. You too, Becca. Miss Becca. Sorry. I know I know it's a southern thing. Um my my apologies, but no, it's great meeting you and everyone in the chat. I'll go back and respond to the chat now. Um Oh, before you before you leave, how did mm. you end up in here? Uh, you can, your handsome face came up on my I just finished watching the hockey and was going off um, YouTube, and your handsome oh. face came up on my um recommended. The recommended YouTube did their job right today. And <laughs> how can I resist this face? Mm -hmm. cool, I'm cool. going to be careful because there's three ways I can answer that. <laughs> and as I said, I want to come back. Um, I was going to say you're going to give him a big head. Hey, you know, freaking. I've heard it before, you know. I mean, <laughs> notice he's not everyone. telling me to notice, Becker, if you will. He's not saying, Can you please stop? I'm getting embarrassed. He's going, Keep going. I'll tell you when to stop. <laughs> <laughs> um, but no, it, it just came up. I must have subbed to you somewhere along the line. I don't honestly remember how. Sorry, Jimmy. And it just oh. came up. Oh, so you were already up. subbed? Or? Well, I must have been because I went to sub. And I had clicked the button, anything? but oh, I didn't okay. put notifications on. Yeah. So oh, okay. 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 And well, um, well, yeah, it just said that you were live, and I thought I don't want well, to be doing. I don't want to be doing awesome. any writing today. And well, yeah, you maybe you must have caught me in a different stream somewhere or something. And I probably you know? did, but I mm -hmm. like subscribed to like I think 120 streams. Yeah. Um, so please don't be offended if I've met you before no, and you say no, hello no. and I don't remember you. Hey, um, I used to I used to sub to a lot of streams while I was shit faced. Okay. <laughs> I, I don't to, do that, I, but yes. I used to um, pop up, you know, when people put the link in the chat, I used to pop up panels that I had no idea who was in the room, but they had the link in the chat. So I I'm like, like that too. And, and then, it's funny. And then I'd be like later, I'd be like, hey, how do I who, when did I sub to these people? How did I you? Where did How I did... meet you? And then and I look connected. at the, yeah, and then I look at the stream and like, um, or like their channel. Like, why did I ever click in here? <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm on a lot of, obviously, as you can see behind me, on a lot of Seahawks and mm -hmm. Kraken, um, so hockey and football chat. But then I meet somebody else or, or, or someone yeah. from there on the stream like this, and it'll like JJ. Who I've known mm -hmm. for a while, and it's like, oh, oh, good to oh, see JJ, you. Well, hunting and stuff with John and J and J. He's been yeah. a buddy of mine since the beginning. Freaking, 
Yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I know him on a couple of different yeah. places. And then he, as you saw, he said hello. Mm -hmm. And it's like, oh, yeah. hey, dude. Yeah, great. Yeah, One yeah. place I know, you know. But mm -hmm. the thing is, I only started doing this probably 18 months ago. Like, I'd be in chat, but coming up yeah. on stream, as I said, with my anxiety, never yeah. would have happened. Yeah. Um, but, but see how much, got, see how much, see how much happiness it brings you when you do, though. You know, and you get me like, talking on crap on any now, like myself. I freaking, you know, I find I get I get in the depression mode, you know, and yep. freaking, yep. a lot of yep. times, you know, I've been doing this, I do two streams a week l l l religiously. All right, and there mm -hmm. are times where, like, I just don't want to go out, I don't want to do it, I don't want to yep. do it, I don't want to, I get that, and, and, I, and I suck it up. And I get up in here and I do it anyways. And next thing you know, I'm happy as pie that I actually fucking did it. You know? Yeah. It's like oh, I get yeah. I get depression as well. As I said, my dad's anniversary of his sudden passing was yesterday. And I, I didn't want to do a thing yesterday. I didn't mm -hmm. want to get out of bed, get dressed, anything. Uh -huh. but, but as you said, made the effort to go on a stream yesterday. And again, today, I'm still yeah. sort of dealing with it. And it's like, yeah. I didn't, like you it, said, it, I, I didn't really want to do that. But... Mm -hmm. Wow, I'm glad I did. Yeah, yeah. Now you had a couple chuckles and freaking, you know, you got a <laughs> smile on your. Yeah, I got thing. to, I got to hear Erica sing, mm -hmm. yeah. and you got it to was... learn how to use panty hose. Mm -hmm. Panty hose and tackle boxes. <laughs> mm -hmm. Good lord! If I woke up and said, "You know what? I'm spending right. the day in bed," I wouldn't know these things now. See, and, now, <laughs> see, and you go on to. I learned something today too. Come on, I learned. I learned you know? a lot. I learned. Mm -hmm. Probably some things I should have learned, but then more that I should have probably learned years ago. But no, I get that, Jimmy. Um, this mm -hmm. this time of year is particularly rough. But the one thing I've learned with depression, I have a few mental health mm -hmm. issues. Is if you make the effort, like a couple of mm -hmm. days ago, I was really depressed, and I got I got up and had a shower, mm -hmm. and that was the only thing I did that whole day. Mm -hmm. But the fact I got out of my head enough to say, you know what, I need a shower, mm -hmm. went into the bathroom, had the shower, felt so much better for it. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, I didn't, need to, doubt. I didn't need to do anything for the rest of the day, you know, because I yeah. was so happy yeah, that I did yeah. that. Oh, I, I get it mm -hmm. totally, as I said, around this time of year. And then it depends on which setting you have your shower head on is how long you stay in there. <laughs> I have two forty-five. A kilo mm. gas tanks. They're about my height uh -huh. in gas. I've been in this house 20 years. I can stand in the shower all damn day and I'm going to have hot water because those mm -hmm. tanks, it takes a lot of consistent use to run mm -hmm. those tanks dry. 23 mm -hmm. years, um, no, mm -hmm. almost 20 years and I am yet to run those bastards dry in the shower. I've run them right. dry elsewhere. And mm -hmm. But about Jimmy, I get it with depression, man. Yeah, after my dad died, I got it really quite significantly, and mm -hmm. it's the small, it's the small uh, victories. Well, you come well, online, well, you have a shower. Yeah, you yeah, know. yeah, yeah. It is, it is, and you know, and the thing with it when you lose your parents, you 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 know, it never you never heal, but it gets easier. It gets easier, and you you know they're always with you. I think my parents have been gone. Both of them have been gone for over twenty years. But I still think about them every day. You know? Well, as so. I said, my nephew is Oliver Damien John, and John Damien was my father's name backwards. Mm -hmm. And I see so much in that little rat bag. Yeah. Um, I adore, I adore him. And I see uh -huh. so much. He looks like my dad. He sounds like my dad. He rolls mm -hmm. his eyes like my dad. At me, right. You know? Right. And um, he was born. Uh, on the 21st of August, of, and my dad was the 18th. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. One, one, um, one, of the, one, of the, one of the proudest moments in my life was when uh, I went to a uh, grade school reunion at a bar. You know, it was just, just mm -hmm. a bunch of the old kids. Yeah, you know, I found them on Facebook, and, and yep. apparently, like 15 of them still hang out together at, a, at mm. this one bar. So I was like, oh, fuck, I'll go down and hang out with them. And the proudest moment was when freaking one of them looks at me, knew my father real well. You, you know, he's like my. He was at my mm. house a lot. He knew my, you know, and he did everything I did. So he, he knew my father well. And he looked at me. He's like, dude, you turned into your father. You sound like him. You walk like him. You act like him. You yep. became your father. And I was like, oh, damn. <laughs> well, you. see, when I, was, when I was a kid, because my parents got divorced in a pretty messy mm. divorce, 
I always knew that I'd push my father too too, too far with whatever uh -huh. I did. When I heard the immortal phrase, Jesus effing Christ, you're being uh -huh. like your mother. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. But I got that after um, about six months after my dad died, maybe mm -hmm. a year. I, I got that exact same thing. Your father would be so proud of you and how you've dealt mm -hmm. with everything. Uh -huh. Would he? <laughs> I, I, okay, thank you. I yeah. did what I had to do. Um, and my brother now is six foot tall. My dad wasn't that tall, but he is a dead sweep for my father. You mm -hmm. can tell that they are father and son, you know. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, oh. I, I, my brother gets it all the time. You look like your father. You sound like him. You take no shit mm -hmm. like he did, you know. And for me now, seven years after the event, that is the greatest mm -hmm. compliment I can get is mm -hmm. your father would be proud. Mm -hmm. You are so much like your father. At mm -hmm. uh, my grandma, um, my great aunt, my um, grandfather's sister said, you are so much like your father. It's frightening. <laughs> and I mean that in a good way. Um, uh -huh. Yeah. But, yeah, it's, uh, it's only been seven. I was talking to my mum about it this morning, and I still cannot say my father's name in the past tense. Mm -hmm. I've not said that he's dead or he has died mm -hmm. yet. I, oh, well, still, I just did. I, he's I still just there, did. But he's still there, you know. Come on. You know what, um, I mean? That's what I'm saying? Yeah, I, I, exactly. So and, many, uh, it's like I can't pick up a tool without being reminded of. You know, well, my... Can't work on my car without being reminded of him. You know, my you know. dad, um, he passed away. I was with. He was on life support. The whole thing. Uh, I was with him the whole the whole catch, time. Catch you later, hunting and stuff. Later, go. Later, J and J. That's and, not JJ. Yeah, that's a different hunting and stuff. Oh, that's a different one. Sorry, mm -hmm. sorry, I can't see the chat. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. I'll blame it on that. Um, but there was a very distinct smell of his deodorant in my mm -hmm. bedroom. A few days after he passed, as if he mm -hmm. had stood in my bedroom and sprayed his deodorant. Yeah. Can you say aqua velva? <laughs> <laughs> so, Dad, really, that stuff stinks. Go and do it in the butt. And then I was about to say to him, why did you spray that in here? And then realized he had died two days mm -hmm. before. Yeah, it was really uncanny. And then felt him brush my face when mm -hmm. I was half asleep. And looked at him like I'm looking at you, and he was in front of me, but he died a week before, you know. Yeah, really mm -hmm. insane. But yeah, the greatest compliment I have ever gotten was your father would be proud. But, I'm, um, su I'm surprised I don't wear up with the whole. <laughs> I, know, I, I, know, I know how you feel, girl. As I said, I, I lost mine unexpectedly, and I lost my daddy just a few months after my mama passed. Oh my goodness, my condolences. Yes, and they were both they were both unexpected. I did CPR on my mom and I couldn't save her. She died in my oh, arms. Ooh. Well, I um my brother rang me at home and he said, I've called an ambulance for dad. Wait, what? Oh, dad asked me to call an ambulance. Okay, firstly, my father could be three steps away from death, but he would still uh -huh. not go to the hospital, the doctor. So instantly I know that's bad. Yeah. When you hear, I've just called an ambulance. Right. Then anyway, mm -hmm. he comes and picks me up. We go to the hospital. He's laughing and joking and, you know, flirting with nurses. And we're looking at each other going, he's fine. <laughs> really? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> anyway, he gets Maddie back to a hospital three and a half hours away. And mm -hmm. he was fine. He was conscious. He was laughing, you know, flirting. Next mm -hmm. day, we go to the hospital three hours away and he is covered head to toe in full life support. He yeah. is unconscious. And I'm just mm -hmm. like, yeah. what the F is going on here? Three and a half weeks later, he comes off life support. And I will never forget the day he came off life support because I was standing outside the ICU and they couldn't sedate him to take the, the pipes out of his throat. So they pull them out. But the problem was his vocal cords tightened around them because you've only got like this much room and they ripped his vocal cords out. And I remember charging into the room, seeing the doctor hold the tube with his bloody vocal cords hanging off it. And I've just gone, um, they're supposed to be inside his throat. What the F? <laughs> and there was the only time I blew up at the doctors because they looked after him 
so well and he's grabbing at his throat in agony. Anyway, long story short, she wanted to come home to die, get him home yeah. in hospital. Four days later, he died. Mm. And I sat up at the exact moment he passed. And I know he passed because my brother told me the time of death. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. I sat up in bed and felt a cold shiver go down my spine. Mm. I, yeah, it was insane. But um, now mm. when I hear I live near the hospital and the helicopters fly over, I hit the ground with PTSD. I, I can't deal with helicopters anymore, which is a shame. But anyway, sorry to bring it all down. Oh, it's all right. No worries, man. Sometimes yeah. you just have to get it out. That's yeah. kind of, Sometimes that's the best therapy that's right a, there. This thing, oh, it is. That's it what is. this <laughs> is all about. It's a, you know, it, 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 you never know where this conversation is going to go over here. And oh, just let goodness. It roll. Yeah, sure. Oh, no, you I, know I, what? Even just, you know, from like reading in the chat and everything, there's a mm -hmm. lot of people in the chat that they understand just as well because mm -hmm. a lot of them are saying, you know, how they've lost so many people. Yeah. And, um, yeah, Chase, Chase in America says she could smell her dad's cologne in her house a lot, you know, and yeah, says it's so I, comforting, you know. So I, because I ended up with pretty severe insomnia and, and night terrors. Mm -hmm. I would spray his deodorant on my pillow. It was mm -hmm. the only thing that would calm me enough to get mm -hmm. let me have at least a couple of hours of sleep and okay. not okay. spray it like air freshener. Yeah. But yeah, and had a t shirt wrapped around a pillow that he'd given mm -hmm. me. It sat like <laughs> I'm cringing internally saying this now, but it was the only thing I could do because I had been with him the whole time. And, you know, and seven years later, I keep thinking I should be over this. I should be over this. <laughs> the uh, Chase, Chase in America's Jimmy C stream is very therapeutic. Thank you. Appreciate uh, that. <laughs> I'm actually a trained psychologist. So I the am, fact that, I, that I am. I'm a beer drinker philosopher and, and turn, th uh, turn and that, uh, that, you know, that is a therapist in its own way. You know? I listen, you get your best therapy sessions at, at the end of a bottle Are of you, alcohol. Hey, I used to have this friend, a friend that was, I can't say used to, he's still my friend, but he, we, when we hung out freaking, he was, he was a, a psychology professor, right? Right. And yep. it literally, he literally told me one day because, you know, we sit at the bar and we bounce, we bounce back and forth. But he's like, dude, you are my therapist. <laughs> like, yeah. He's like, I'm a professional therapist. You know, that's what he did. He was a professor at it, freaking. But what? That's what he taught. And freaking, he's like, dude, I don't need to go to a therapist. I got you. I um, <laughs> I literally finished my psychology degree just before Dad got really sick, mm -hmm. and I refused. Point, and this is nothing against psychologists. It's all I ever wanted to do, but I refused point blank. To go and see a psychologist. Everyone said, you should go and talk to someone outside the family, you know. Yeah. And I was sitting there going, oh. I mean, it made sense, but I was sitting there because one part of our degree was clinical practice. So how mm -hmm. you would be a psychologist if Jimmy came into my office and said, I I was sitting there. I went, found three psychologists. I sat there with two of them going, you're not shrinking the shrink. No. And the one I actually ended up going to was an old school friend of mine. And I didn't twig who it was because it was the time of coronavirus when we're all doing, you know, phone. Yeah, yeah phone we just call it, we just call it the roller so that freaking, you know, algorithm. Yeah, oh, sorry, my mistake, yeah. the, the plague. Mm -hmm. And then I see her on Zoom and it's an old school friend of mine. Mm -hmm. And we just laughed, got on with it and yeah. whatever. But, yeah, I was sitting there going, and it's why I've never become a clinical psychologist because Jimmy or Becca would be there, you know, and I'd be sitting there writing notes. They'd be pouring their hearts out and I'd be sitting there going, that's it? Really, Jimmy? That's the <laughs> that's your trauma? <laughs> yeah, Let right. me tell you how bad I've, you know. But um, well, You know what I would tell you today? Next time you get into that shower, you know, take your mind off things, just think about it. Think that your shower head has three different settings. Spray, mm -hmm. pulse, and oh my goodness, don't stop. <laughs> oh, it's going. And if it's the water that, pressure that I've got in. if it's handheld. Exactly. <laughs> exactly, Jimmy. 
Jimmy. It's adjustable. It does not have to be handheld. Although if it is, well, and that's I'm what just saying, is. the handheld ones make uh, water. You know, yeah, water that's the handheld ones. Are like, oh my it. gosh! Don't yeah. stop. Yeah. Okay, I know where Beck is going with it, but Jimmy, <laughs> do I need to or want to know? You know what? No, no, just, no. Just, just you know, let's just say the water flow will make the water flow. Exactly right. So that's what I said. That's the best therapy right there. <laughs> well, actually, Especially the, if best you got therapy, the one that does know, the, the best therapy is getting those it, Instagram if you messages. Got, if, if you got that one that does this, you know, the has the, the uh, kind of like the the uh, the stutter the in it. You know, it's pulsating. Yes, thank you. Freaking yeah, that's the one. That, uh, again, that, Jimmy. Know. No, hang on. Let me think for a sec. Mm -hmm. Do I want to know how Jimmy knows this for a fact? Hey, let's just. It, I'm, I'm is all it about something he's okay. is yeah. it something that he's I'm, read I'm well, online? I'm well trained at water sports, okay? Oh, please so, tell me you're talking about to, water that's all, we have to, that's all we have to say, okay? I'm well trained at water sports. Okay, um, Becca, it was yeah, this, this this ain't Jimmy's first rodeo, let me tell you. <laughs> Becca, uh, it was lovely to meet you and talk to you. Hope to do it again, Jimmy. You're a freak, and we're going to get along just fine. There you go. There you go. Now you know. <laughs> Boom. We're instant friends. Uh, <laughs> hang on. Water sports. You mean water skiing and No, I both. mean water sports. I mean water No. Sports. Oh, the other one. Okay. <laughs> right. I'd better ring the priest and see if it's and a few hours. The fun feeling ones. <laughs> yeah. 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 Wakeboarding. No. Yeah. The, the, yeah, other no the, one. One. the water sports that are played in the bathroom. <laughs> Yeah, the ones that don't have no uh -huh. engines. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the ones that go down the drain. So yeah. exactly. Uh -huh. right. I'm with you there. Mm -hmm. Oh, excuse me. The ones that the ones that drain it. <laughs> hey, Becca, as long as Jimmy's Becca, not needed there? drain I Becca, I am fine with whatever he's into. <laughs> were you there when we was uh talking about the prostate? <laughs> no, uh, my father, speaking of my father, may he rest in peace. Oh, my man. father has a history of prostate problems, and my dad used to oh, always well, joke yeah. when he was going for those exams. God, I hope the doctor's hands are warm <laughs> and small. <laughs> and gentle. Got small fingers. <laughs> I'm just glad uh, I never have. To, I never have to worry about that. I had Kathy um, so riled up, freaking. <laughs> I apologize for. No, actually, I don't. Oh, no, I worries. Just, I apologize. no worries. I regret nothing. Well, it's I all about the good time, man. You know? Yeah. <laughs> look, look, you're going to go make dinner with a smile on your face. That's all that matters. I'm going to go. <laughs> no, I am going to be worried. Actually, I know what I'm going to be doing. It's not going to be dinner. I need to go and have a shower. Oh, water sports. There we go. Oh, yeah. yeah. There we go. Now we're talking. There we go. I, I, How do you spell relief? You, you should, <laughs> Three you sentences. Should. You really should have a little something to eat first because you're going to... No, I probably cause, should. Because uh, you're going to take... Jimmy's speaking gonna... from a wide range of experience. Well, yeah, friend. you're going to... Because you're going to end up needing a nap afterwards. And you need to go, I'm going, going Bob, to... Bob, here I come. <laughs> I'm going to take my sleeping pills and go to bed. You're not going to need them. I was going to say, not going to need those tonight. <laughs> no, oh, no. Oh, Jimmy, we're going to get along just, just brilliantly. <laughs> I see. Mm. Oh, goodness gracious. I did think I wasn't coming up to say hello. Right. Uh -huh. Probably shouldn't have. But, uh, <laughs> I do a lot but of just crap. Think, just think now, and I hear what I'm saying. You're going to be going down with a smile. Uh -huh. <laughs> down, up, and round about, my uh -huh. dear. Why do you bet yourself? Uh -huh. See? Oh. I'm just saying. <laughs> keep an open mind. Wow. And Jimmy's thinking, I used to love my strength. This idiot Australia gets on and it's all downhill. Oh, no, 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 no. It's all good. It's all good. I got, I got a, uh, I think it was about a week ago, I guess I posted, but I got a short on my channel that I posted a picture of. It's just boobs on there and you like a bikini. And then you can see mm -hmm. the belly button. But then, you know, my overlay goes over that one. And it's got the Golden Girls, Dorothy and Stanley on the overlay, right? So you see these huge okay. boobs, right? And mm -hmm. Dorothy, uh, I mean, uh, Stanley sits there and or, uh, Dorothy says something like, you know, what's wrong, Stanley? And he says, I just lost it or something. And, and Dorothy says, you never had it. Okay. <laughs> but if you look at it, I mean, I put my caption up there about the, 
the 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 girls going south. Yeah. <laughs> hey, my girls were my girls only have ever known how to go south because they don't go north even. Well, yeah, but there's there's all kinds of ways. I mean, I left that one open to interpretation because there's all kinds of ways you can go with that. And if you notice, Becky, Jimmy's looking down. If you notice this, or is it just um, me watching? I just I'm just uh, dealing with some stuff. I'm going to throw in the recycle. I mark it. I mark the. You know. Oh, I I thought you were watching the boob bit. No, no, he no. Says he was cleaning out his receipts. Oh, I, was, I was thought he was still <laughs> see if he still got it. Well, <laughs> no, he was watching it. the bird video. We all know this. No, he just no, held no, that up no. so he didn't have to admit I already it. Seen it. I already seen it. Freaking, I watched it. Oh, now. okay. <laughs> yeah, but that was not me in that picture. Well, let's just say, let's just say, Becca, don't, Becca, let's Becca, just Becca. say, you know, I mean. Don't, don't ruin his fantasy, my love. Let him think it was no, you. I, I don't know. I don't think I'd want those. Well, they were pretty big, and they were they were they weren't too far from her belly button. I mean, I had a, know, I had a I had a friend who she, was of Greek origin, and let's just say she didn't have boobs. She had mm. airbags because if she tripped yeah. over, she'd bounce straight back up. That's yeah. all I'm saying. I don't mean to be disrespectful to my great well. friend, but this girl, you could never push. You know, yeah. one of those punch, um, punch, um, what are they called? Those things that you punch and they, I can't think, I know what it is, but I can't rock them sockums or something where you, you know, you knock them down and they bounce back. Yeah, I yeah, swear, yeah. That, rock, I rock. swear that was my friend. If she ever tripped over, she'd oh. bounce straight. Straight back up. All right, Erica. I'm sorry about that. The ads. It's actually yeah. I do get. I do. I've been averaging like two bucks a stream off of that. So yeah, I don't, we don't. Um, I don't understand that, man. Because I'm I'm right there with Miss Erica. I, I mean, I'm on. I don't know if they're you just not them. sitting them or for some reason it's just hitting yours. I, I'm not really understanding. I don't know. But, it happens. What do you mean? On my it's on my stream. I freaking yeah. No, I'm just saying though. When, there's, when, I, when I, I, mean, I don't know if if it's their sentence that they're not doing it that way or that if, yeah. Um, you know, because yeah, I just know. Yeah, I think you a lot of them on it's here. It's my choice. I press the button. Oh, okay. and if that happens. So you turn it on to get the get the yeah. little bit of extra. Yeah, I earn about two dollars a stream from that. Yeah, but I'm just saying I don't know if YouTube um because other people I, might have that turned I no, turn listen it on, to me. Listen to you. me. The I, other people yeah. might have it turned on as well. That for yeah. I don't know, maybe YouTube is more targeting no, no, certain turn, ones. Because I I, I, I know people that have it turned on as well. I think I, Jimmy, I don't get them. In Jimmy's stream, if if I understand this, if Jimmy yeah. turns it on. It yes. will happen on his stream. If I yes. turn it yes. on, it will happen on my stream. Is that yes. right, Jimmy? I, I, yes. Yeah. But, but yes, it, but for some reason, uh, on Jimmy, like on when I'm watching other people's, it might just run one ad during their stream. Oh, you know, oh, see, yeah. But on yeah. Jimmy's, for some reason, it does it. It does it multiple times. So I'm yeah, not well, really sure why. Well, and some people it only does it like once during the stream, and other maybe. people it does it. You know, more than you know. More well, than once, like multiple times. Well, oh, I see. Because you don't, you you set it to turn it on, but you can't set how many times to run them. That's no, what I'm trying to no, say. Not at all. Okay, yeah, that's I'm what I'm trying to say. Some people's it I'm doesn't sorry. run as many, and other people's man, it just runs a ton of them. Well, maybe maybe it's the fact that people on here watch them. You know, that yeah. you never know. Yeah, you because know, if people are watching them, they, it's gonna, you know, it's gonna inspire them to play them more. You know, freaking. Yeah, if, no, if that's clicking, a good point. Jimmy. If everybody's clicking off of them, you know, freaking, you know, we, nobody makes money at that point. You know, right. In, 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 hey there, YKB. Know. How you doing? Yeah, YKB. Oh, plus, plus the fact, um, I don't, I don't know. What do you think about the hours? I mean, we're almost at six hours here. You know, so, could be. They could be targeting yeah. more that are, you know, longer yeah. or um, you know, Jimmy, with a longer more than they. Qu question about the ads. You, um. So when you get the ads on stream, I usually yeah. click yeah. off them as yeah. a general rule. Yeah. So do you, I need to watch the ads in their entirety for you to be paid or can I watch one and click off the rest for you to be I, paid? I, I I have no idea how they actually do that, you know. Right. Um, 
you know, I you know, I was always told you gotta watch the ad entirety to get that Yeah, is, that's you know, my big challenge. But too. if but if you watch one ad, it's it, it's at least you watch one of them. You know, if they run multiples back to back, you know, who has and some yeah. ads you don't have a choice. Uh, they're the ones that yeah. are not skippable. So you have to watch them. Yeah, uh, that's the only I'm ones you can, you know, you can don't they did you have a choice on uh, the ones that are skippable? Yeah, I don't know what Yeah, that's during. what I was wondering, Becca, because the ones that are skippable I'll usually skip to yeah. through, particularly yeah, in the middle of hockey or something. I, yeah, I don't know what kind of ads they, they put in my live show. I don't know if they're skippable or not. Well, you choose. Oh, it's whatever I, you chose on there. No, there, there's no. No, no, no. You can't choose. You could. Yeah. You just choose. To, my yeah, understanding yeah, of it is. Yeah, I just. Oh, I always, I always could choose. I could choose skippable. I could choose um, uh, uh only yeah. ads at the beginning or the end. Yeah, but I that's a choose... setting for your videos. Oh, that's you not know? for your. I, I thought I did it for my like... live streams too. Okay, maybe, maybe for you. I don't know because I have. When on my settings for my videos, I I just clicked them all. Yeah, 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 whatever. You know, oh yeah, I didn't do that. You know, because like yeah. most of my most of my videos aren't long enough for them to run ads in. You know, so I mean, oh, some okay. of them are, but freaking, yeah. you know. Yeah. But, I think I think our um Seattle know. stream has it at the beginning, like because we go eight, nine, ten, eleven hours, and I yeah. think I've only ever seen them at the beginning. I yeah. don't recall. Yeah, or if the, you click out and come back in, they play again. Yeah, but, I mean, yeah. I could probably go into the settings and freaking see what the fuck. But I don't, I can't even remember how to get in there to do all that. Oh, yeah. don't do it. You'll blow yourself up, Jimmy. Oh, oh, what are you kidding me? I got, I got freaking, I got, what do I got? I got seven windows open right now. I'm freaking. Seven amateur. I just counted 14. I've got open. I yeah, can click but, in I this can, one. but I could click in any one of them. Freaking, yeah, so same you know? now. I know how to do it without shutting anything yeah. down. Yeah, anyway, yeah. I am now 45 minutes after telling you I was leaving. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm actually gonna do it now. Yeah, so. we we'll do like that. <laughs> I, oh, no, <laughs> I will tell you three hours before I actually leave your stream that I'm going <laughs> and then stay for another four hours and then yeah. tell you again. But no, it was great meeting you guys. Thank you for having me. And um, yeah, no. Oh, my fun. pleasure. Thanks for coming over, hanging out. It was nice to meet you. Yeah, great to meet you. And um, yeah, do it again sometime for sure. Yeah. Um, Really need to go and have that shower now. Ha ha ha. All right, guys. Take care. Later. Talk soon. All right. Totals, Miss Megan. Ready? Live. Go to the analytics of the live. No, we don't want that. Oh, yeah. Maybe customization. Hmm. They're talking about uh, the animal um, stuff in the chat. Mm hmm. Let, let's see this the thing is let YouTube insert mid roll ads and I and I uh, it's conservative balanced or aggressive and I picked balanced so you know I mean, yeah who knows I, as I said I, I wasn't talking about you know that others don't run them I'm just saying they don't run they don't run as often yeah well they um, probably they probably have it so. on the conservative button. Could be. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, Miss yeah. Megan says, "Thanks for having me. Can't wait for the for oh, the next sorry. one." Yeah, yeah. So there's a conservative setting, so you have lower potential of earning and freaking and less interrupted of viewer experience, and and I have it on balanced, so there's a medium earnings and and a balanced viewer experience. So I don't know. I'll 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 change that to conservative. I mean, no, you don't have to. I was oh, just no, saying I, that I, I understand what I'll, Miss uh, Miss Miss Erica was talking about. Well, yeah, but I um, let's I get I'm getting a lot of feedback from it. And, oh, uh, I see. And, you know, a lot. And like, eh, I don't know, I don't know if it really how much it really bothers people, but you know, saying every I you know, thinking, I've I've definitely heard enough. 
negativity about it, you know. Like, eh. well, I'm just trying to make a dollar, man. That's what I said. I mean, it's not like it. Um, uh, it's not like it's the end of the world or anything. Yeah. It's just, I mean, I guess you uh would call it. Um, I don't know. I guess it's just like anything else you watch, and you got like a commercial. You know, <laughs> you're right into the show, yeah. and then they go to a commercial break. You know, right yeah. when, and it seems like it's always right there at the worst time, or. So it's not that, you know, but without commercials, you know, they wouldn't have the money to, you know, to have the all the shows and yeah. stuff. So, yeah. yeah, I mean, it's it's the same thing. It's just, yeah, I, I mean, I can get it. It's, you know, it's irritating, but I know it's for you, it is, uh, it's worth it. I'm mean, not worth it. Yeah. You're being irritated, but I mean, it's worth the, uh, you need it to continue yeah. on, you know, yeah, I don't, you know to help run helps, your show. You know? Yeah. It's only a couple bucks, but it helps. You know, let's just say, well, yeah, it all money the, helps. It helps pays the cable bill. You know, it helps. You know, it helps. You know, and the super chats, wanna, it all goes, everything I earn there goes right back into YouTube, some way, shape, mm -hmm. or form. You know, they're freaking, you know, because I, I give out a lot of super chats on other panels, you know, and freaking, or, or other streams, I should say. Freaking, I mean, I, I, I buy membership. You know, there's a few channels that I freaking, that I'm a member on very few, but there's a few and I'll buy memberships for people in, you know, the freaking, in other panels, you know, just to oh, trust me. I'm giving my a name light. out there, you know, <laughs> as I said, I mean, I'm giving a lot, but, um, uh, it's just, you know, now, I mean, I, I could get away from it. I could just simply pay for to have YouTube. We have the no ads, mm. but I ain't going to do that. Cause I don't want to spend the money to have no ads. <laughs> Well, that's another thing that freaking that it pays for is me to not have to watch that. <laughs> right, that's what I'm saying. You can you can yeah. do that, but you yeah, know, it's, you know, it's only a couple bucks a month, freaking. And it doesn't come out of my pocket; it comes from YouTube. You know, so mm -hmm. well, that's and that way, there every time I go in the stream, people get paid. You know. Yeah. Every time I watch a monetized video, they get paid for it, you know, without me yeah. having to suffer through fucking ads. <laughs> yeah, I, I ain't watched TV in a long, since I uh, started YouTube, really, freaking. Well, you know, they even have, what is it, what is it called, YouTube TV, too. To my understanding, it, you mean, you get. I mean, you get a lot of like what goes on regular TV. Oh, do you? On YouTube TV. Mm -hmm. mm. I mean, you I get the know. same, uh, a lot of the same, you won't get all of them, I don't think, but a lot of the same networks and stuff. Like even the live shows and stuff. I don't, That's my I, understanding of it. I got to look a little bit more. Somebody I was mean, telling paid, me about I it. I pay for it. I don't, I don't watch it, but I don't, you know. You pay for YouTube TV? I pay for YouTube Premium, which includes it, I believe. Because I get YouTube music for free, so it should be the TV too, right? Uh, I don't know. If, if, if you were paying for it, you're going to pay like $70 a month. Oh, for YouTube TV? Then I'm not paying for it then. Yeah, I think it's like $70 something or um, no. I'm trying to think of what that person told me. No, I pay like 10 or $12 a month for YouTube Oh, TV. no, they, then that's not YouTube TV. Yeah. This literally would replace like right, like TV. Yeah, so. I, hear you. I I hear what you're saying, but I don't know. Freaking, I know I got YouTube Music that comes with YouTube Premium. So, and you know, there's so I, much I stuff you can music. find on YouTube. If you just want to watch movies, there's so many I, movies you can find on YouTube. And it's funny. It's funny. I get because I do the premium. I get to watch a lot of movies for free that are otherwise rented. You know. Mm -hmm. Hard to find them sometimes, but you know, they find me. YouTube knows what I like to watch. Right, <laughs> you know? right. It's taking them a while, but you know, <laughs> they're finally getting good at putting stuff in front of me to freaking that I actually want to watch. You know, so yeah, mine does it uh, for the most part. It's taking a while. <laughs> Miss JCT said she's fading. I'm fading too. It's almost three in the morning. Oh, heck yeah, it is. I didn't even realize that. Yeah, man. Yeah, it is about that time. 
So, well. So I was only staying up. Yeah, I was really only staying up long enough to get that phone call. <laughs> ah. <laughs> um, and then I thought Mr. John maybe would still be in here to come back to sing, but. That would have been great. But yeah, he faded when way back then. He pretty much. That was like the last time I heard from him. Is that is? Oh, Kathy, I'm sorry about Kathy, that. Kathy tried talking him into it, but um, yeah. Well, I hate that he didn't come up here and get to sing me that song. Yeah, it's all right. It's all right. But I'm, I mean, I'll see him again. <laughs> but as Maybe. I said, he might not do the Zoom thing. Yeah, well, you know, I mean, I remember the first time I came up here on Zoom. I mean, it took me a little bit to, to figure out when I how to do it and everything. Mm hmm. Yeah, it's a, it's a little challenging, you know, but freaking. Yeah, uh, but then once you do it once, then, I mean, except for the occasional update that you got to run, um, once you yeah. do it, then, yeah, it's the same thing every time, so. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, you get easy. the hang of it. It's easy. Once now, I've never time. started a Zoom one, you know, I've only come up, like, on yours, and I've been, mm -hmm. you know, I went up on the Zoom ones, like, you know, like at work and stuff, but I've never actually started one. Mm -hmm. JCT sipping the cognac. Ooh, there you go. Good stuff. Got the cotton mouth like a dog. Hate it when that happens. You know, there uh there's that stuff called um oh crap, I'd have to go there and get it, but it's made from the cognac root. Of course, a different kind of cognac, that's what made me think of it. <laughs> uh, but they use it as a thickener. <laughs> like you like you can put it in gravies and stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh, but that's the cognac root. That's not the drink cognac. But it does it taste like the cognac, though. No. no, no. It said it's just a thick. It's just a thickener. Uh, it's a thickener, and it don't have it has zero carbs, so it's not carbs. like using flour or or cornstarch or anything like that. Um, mm. A lot of people that that are like keto or. Um, you know, I really want to watch their blood sugar, mm -hmm. you know, stuff like that. They'll use it. The only thing that I wouldn't purse, I mean, I, I have some and, and I'll use it for certain things, but mm -hmm. I would never, like, if I'm going to make my squirrel gravy, no, I'm oh, not going to use that. Yeah. Or if I'm going to make like regular, like regular gravy, if I'm not making just a teeny bit, like a little sauce or something, if I make it like gravy. No, because it's mm -hmm. got like a like a gel um yeah. texture to it oh i hear you yeah and i you just you just don't want that gel not jelly but gel you know yeah i hear you <laughs> the goo is gooey and blind straight freaking i feel for you man i remember uh the city i grew up in had uh the, the water had floor clo uh, fluoride and chlorine in it that i didn't drink water for a long long time you know, freaking, and then, you know, of course, they started bottling water that you could consume without the fluoride or the chlorine. Yeah, hell yeah. Mm -hmm. Do you ever buy the little drink mixes to put in your water? No, yeah, I used to. I'm not a fan of those uh, fake sugars, so I stopped doing that. Those what? Fake sugar. They have artificial fake sweeteners in them. Oh, fake sugars. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. I, I mean, these are, I mean, I don't know. I guess I'd have to go. It's like, you know, like whatever they put, like in Crystal Light and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, fake sugar. Yeah, except I do get a, um, I get the sugar-free uh, Kool-Aid ones, the little squirty ones. Yeah. Like it comes in little squirt bottles. And now yeah. those actually are pretty good. I don't really taste a difference between, I mean, they... They don't have an aftertaste, or I, I usually get the orange, the grape, the cherry, mm. and the tropical punch. Yeah. And they usually don't have any kind of like that aftertaste or anything like that. Hey there, Park Nest. How you doing? Well, good morning, Parky. Didn't see you slip in there, but yeah, well, what up, dude? Hey, he just came in. Yep. Yeah. Um, we're about to shut it down, too, buddy. <laughs> Did you get your sleep earlier? Yeah, I did. I took like a five hour nap, which was freaking enough to freaking, you know, get me back in it here. I was, I was freaking destroyed. I'd been up all night and freaking, I went to lay down at like nine o'clock this morning. And as soon as I put my 
head on the pillow. The wife says, hey, you got a doctor's appointment at 11. I'm like, yeah, okay. <laughs> better, oh, wow. better, better pour me a coffee. <laughs> <laughs> Did your doctor's appointment go well? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love this guy. He's awesome. So freaking, yeah, we took care of that. He, he fixed my meds up and freaking... We got a game plan to straighten some stuff out, and oh, that's and then, good. That's good when you got a good doctor. Yeah, yeah. and then we uh, we went to freaking lunch. Had a really awesome freaking uh, call it a Texas burger. You know, freaking bacon and barbecue sauce. Freaking it was fucking awesome. Oh, I bet that was good. Yeah, it was. It was well, they did it up right. You know, freaking put they a go nice, thick patty. Put a nice, yeah, yeah, yeah. It freaking you know like. Like freaking two third pound, you know, freaking type of thing, freaking, and and I uh, put a nice char on it too, freaking. So I was like, oh man, it was like it, it was like it tasted like it was cooked on a fucking grill, you know, like probably you know, was. Yeah, I don't know, man. I know they got a griddle back there, but he got he, it just you know freaking tasted it. It tasted like almost like it was on charcoal, you know. Even the bacon had a nice crisp on it. You know? Oh wow! Yeah, Golly, like, now you're making me hungry. Yeah, it, it was. <laughs> it was like ah, uh, and of course the bacon sticking out of the fucking thing. He put whole strips on it. You know. Oh, I love when it sticks uh, out. Yeah, 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 and freaking ah, uh, and, and then and then we went to Wally World, so I got my exercise in. Freaking. You know, YKB says, Jimmy, what you a gardener now? Hello. <laughs> huh? I, I'm not sure. You must have said something that makes him wonder if you're a gardener now. Oh, mm -hmm. I don't know. I mean, uh, we will be growing some stuff, but you know, it ain't gonna be it ain't gonna be in a garden though. It'll be some some pots, you know, like a bucket 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 garden. Cause I ain't. Hey, I ain't, there ain't you know, just the containers. There ain't nothing wrong with yeah. that. Yeah. Well, you know, let's let's just say, yeah, that's the only chance I got this year because it's gonna. I can't, I don't, that part of the yard, the the other part of the yard that is actually be best for planting is uh, there's a tree in the way. So freaking, you know, and eventually that tree is going to come down sometime this summer. So I'm not even going to try and plant anything in that area because it's probably going to be trampled by the tree and the people trying to cut it the fuck down. So. Right. We, we had, we uh, when my daddy here. got, you know, older and he couldn't like bend over, as, it was easy like to weed stuff out and stuff. Yeah. We ended up having old raised beds. And so we took, uh, you know, old bathtubs and we yep. took 55 gallon barrels and cut, you know, cut them in half long ways yeah. or lengthwise yep. and put those and we put them up on pallets, you know, so that he yep. wouldn't have to bend over to weed them. You uh -huh. know, and that's, yeah, then we, they grow all kinds of things in there. He had beautiful oh. garden. Trust me, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, uh, you yeah. know. Oh, he I said, I thought I heard you say you were doing some work in the garden. I got loads to do this year. No, no, not me, man. Freaking some work in the garden. How would that sound? Some work in the garden. Some work in the garden. Yeah, I don't know. I'm trying to think of what you said earlier that might have sounded like that. I, I don't know, freaking. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I got got my walk through Wally Word and got my exercise in. Yeah, you talked about your the doctor and then the yeah. uh, then the going to going out to eat mm -hmm. at the restaurant and the yeah. burger and the oh no, not yeah, who knows? But yeah, and sure. that is true, Miss JCT. Yeah, they gotta have they gotta have the bees come around to pollinate mm -hmm. everything. Fortunately, we have at the end of the pasture down here. Um, We've got a man who raises bees, and so um, they were always really, really good. I mean, we always had them anyway, but when, boy, when those bees came in, mm -hmm. um, it really got really good. <laughs> Watch the shorts, I'm sure. Uh, okay, I guess you made a short. Oh, one of my shorts. Mm -hmm. I don't know the little hearts of it. I can't see. Is that just? I don't know what that's behind the word it short. Says, it says, "Watch the short." I'm sure. Watch the short. Uh, I'm sure. As S U R E. I'm sure. I'm sure. Watch the short. 
I'm sure. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm not following you, Mr. YKB. Yeah, uh -huh. <laughs> was it one of your shorts or freaking, or did you watch one of my shorts when I said that? Are you wearing shorts? <laughs> because that probably might have been an old one, freaking that I, that I said that at. I don't know. Did you Man. drop your shorts? Uh -huh. Oh. Oh. I don't know. I know my yard needs a lot of work before I'm putting a garden in it. That's for sure. Yeah, we've had so much rain here that man, it don't at this time of year, it don't take long and everything just starts shooting up. Mm -hmm. And you can don't have you don't have time in between to mow it because it's too wet. Mm -hmm. You know, you know so. I fucking had to deal with that back home freaking one spring, freaking a uh, year or two back, you know, maybe two or three years back actually. And it was fucking, it drove me ape shit because the fucking dandelions got like three feet fucking tall, you know? <laughs> and, and you know, and then they started seeding. And that's the worst because now all you're doing is seeding the lawn with fucking all the fucking dandelions. Oh, See, fucking I would have loved that because, you know, dandelion root. Um, uh, I, I buy the dandelion root extract mm -hmm. and uh, I take it every single day. And that stuff's like fifty something dollars a bottle. Well, yeah, and it's only gonna lay. It only lasts me like I don't know, like eight days. Well, I don't know how much you get out of that, but or or how much it takes to of the root that you'd actually be, you know, need to get. To, you know, yeah, well, but you can eat the the Danny line. You can eat those. You can put it in salads and. I know, I know, I know. Yeah, I mean, they're just they're, they're just good things. Mm -hmm. I watch a lot of people make like Danny line soap and stuff. Now, if you do mm -hmm. that. Uh, to my understanding, I've never done it, but I think once you process it, I think you have to let it sit or something for like three or six months before it actually is like, you know, good to go. He said, I watched Watch it back. Jack. You slurred. Sure. I'm exhausted. And it sounded like you said, I've been gardening. Oh. 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 Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm a little drunk, dude. So yeah, I'm slurred. You know, I've been <laughs> gardening. I don't know what I was garden. <laughs> yeah, blind straight. Yep, yeah, Danny Lion. It, it's just all good for you. It's definitely it's good a liver detox too. <laughs> I just wish you could go out there and just like. I wish it would be like anything else from the garden. You know, you could just go pick it and just. You know, because you like like the extract. You know, I don't know how they they you know get, I don't know how they squish it all out or what they what they yeah. do to make that. You know, because I'd love yeah. to be able to do that. Yeah, it would be a blind street. Roundup kills all the grass, man. Freaking, no thank you. It kills everything. Freaking, nothing lives under uh, Roundup. So won't be using that. Right. Um, is Miss Doris, is she already in bed and everything? Or oh, she have to work? She's been in bed. I don't know if she's working tomorrow or not, but she's been in bed since about nine o'clock. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I don't know. I've yeah, been having a hard time sleeping, so I'm I'm, I'm kind of, it's like my days and nights are mixed up. Yeah. Yeah, I'm completely freaking um, nocturnal these days. Hopefully I find a way to Hopefully the weather, I get it straightened out by the time the weather breaks and it, uh, there's some spring in the air, but freaking, you know, because like, man, I got too much shit I want to be doing around here. Freaking and that man. is true, uh, Mr. Uh, YKB. Um, he goes, Danny Lions equal pay the bed. Well, that's because what? Danny Lions are a natural, um, like a... Um, I don't want you to call maybe like I don't know if you call it a natural diuretic, but it's a uh, anti-inflammatory. It's a natural oh. anti-inflammatory. So oh. yeah, so it, it it helps make it helps like when you drink the water during the day, like if you mm -hmm. if you uh if you swell or anything like that, it'll yeah. help you get the you get, get your water gallop. off your body. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, that's actually the reason that uh, I drink that I do drink it every day. Um, it's so because it does act as an anti-inflammatory. <laughs> it's just a natural way to do it. Uh huh. Uh, Mr. Parkness, why would a well-dressed what does that say? Lion. The next word. Why? Why would a well-dressed lion pee in your bed? 
I don't know where you got the well dressed lion. Lion. Mm hmm. I've had dandelion tea. I've made my own. Mm hmm. Oh, maybe that's where he's getting the lion. Dandy lion. Oh. Maybe that's where he's getting it. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. I it's good though, you know. Though. It don't it don't taste bad, or mm -hmm. you know, there's some natural stuff that I mean, there's like medicine that you take that always tastes bad, but but even some natural stuff like I tried doing turmeric, like the turmeric extract because it's supposed to be an anti-inflammatory as well. Man, I I can take a lot of things, but that stuff right there, uh uh, I threw that whole bottle in the trash. Mm -hmm. It's funny that we're talking about this because <laughs> this right here <laughs> could do the same thing. Get rid what? of the water. <laughs> oh, is that one of the like uh, like a Lasix? Mm -hmm. Well, see, exactly. but I don't. It's exactly yeah, but what see, it is. Mm -hmm. yeah, well, that's what I would rather have. <laughs> um, but I don't have any health insurance right now. Mm -hmm. I yeah, am, I so. Yeah, so I have to go the natural way, and and this, you know, it it works, mm -hmm. and I mean, it's natural, and it is a it's a natural liver detox, and I mm -hmm. mean, it does it. Danny Lion uh, actually does a whole lot of stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Well, uh, you know, one of the things they like to say is around in 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 over here is all the weeds, all the things we consider weeds, freaking, or or most of the things we consider weeds. Were, were actually grown back in the day for natural remedies, freaking, mm -hmm. you know, a lot freaking, of them. And, and, you know, it's, you know, it's, and it's funny because freaking that's why they're in everybody's yard. It's freaking because, you know, they were grown on purpose. <laughs> and I'm not sure what, uh, what you're talking about, Miss JCT, when you said that you thought that YouTube hated health talk. Mm. There's doctors yeah. and things yeah. all the time that get on here that do, live streams and videos and shorts and everything else talking about you know like yeah. natural things and ways to do things and yeah, mm -hmm. yeah or heck it's, the, it's full of the youtube is full of like weight loss stuff or yeah or you know all that kind of stuff so i'm not really sure mm -hmm. what you're talking about yeah you just have to wait a minute jct you know we can't you know freaking it ain't easy to talk to every comment and whatnot and freaking it's hard to catch up <laughs> YKB says he wants to pick rose hips this year because to me he wants to make some uh, cordial. Well, what's that? I'm not sure. I just know that cordial cherries. I'm not really sure. Um, don't know. Put ginger in your spaghetti sauce. I've never thought about that. Ginger is actually another good anti-inflammatory. But I've never, uh, of course, I don't make a lot of spaghetti sauce because spaghetti sauce has a ton of carbs and it's not good for me. But um, but I've never thought about putting ginger in it. And just don't add the sugar. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. He says it's a rose hip syrup. Oh, okay. That's what cordial is, a syrup. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Hey, I learned something. I'll, I'll have to look that up. Um, I don't know what rose hips are. I've never, um, I've never heard of those. I'll have to say, either if they're called hips? something else here, I or if I just, I think they're actually part of a rose. That's what I said. I'm, I'd have to look that up to see what those are. They're a flower. Hmm. Oh, this says it's a fruit. Or, yeah, okay, it's not a flower. It's just, oh, it looks like a seed. It looks like a berry type thing. Rose hips, here it is. Yeah. Is the accessory fruit of the various species of the rose plants. Huh. What? It says, due to its high levels of antioxidants, rose hip tea may boost your immune system Aid in weight loss, reduce joint pain, support healthy looking skin, and protect against heart disease and type 2 diabetes. Well, I'll be dog. 
Thank you, YKB. I'm going uh, I'm gonna cop I'm gonna copy this so I remember what he said. Yeah, and I'm gonna look into it because everything, no matter what you take, you always have to make sure it doesn't interact with something else, you know, that you're taking or you know, you got you gotta look at all the health and uh you gotta look at the benefits and the downsides of it too. So but I'm gonna look into that. They look like mini mini tomatoes. Yeah, they look like little cherry tomatoes. <laughs> Let's say he said add a mix for water. It's got a 1,000 time more vitamins than carrots. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. Huh. Well, there you go. Well, if you're not going, are you, are you going, are you hanging out or, or what? If if you're hanging, I'll uh, I'll just go pee and come back. If not, oh, really it depends. It just It's just yeah. up to you whenever, you, you know, I can't be up here a whole lot longer, but. But I'm glad I'm glad I did stay because that's kind of a neat thing that Mr. YKB just sat there and saying, "Yeah, yeah, I learned yeah. something that you know that I can not, I can actually use." Yeah, all right, I'll be right back. Oh, the black walnuts, you know, um, Brian Straight. I don't I don't particularly care for the taste of black walnuts. Um, I bought some of them, and I don't know. They just don't have a pleasing taste to me to my palate and so i don't think i would particular I, I wouldn't see anything that i would put them in unless you can suggest something that you know i knew i know they are a little bit more pricey but but i did try them because i wanted to because i did i did want to i did want to use those easy to process top and tail them and mush up and save the juice. I I don't even know if I even have any of those things around here. I said I've never even heard of them. But if they are easy, to, if they're easy to grow, I might actually um, plant some of those in Arkansas. Or um, I don't know. I'll have to look into it. Maybe they have an extract or something you can buy too. I'm always looking for. Um, alternatives to anti-inflammatory stuff. <laughs> Miss Tiffany, <laughs> careful syrup is sticky. Well, I do know that that uh, that Manuka honey that I have now, it it now it's not a it's not a honey that I I mean it's it's wonderful tasting. Okay, don't get me wrong, it is really good tasting. But it's also like 60 something dollars a bottle and these ain't big bottles okay um so i do buy it it comes from new zealand and um i use that if you have like an infection um it helps pull out the infection and it helped me more than anything that the medical doctors had me trying when i burned my legs and so i would mix that with some um allison max which is a garlic tablet and it has to be allison max it's not like the stuff you go to on the walmart and buy um it's not like garlic or something like that but you you put you open up one of those little garlic little tablet thingies and you uh, are capsules and you mix it with that manuka honey and then you put that uh, now don't you put that over your wound and it helps pull out the infection and so because my legs got burned pretty bad um so when I, you know, got caught in, caught in that fire. And so, uh, but yeah, it helped and they're doing a lot better now. So I usually, I just have those bottles around just for like, in case that I get wounds. Cause I do get hurt a lot. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But as far as $60 a bottle and you eat a lot of honey, that's probably not the way to go. <laughs> right. Right. I like honey though. Naturally sweet. Yeah, that's what I said. We have a place down here that's like the, that uh, they have those bees, you know, and they they do the honey. But this, there's something about there's only two places you can find that uh, that Mazuka, uh, Manuka honey. It's New Zealand and another another place, and so it it it's that one. It's that one in particular. Yeah. Mm hmm. Yeah, well, KB, I, I, I agree. 
natural remedies are, you know. So I said the um, natural stuff. I mean, it's been around forever. A lot of doctors don't want to tell you about it, you know. But well, I mean, yeah. and I'm not, you know, I'm not dissing medicine because there's some medicines out there that do wonders. Yeah. You know? Thank you, Kathy. Appreciate that. I love my honey. Uh -huh. It's kind of like the, um, what the aloe vera, you know, if you grow your own aloe vera plants. Right. My daddy, my daddy could grow those things. And he, and mm -hmm. of course, and I loved them, um, especially if you got, you know, if you got like sunburns or stuff like that. But, but then when he passed, I don't know, I don't know what I was doing wrong to that thing. <laughs> and it ended up dying. As I said, I don't, I don't know what I did wrong to it. Mm -hmm. Doris is doing good. She got two spider plants right now mm -hmm. that are like, that are like a year old, over a year old. It's like it's like the first time she's ever not killed a plant. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, she's killed she's killed at least a half a dozen cactus, you know, freaking, and and then some, you know. I mean, she's killed spider plants before too. <laughs> well, there's some plants that I know if you if you overwater them, it's like um, I think on the aloe vera ones, I think what they say is pretty much don't touch it. Like it only requires water, like geez, it's. Yeah. I, I, and I think that might have been my problem. I think I was probably trying to water it too much, you know. Yeah, you gotta let the plant let you know. You gotta let a plant tell you when it needs water. Yeah, it's kind of like the peace yeah. lilies. You know, everybody wants yeah. to overwater those, but you just, I honestly, you just wait till they start drooping. Yeah, well, that's any yeah. plant. Yeah, yeah well, I mean, but these, yeah. these, you can, I mean, you can put you on a schedule, but, but if they droop, I mean, they can still droop for two days and they're going to be okay. As long as you water them right then, yeah. they'll come right back. Um, I just, I had to learn that, you know, you just let it just, I don't know, all of a sudden yeah. one day it's up and the next day it's done almost to the ground <laughs> drooping. <laughs> Olive oil or never water, it's like a cactus. Well, cactus still needs a little water here and there, but you know, freaking, <laughs> you can't totally not water a cactus. They still need it. <laughs> yeah, it's just it's just not very often. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I'm sure she's my wife has killed them in both ways, overwatering and not watering. <laughs> and I never saw my daddy water mm -hmm. these aloe vera. So mm -hmm. as I said, yeah. I never knew exactly. I tried to look it up, you know, and I don't know. I just, I just couldn't, maybe it was because it was his. Maybe I was just not supposed to let it, mm -hmm. you know? Well, you know, it could be that too. Miss Kathy says she's had a lot of aloe vera plants and spider plants. Uh-huh. <laughs> Killed them all. Hey. <laughs> I mean, Spider plants, you pretty much, you know, once you get them going, drinking. <laughs> Mr. Mark, I just saw that. <laughs> well, there's yeah, just some yeah. things that, you know, I guess they just are not meant to be. You know, I made this uh, this dressing like at Thanksgiving. My mama had always made it. My daddy wanted, you know, my mama, she because he, he liked her dressing, right, that she mm -hmm. made. And, you know, of course, she made it ever since I was little. And well, I mean, for years I had made the same dressing. It's just, I, when she got to a certain point, you know, I made the dressing, but I still let her tell me how, you know, so she yeah. could always, yeah. So she'd always feel like she's making it. And so, but I made it for years, right? Well, mm -hmm. um, she died right before Thanksgiving. And um, so everybody said, you know, wanted me to make the dressing, you know, because my daddy wanted her dressing for some reason. I don't know why I said I'd made it for years. But I just could not get that to set up. And I think it was just because it just it just wasn't supposed to that year. You know, since we just lost her. I don't know. Hmm. <laughs> YKB says get rid of the spider legs before you put a bikini on. <laughs> uh. Let's see. Uh Blind straight says an eyedropper once every six months. Hmm. 
He also said loud music kills plants. I don't, I don't play the stuff real loud. And Miss Kathy says, no, Jimmy, she doesn't kill them. <laughs> well, you know, just saying, Kathy. <laughs> loud music kills plants also? No, that's not true. That's not true. Mythbusters prove that. <laughs> I know they say uh, play some music for your plants because they tell mm -hmm. you to talk to them and everything. Mm hmm Actually, I forget what Mythbusters did, but I know they te Mythbusters tested the music. And so I forget. I forget the actual results. I could probably fix it. Look at what I played. Floyd on oh my wife. What on oh my plants? They loved it, right? You know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she said, "I had ten cactus plants." Her brother got mad at her and threw them out her bedroom window. <laughs> uh, well, it wasn't very nice. <laughs> Playing ABBA made my plant schizoid. <laughs> uh huh. Charles the Third talks to plants. Well, yeah, well. <laughs> My mama used to talk to her plants. We have a, a dining room here that, uh, well, they always called it the round room because the front of it's all rounded. It's got like, uh, uh, I don't know, six or eight windows, whatever it is in there. Yeah, yeah, and, the bay window type thing. Yeah, but there's like six or eight of them going across the front. Mm -hmm. And so she had all these plants in there. And I mean, she, it was, it was gorgeous. Then the whole mm -hmm. rain was gorgeous. She she definitely knew how to grow every you know, grow it. <laughs> she never she knew how to grow, you know, grow everything. Mm -hmm. But um, and then I don't remember why. I think when she got some new furniture, the first time she had ever had new furniture in her life, um, when she got that in there, it's got a big old huge dining room table in there. And I don't think there was much room for the plants anymore. Lady knows, bro, we'll catch you. Have a blessed, is it day there now? My KB? Uh, yeah, yeah, it's day. He's going in, he's going to, he's going to school. So, yeah. but yeah, I think I'm going to call it a, call it a stream here. Yeah, I think I'm going to try to get some sleep. Yeah. All righty. Thanks for hanging. It was a, it was an informative learning stream. And it, was <laughs> it was. A good bit of fun too. I know sometimes, you know, we have a lot of fun, but, but you know, it is nice sometimes just like when the chat, you know, tells us things and you learn things and, yeah. you know, a learning stream is always really nice too. Yeah. It's always, that's for, for sure. It's 818 in the AM over there. Uh -huh. <laughs> These don't won't be very long. Yeah. So, all right. Well, toodles y'all. Toodles. Peace out folks. Thanks for hanging everybody. Much love. We will catch you, what the hell is today? Today is Wednesday. We'll catch you tomorrow, tomorrow night. Peace out, brothers, sisters.